Hey, folks. Oh, how are y'all doing? Can you hear me? Hello, hello. Very spooky vibes. Yeah, right, let me let me just see. Can I? Can I get the audio adjusted. Ah. Uh, Hello, hello. Good to have you here. Oh, there we go. You might be able to hear me now. Ah, oh, hello, folks. Hope you're all well. Hope you're all having a good week. Uh, welcome to the big boy stream for this week. We're doing a long one. Uh, it's a new, it's a new release. It's one I'm quite excited for. We're gonna try and see if we can play through the entire game tonight. It's currently uh, half two in the afternoon for me, stateside, and we are going to be going as long as we can to play The Quarry. This is a spiritual successor to Until Dawn. Uh, and if you remember Until Dawn, it is an interactive horror movie where you have to try and save a bunch of kids in a precarious situation. Uh, this is a game in a similar vein to that by the same developers. It's not part of their Dark Pictures anthology, which is like specifically shorter stories uh, that they've been doing. Like kind of like they release them like biannually, annually, like more regularly. This is separate to that. This is more in the vein of Until Dawn from what I've heard, which is great because uh, Until Dawn is way better than the other stories. I'm sorry, Supermassive. It's true. Um, it's the best one by far they've done. <laughs> Uh, and I'm really excited for this. Oh god, but how are y'all doing though? I hope everyone's having a good week. We'll give people like two minutes to hop in the stream and then we're starting. Most recent one is the best one to be honest. I actually haven't played or seen that one. Normally I watch Jeremy do a playthrough of those games and it's like... <laughs> the first two have been kind of shite. But I'm glad to hear that the third one's better. I think they're doing like eight short stories of uh, horror games, which is cool. Gotta appreciate the effort regardless. Uh, I'm so excited for this though. Yeah, so this is gonna be a long boy stream today. We're gonna see if we can get through it all. I've heard it's about eight hours, I wanna say. If it's anything like Until Dawn, that sounds about right. We're gonna see how far we get. Why not play Mario Strikers instead? I mean, I, I was gonna play that later in the week, but between the two, like... Sorry, Mario Strikers, you know? <laughs> play the re-release of that football game that came out on Wii! Or follow up to Until Dawn. Like, the, the answer's clear. Mario doesn't stand a fucking chance. I'll, I'll play Mario a sports game, probably next week or something. But, this is better. This is way better. Go local sports team. How do you feel about having the lives of children at your mercy in quick time reactions? Well, that's the thing. Last time we played Until Dawn, we actually saved every child, which people were fucking blown away by. Somehow we pulled it off. Uh, and I, I always try to, like, in the, this kind of game, to get the good ending. Like, it's my- like, we did it with Detroit Become Human as well. Where, like, we tried to save everyone, I think by that one guy we shot in the face. <laughs> Except for him, we did a pretty good job. We're gonna be trying to do that again. Follow Kevin's lead, kill them all- Ah, oh, but it's overdone! Like, yeah, let me pick every bad option. Let me just, like, do the fuck face run. Everyone does the fuck face run. I want to try to get the good ending. I want to try, actually try. You could watch the fuck face run elsewhere. This is, this is the serious game remote run. Sweaty try hard mode. We have to persevere. Alright, we- uh, look, you're talking to someone who even playing Minecraft story mode tried to get the good ending. I don't wanna just do, uh, like, this, uh, you know, I don't- I don't wanna just do that. No, I wanna actually try. <laughs> I 
Uh, Lick, thank you for the five gift subs. JF, thank you for a thousand bits. Thank you very much, guys. You're all good. There's a bad end in the Minecraft. Well, story mode, apparently. Uh, we, we could have got some stuff way worse. I don't, I don't even know how true that is. I feel that game was awful. <laughs> I'm not like the other streamers. <laughs> no, listen, like, we tr like, David Cage like games. We're gonna, we're in it until the end to try save these kids, okay? We did it with Until Dawn, we have to try do it here. Unless one of them's like a real bitch. We, we should try save him. Came close to shooting Emily in Until Dawn. Like, well, that's one of those, like, fucking awful. We should probably save these kids. Okay. We're gonna get started. Let me, let me gear this on up. Main capture. Alright. Have you guys been able to hear the background audio okay? It's gonna be a bit loud. Because this is a cinematic kind of movie game. So it's gonna be louder than normal. Audio-wise. We will test this very quickly. Okay? New game. Oh. Wait. Good God, what has that done? Hello? Hang on. You guys, you guys can't... Game's crash. Okay. So, so, Alright, something's gone wrong. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's not a good sign. <laughs> oh, no, that, oh. Oh, I got a uh, feeling of dread in me now. All right, let's, uh, let's boot that up again. Off to a good start. I don't know what happened there. <laughs> Let me make sure that's displaying correctly. It changed the res resolution suddenly when I actually started the game, and then it just died. Okay, let's try this again. Mario heard you shit talk in his franchise. <laughs> you gonna diss Mario Sports? You not playing like Super Mario Strikers with like? 50% of the character roster of the original Wii version? This is my turf. This is Nintendo Town. Okay, new game. Okay, it didn't break this time. There we go. We're playing with streamer mode as well. That means all the, the licensed music has been replaced with uh, Kevin McLeod royalty free. I woke up to an we probably have actual actors in this too, which is always kind of wild. Uh, something I didn't realize, yeah, like people pointed it out when we were playing Until Dawn before. Like, uh, like, was it Rami Malek? He's just in that. Like, he's huge now. like actual actors in these games which is wild going for the quad I hope this isn't licensed <laughs> Justice Smith that is that am I thinking the right guy no I don't think I am Is that the Detective Pikachu guy? Or is that a different smidge? It is. Okay. We're gonna get Ryan Reynolds to help solve the case and save these kids. They actual actors. Fly. 
Detective Pikachu is on the case. I can't do a Ryan Reynolds impression. I'm sorry. Why'd you kill the music? I think you know why. Um, I don't think I do. We'll get Beginning with an L? Soon. Like the L word? Lesbians? Lost, Max. We're the lost. L? We're, just, we're in geographic flux. <laughs> right, so. Lost. That's debatable. Don't mention the gays! Whoa! <laughs> Wait, what the fuck is this? Take this hip one? Take a moment to consider the following, as it will guide you through the various what is twists this? and turns that may appear during your stay at Hackett's Quarry. What you see here are quick time events, or QCPs, which will help you to act at just the right time. You probably shouldn't be cheering this. Watch your step. Hackett's Quarry can be a dangerous place if you're not paying attention to your surroundings. Take your eye off the ball, and it could spell disaster. A child has already been slain. The red is yours to choose, but that doesn't mean there won't be obstacles along the way. It's the Gators. The Gators did it. Oh, heads up! Up, uh, wait, wait. Oh, that's a yeah, thumbstick honey, movement. Yeah, nice catch. <laughs> Thank you. We just saved the child. Man, the roads are definitely getting worse out here. I guess it's all part of the rustic summer camp Vent the experience. Dash. Oh, right, that's where we're going. I lost track like 200 miles ago. 200 miles ago, huh? Let me just see. Okay, can I get subtitles? I want. I want to just quickly check. Subtitles. On. Not preview. Okay, make the middle. There we go. You know what, Max? It's okay. It doesn't make you any less of a man. You know, if Columbus hadn't gone lost and landed on these golden shores, those might be too big. <laughs> They're taking up a lot of space. Hang on. Normal. <laughs> Worse, there would be no United States of America. Bit better. <laughs> Bit better. Goodbye, hot dogs. See you later, apple pie. Columbus never actually landed in North America. What are you talking about? Didn't even know he wasn't in Asia. Are you serious? Hang on. I'm just curious. Just another guy who didn't want to admit he was lost. Well, yeah, that's that's definitely too big. All right, hang on. That's a <laughs> go back to normal. Just another guy who's got a whole day named after him. So. Put that in your pipe and smoke it. Oh my god. Okay, just get us to camp already before I roll my eyes out of my head, please. <laughs> I'm working on it. I'm working on it. Let's not die. Performance-wise, is it okay? Wait, pick leaf, flip, pick map. Uh, let's take the map. Uh, voila. What is that? Yeah, yeah. No, but seriously, what happened to the, the normal map? This is the normal map. The one on the phone. No bars. Wait, geez, we don't want to have like Google Maps. All oh, these kids are dead. Let's see, so we are. Well, I guess they don't put summer camps on maps. Have you seen any signs for it? Hey, eyes on the road. Oh. oh. Why was he looking down so long? Why? What? Why? He was looking away for like. Oh, oh, oh Jesus! Dude! What are you doing? Yeah, I mean, still in one piece. Jesus Christ, what do you think that was? A bear? What? No, no, Max, it wasn't a bear. What was it? I think it was a person. Uh-oh. Lou, are you serious? Do you think we hit a person? Oh, I don't think we hit him. No. <laughs> I mean, it was really cl close, like really close, but maybe we didn't. Oh, 
I don't like this one bit. What is it? I really have this car up. Oh, he's fucked. Well, maybe it looks worse than it is. Uh, I should check out the damage before we try to start it up again, huh? Could you grab my, uh, the, the toolbox from the trunk? Yeah, yeah, okay. Oh, it's not gonna- you don't get out of the car. Don't get out of the car. You're in the middle of the woods. This is how these kids are gonna die. Okay, use left stick to walk. It's Who's not gone so bad. Here? My mom's gonna kill me. Don't worry, the monsters will kill you first. <laughs> Just don't say anything! <laughs> Yeah, yeah, you're you're not gonna last long here. Tutorial unlocked interrupts. Press left bumper to view. What's an interrupt? Wait, there's combat. What? At certain times throughout the night, opportunities will present themselves, giving you the chance to take matters into your own hands. Oh no, the chicken! <laughs> It is worth noting that they are only suggestions. You don't have to act upon them. <laughs> In fact, sometimes it's better not to. Should I let the chicken die? Now you will. Like, don't breed evidence, Pat chose. I don't like the combat one. That's kind of menacing. Alright, let's get what's in the boot. Snoop. Well, no, I was just looking for the tools. Why are you reading the letter? It's been rejected from you. Like, we shouldn't be reading this. Why didn't you tell me? We just need the toolbox. <laughs> Don't go through his mail. Yeah. Do you need a hand? Yeah, actually, if you could just shine a light. Need a hand? Here. With college applications? Here you go. Perfect, thank you. The sooner we get out of here, the better. Just picture yourself curling up. Oh, you're doing a great job fixing that cat. Fire pit you could be a tradesman. Singalongs. I don't think people curl up right in front of big old fire pits. Actually, nothing not? wrong with being a tradesman, uh, honestly. The pay is probably fire. better than most stuff you get a degree for these days. <laughs> well, anywhere's better than here. Anything's better than here. What's this over here? Oh, I don't like that. You totally saw that. Like, <laughs> there's no way you didn't. Where are you going? Just over here. Just stay there for a second, okay? I'm almost done. You should really stick together. Defiant, are you my bo- No, no, you're sticking together, kids. All right, I'm not letting you die. God, Max, hurry up! What's going on? I'm worried that there's somebody down there. Are you serious? I don't think you were the I didn't think we actually hit anyone. Well, I don't know, I just- I heard something, okay? Like a, a woman. Do you think we hit her? I just want to check it out. It's okay. clearly a ghost. Right. Like, like, just don't go too far, okay? Be yeah, careful. Yeah. St no, stick together. Oh, I hate this. Why are you going further into the woods? <laughs> Hang on, Max. I what think there's a Charizard down here on Pokemon Go. I need this one. <laughs> I'll be right back once I catch him. The fool. Ah, oh, this sounds right, about right. The fool. The fool. I wonder who this is. We all know a fool when we see one, don't we? Innocence and freedom, or recklessness and risk taking, spontaneity, actions that thought and the consequences to match. Think, think, and don't get burnt. There's 22 tarot cards. Is that? 
How many tarot cards are in the deck? It's not 22, is it? I thought it was like 13 or something. There's a lot. Oh, there is 22. Okay. I don't know my tarot cards that well. I did get my um, my fortune told once with uh, tarot cards, and I got the death card. <laughs> so, uh, wish me luck, Kang. <laughs> I might not have long left. Oh, I hate this. Like, uh, I've had nightmares where I'm just lost in the woods like this. No joke. What's this here? Fortune teller poster. This is a poster for a traveling sideshow. It looks like it's been here a while. Left forgotten in the woods. Are those burn marks around the edges? Everything's burnt for some reason. I, I hate it already. <laughs> I don't handle horror games well, for those uh, who didn't know. Audio-wise now, I want to do one final check. Is it okay? It's not too loud. It's not too quiet. Performance-wise, is it okay? I'm streaming on a new PC. I'm just a little unfamiliar with it. I just want to make sure. It's all good. It's all good. Cool. Thank you, guys. Okay. The subtitles are too small. The subtitles are fine. I'm not making them bigger. <laughs> it's very dark. I mean, it's supposed to be. Oh, God. Okay, which, which path on the road are we taking? Left or right? It's a little bit loud. It's supposed to be loud. It's supposed to be a bit louder than normal. Go left. Okay, it's a dead end. It's a, we're all right. In here. Don't be like another raccoon or something. Escapeology trunk. Trunk filled with strange devices, that of an escape all just perhaps a relic of a traveling show that must have passed through the area. Handcuffs. Can't take them. No use for them. I keep thinking I'm hearing stuff walking around me, but it's just the soundtrack. like some kind of travel and show, but why would they be playing Pokemon Go out here? Silence. <laughs> oh, I didn't like that. <laughs> uh, why is she going off on her own this far into the woods? Like, never mind the monsters. Like, what if just a bear attacks you? <laughs> like, honestly. I can hear, like, a... Like, you need to go back, Laura. Why are you going further in? I guess I'll bumble through here. Fair warning as well, this is the kind of game where we might have a jump scare. So brace yourselves. Like, why is she this far in the woods by herself? Oh no.
<laughs> you need to get out of there, Lord. Where are you? The Charizard, it's closer. I can see it on my mobile device. You gotta go. Oh, get ready for quick time events. She's gonna trip over some shit. <laughs> no! <laughs> okay, they gave, they gave us ample time for that one. It doesn't tell you the direction until quite late. Noises all around oh, me. Look, honey, honey, take a breath. It's okay. It's the woods. There's a lot of stuff out there. We're not alone, Max. To freak yourself out. No. Team Instinct is out here too. Can we just leave? They've taken yeah, over yeah, the yeah, Pokemon gym. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> Thank God yes, they're back in the we fucking go. car. Burn like a kid. Max, come on. Here we go. Here we go. We're getting out of here. Oh, the game's lagging. <laughs> We're okay. Max! I just okay, give me a minute. Give me a minute. We've I think got it's to desync, go. has it? Right Can you just I am trying to get us out of here. Alright, just... enough! Shit, I'm sorry. <laughs> it's like a... I'm sorry. It's okay, it's okay. Can I resync it? <laughs> it's tough. <laughs> uh oh. Man, I can't, I can't. We're okay. We're safe in the car, really. We're gonna be okay. Oh! Oh! Fuck! Oh my god, my heart just exploded. Who are you? Roll it down. Hi, officer. How are you doing this evening? Are either of you injured? Really, we're fine. We're just a little shaken up. Scaring the shit out of why? Why would he do that? <laughs> well, you folks want to tell me what happened here? Pat chosen new tutorial. Oh god. Hackett's quarry is full of twists and turns, unknown paths and unexplored wonders. A rabbit. With each step taken, you tread a path of your own, matched with its very own consequences. Oh <laughs> my! Moments throughout your stay that show you that the choices you've made, the path you've chosen, could have gone another way. It's okay. <laughs> At Hackett's quarry, there's no such thing as <laughs> the wrong Christ. way. Jesus Christ! She just but got crushed. <laughs> Some paths are more dangerous than others. Okay, alright. Do we be honest to the officer? Tell him that we're playing Pokemon out here. Or do we lie as like, oh, I just uh, want to get a closer look at the scenery. Uh, took the wrong turn on the road. It's like true the barrier. Something jumped out. Okay, let's try. Be honest. See how it goes. We, um, uh, something jumped out right in front of the car and we didn't want to hit it, so we swerved and now here we are. Something jumped out. It's a very intense camera perspective. I think he jumped out. Ah, uh, it was dark. Uh, I'm sorry, it was, just, it was so dark, and it happened so fast, and they were gone. I don't know. They? Ma'am, did you hit someone? No, no, God, no, of course not. You know, I mean, I don't think so. I don't, I don't know. Sir? Pat chosen. Uh-oh. Keep the car running. Cop Sir? seems anxious. Is this kind of like... The all-time scariest cop. 
I don't know. This is my first cop. What, like ever? Uh, yeah, I'm not a criminal. It's okay, officer. They were on team instincts. <laughs> What, what, what's the yellow one? Tell me, just what in the hell you are doing That's instinct, isn't all it? the way out here this late at night? <laughs> no idea. I gotta stop the Pokemon Go references. It is the yellow one. Yeah, no one picks it. Team Mystic's the one. You go blue. You go blue. Team Valorant gang. <laughs> We're just taking in the sights. Where is she looking? <laughs> The eyes have gone into the back of my head. And <laughs> she's on some. <laughs> they we're heading to camp. We're heading up to Hackett's Quarry Summer Camp. We're new counselors. You're one night early. No, no, we know. Um, but we figured we'd get in early and scope it out. You know, I mean, they know we're coming. We called ahead. And to be honest, sir, one of us kind of oversold their navigation skills and got us completely lost. So scary. You're not gonna make it to Haggett's quarry. Not tonight. What? Harbinger Motel. Oh, the I place you can bunk up there for the night. Okay. Wait, why has he got uh, blood on him? I think we're just gonna stick to the plan, sir. I mean, Mr. Hackett knows we're coming, and we called ahead. No, ma'am, you're gonna head to the Harbinger Motel. Do you understand? What? Well, he's got blood on him. He's <laughs> he's had a real bad shave this morning. Uh, just say compliant and didn't just go to the quarry anyway, honestly. <laughs> okay, fine. Yeah, we'll head to the motel. Understood. Just lie? <laughs> uh, there's just one small problem. Uh, I forgot to spring for the middle of nowhere coverage plan on my phone. What he means is we're lost completely. All right, ma'am. Step out of the vehicle. Wait, what? Um, I just want to show you how to get to the motel on your map there. Okay. Oh, I don't trust him. For sure. Son, remain in the vehicle. I... It's okay. It's okay. Okay. Oh, I do not trust him at all. Okay. So, we... <laughs> what is that so right about <laughs> here. Harbinger Motel is here. Right, okay, and where was Hackett's quarry again? Well, I'm sure the fine folks at the Harbinger Motel can guide you there first thing in the morning. He really wants us to go to that motel. <laughs> There's a poker stop there also. <laughs> Harbinger Motel. Stay on the road. Wait, but, but what if there's someone out there? Yeah, I'll have a look. Good night. Oh, I hate him. So suspicious. Why why does he have blood on him? Like once he spotted that detail, it's like that, that like, that's not good. Maybe he did just cut himself shaving, but you don't you don't leave dried on blood on your face. Why is this guy just sitting there? God, 
guy was weird. God, he's giving me major weirdo The vibes. dude needed like at least a dozen showers. Oh my god, I know. What was up with the thing? I Did you see was, that? Was it blood? Okay, at least they still have the blood. Meet you. Let's get back on the road. Yes. I think I've had enough woodland encounters for one night. Thank you very much. Agreed. So where's this motel? Okay, so we're here, mm -hmm. and the motel is here. Okay. But we're going here. What's the merry way? Hackett's quarry. How'd you do that? I don't know. I kind of tricked him into showing me. <laughs> very slick. Are you sure we shouldn't just get to the motel and just listen to this guy's advice? Honey, you really want to listen to the advice of some creep ass cop who told us in the middle of the creep ass Oh, I think these kids might be dead either way. <laughs> no, that sounds terrible. Yeah. Let's hit the road, shall we? That's what I thought. Ma'am. Oh my god. If he called me ma'am one more time, I was going to shove that badge up his dick hole. <laughs> Seriously, do I look like a ma'am to you? I got like 20 years before I'm a ma'am. Mm hmm. What? I. 20s. Wait, wait. Debatable. Easy. I mean, I'm kind of into ma'ams. Well, okay, we're done here. <laughs> Where's this conversation going, Max? <laughs> we, we didn't need to learn this in the middle of the night. <laughs> He's into milfs. <laughs> oh, jeez. You gotta be kidding me. There's nobody here. We drive all the way the fuck out Max, here. Max, can we just look <laughs> just, around before we jump to the a little too much information, you to Mr. Hackett, or did you just leave a message? Well, what's the difference? This. This is the difference. Hello? I guess he doesn't check his voicemail. How was I supposed to okay, know Yeah, we made it to the camp. I mean, clearly there's somebody here. Yeah, or it's just an abandoned car, and this is a complete waste Why of time. Why would there be an abandoned... I'll take the car. Max. Let's split up again. Max, don't In the be a dark dick. of the I'm night. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It's like they they keep splitting up. Like this is uh, This isn't fucking Scooby Doo. It's, it's much more violent. Let's just wander into the darkness here. I, I can't see shit. I don't, I don't like this camera angle. Okay, someone made a nice cu cu cup of cocoa. Want to turn on like a light or something? The light's on there. Is anybody home? The door open? Is the ending over here? Are we gonna are we really gonna like break open a window to get in here? These kids are not gonna survive long. They're they're splitting up too much. Mr. Owl, please. I can't see for shit. <laughs> it's it's so dark. Raul that wants to help. Oh, there's another Pokemon out here. Sweet. Gonna be a raid battle at this house soon. Let's see how he's doing in the car. Is he even here? No, he's at the other car. You literally just sitting here. Lord, there's no one here. Come on. Just give me one more minute, okay? 
He's giving up. I don't like this at all. Dude, I, you're just a danger of wild animals doing this. Is this a cellar? Why would you go in here? Why would you? Hey! Hey, are you okay? Uh oh. I'll be right back. I'm gonna get some help. I don't Max. think they need help. Max, I think you're the one who's gonna need it. There's somebody in the bunker. I think they might be stuck. Stuck? Is it Mr. Hackett? I, I don't know. Just bring some tools so we can break the lock. Don't do it. No. Hey, this I'm is back. how you unleash the demon. I'm gonna get you out of there. Hey. hey. Wait, what, what are these? I don't know. You just said tools. Why did you you just brought think? a wrench. Come on, man. Look, there's someone in there. <laughs> Like, what? No, look. I'm looking, I am. Let me see. They just need to go home. Stop putting your eye to it. There there was definitely someone there. Okay. Okay. So Oh, could you do the isn't there a trick for like two wrenches to break a lock? Should I just take the hammer so I don't break it? <laughs> I don't want to get in there, so I'm just gonna take the hammer. <laughs> I don't want to. Yeah, I don't want to do it. Take the hammer. Hammer time. You sure? It's gonna be super loud. Oh, uh, okay. Right. No, we need to not make the noise. I don't, I don't want to make the noise. Yeah, okay, the wrenches. Yeah, okay. Wrenches. Yeah, you actually had the right idea with these. Here we go. Damn. <laughs> you need a hand? Yeah. Oh, I don't like this. <laughs> Like, just, just hit the road, gang. Just keep going. You've seen the Evil Dead, right? <laughs> Why would you? This reminds me of that horror film. Hello? Have you seen the Blair Witch Project? Wouldn't it be hurt? spooky if we just went missing? Hey. There's a ghastly down here, Max! <laughs> I can sense it. Oh, that's... Ian? No, we should just- we should just leave. <laughs> we should just- <laughs> We need to run. I don't think we have a choice. I hate it here. What happens if I just walk away? What are you doing? I'm just... You know, I'm scoping it out. Max is terrified. <laughs> like, this is not good. This is not a good idea. This is not a good idea. This is not a good idea. It's literally covered in blood. 
bloodied cow looks to be too big for a dog. What kind of dog would we call it? Ian, anyway. Okay, so it's like a person or something. I don't want to meet Ian. No, you need to go. Max? You really need to go. Ian is pissed. Which way was back? Hun, maybe it was a possum or something. No, there was there was someone here, I sw swear. Just leave. Hey. Just get out. It's been kind of a night, you know? Let's just get to the motel. We can come back here first thing in the morning. We can check everything out, but... I mean, you must be exhausted. I know I am. I think our imagination... <laughs> oh, jeez! Max! We already lost him. You need to go. You need to go. I think I'm leaving alive. Just leave. Oh, shit. <laughs> oh, I can't just. Do I just abandon him? No, you gotta help. <laughs> Pat chose him. Come on, Max, give us a hand here. No! Oh, no. no! What the fuck? No. Does this look like the goddamn Harbinger Motel to you? He's, oh no, he's really pissed. Every little movement, every little thing you do. But why did Did he just kill Max and he shoot the other thing? Where's Laura? The world is just sedated. What has happened? Why have we got salsa music? <laughs> I don't think we could have saved those kids. Welcome to the quarry. Okay, so I don't think we could have saved Max. I think Max was done for. I think that was scripted. Laura's been, like, drugged. Which is not great. I don't think police officers are supposed to have that. I don't think there's any way I could have saved him. What's going on here? Hello, my friend. Welcome to the show. How's it going? We are friends, aren't we? I've waited for you. I've waited. Yes. So I do hope our time together proves enlightening. This camera is uncomfortably close, Steve. There's no need to worry. I'm here to help you. Think of me as your guide into the unknown. It's exciting, yes, and terrifying. But if you're brave enough, if you let me help you, I can help you. 
I'm not we very brave, ma'am. Yeah, have you seen any Pokemon out here? This is the card you found. <laughs> the fool. I wonder who this is. We all know a fool when we see one, don't we? Innocence is and looking freedom. at me. All recklessness and risk taking, spontaneity, actions without thought, but the consequences to match. Think. Think. And don't get burnt. Oh, not off to a good start there. Max is already you gone. More if you'd like me to. Uh, let's see more. Sure. This is what might come to pass. A possible future. A path yet unchosen. Look here. Look here. Oh. this the, there the are car is on fire there, you know secrets and lies paths to uncover on which I can shed light if you let me help me help you and remember what doesn't kill you will make you stronger well, actually, it might significantly impact my health and make me physically weaker. I don't know if that saying is true these days. Kelly Clarkson? What? Chapter 1, The Quarry! <laughs> what is this music? Yeah! I'm so excited, are you? Summer vacation. It's spring break time. Join our lovable cast of characters as school's out for summer. What crazy hijinks are they gonna get up to? How many Pokemon are they gonna find? Well, there they go. Peace and love. See you later, kids. Yeah, Hackett's Quarry forever. I know his voice. Where's he from? You know how many hearts are broken on the last day of summer camp? It's like a romance apocalypse. Cynical, they'll get over it. Reflective, you never know. Hmm. I mean, you never know. The universe has a kind of way of uh, working these things out. The universe? Yeah, like the uh, the cosmic space gods. Space gods. You heard me. What? Okay, spell it. <laughs> Nothing to spell. You know, we're cool. Oh, so cool. We are super cool. <gasps> These kids are just in so this house. Us, huh? <laughs> Is there anyone called Ian here? <laughs> okay, quit it. Hi, Emma. Hey. Okay, this is, um, you've heard of spatial awareness before, yeah. right? Spatial awareness is for nerds. Uh, be lemon and grab out of bags, will you? Yes, boss. Say hi to Emma for me. You're a bad person. Yes, I am. What's going on? Okay, who, who are we playing as? Can we see? This is Jacob. There's an evidence tab. It's clues. Got two of nine of the clues. Paths. Love at first fright. You, your pat. Above the law. Oh, they're on like old videotapes. This is like, like the goddamn Har Harbinger Motel. <laughs> the video nasty? <laughs> I mean, that's quite cool aesthetically. So, like, what? Uh, view my pat? Laura tried to help Max after he was attacked in the storm shelter. But I, the, I, I don't get to see the consequence of that. I'm assuming this is working like the butterfly effect from Until Dawn. So that's how you can go back and see some of your choices. Evidence. 
Jacob Camp. Abigail's out here on her own. Bow tree that stands tall in the middle of the camp symbolizes the growth of all our campus at Hackett's Quarry and their journey into Blossom and Hacketeers. Well, it's the central hub of Hackett's Quarry Summer Camp. The lodge, the, the lodge is where campers congregate for meals, lessons, and indoor activities. Also home to our nurses' station, just in case of any unlikely bumps and bruises. There's, there's, there's no E in here, so we have to keep we'll keep an eye out for him. There's the tarot cards as well. There's 22 of those to collect. There's no Silas either, yeah. Jake, bags, focus. I'm sorry, man. I'm, I'm trying to get him. I'm... <sighs> Jacob, go upstairs. Jacob, get bag. Caitlin moves on with her goddamn life. Oh, she wants me to get a bag and not just like... I, I thought we were unpacking. Can I go in here? I didn't have to be like a dick about it. Hey, uh, do you know anything about that like bolted shut door? According to reports from the local paper, the North <clears throat> some hay bales caught fire during the opening. Hey, what do you uh what do you listen to? Before they knew it, the whole place was up in smoke. <laughs> Good to know. Awesome interaction. It's like, yeah, just fuck off, buddy. That's not bolted anymore. The fire? Oh no, no, not again. <laughs> Hello? Please talk to me. Whatever, man. <laughs> He's so done. Ryan Reynolds Pikachu in the basement. <laughs> Right, yeah, right. Ryan's not looking too good. He's missing Pikachu. Oh, uh, what, what you listening to, man? They gotta catch them all! <laughs> Pokemon. Jesus Christ. Hey, hey, are you guys gonna help with the bags or what? Oh, um... You know, I was actually just working on fixing uh, the door. It's Dylan, come it's on. broken. Dylan, please. I can't. It's, it's... I gotta get the last bags What's in there. Come wrong on. with this thing? It's just Dylan, please. Why are they all being jerks oh, to this guy? <laughs> cool. Thanks, guys. Gotta go in the window. Can't go in that window. I think that, that house was there before, wasn't it? I think so. What a bunch of jerks. Hackett's Quarry Summer Camp. Established 1953. Clue discovered. Way back in 1953, it's still going strong today, nearly 70 years on. It's a clue, apparently. No way to turn off the blur. Hang on. Uh, settings, graphics. Is it depth of field? Is that the one I want to turn off? <laughs> well, you can't get rid of it. Oh, I, I accidentally hit... Hang on. It's something else there. Okay. Let's just do that then. Uh, display... No, that's just brightness. Okay. Maybe that'll make it a bit more bearable. It's got like some motion blur going oh, on. Who would want to leave a place like this? It's like a goddamn Bob Ross. So peaceful. I think Bob would have been a bit spooked here, I'll be honest with you. <laughs> Ray
break on into our home. Oh, skill. Okay, what we what we got? Any Ugh. spooky foreshadowing Horror. books? Yeah, that'll do it. <laughs> that'll do it. Look at this peaceful home. Paper is just tossed everywhere. Uh, where did the, where did she say the bags were? There's a bear. Are they upstairs? Upstairs. How's it going, Fred? Okay, really, dude? Locking me out? Okay, in my defense, A, it was Dylan's idea, and two, it was really funny. Oh, yeah, right. Is that is that right? I don't know <laughs> the rules, man. <laughs> You're an okay, asshole. Whatever, look, are you can tell me what the bags are what? Nah, I gotta stay here and wait for Mr. H to return our cell phone. Sorry. Jesus Christ. Okay, and why are the stairs blocked? Well, apparently it's to keep raccoons and other pesky varmints from ransacking the place. Uh, Mr. H's words, not mine. Oh! Boring! <laughs> Let me just go on up. I, why? Like, did, is there a light switch? <laughs> I'm staring in the fucking space. How is it this dark in here? <laughs> That's intense. Is that you, Dylan? I can only deal with one shit at a time, Jacob. <laughs> what does this guy do? Why does everyone hate him? Okay, here, we, we have to turn up the brightness somewhat. Like, just a little. Just a little. Okay, there we go. Yeah, we can act we actually kind of... We, it's not much better. <laughs> Let's see a little bit. Everyone hates this kid, yeah. Walk into the void here. It's not blocked to keep the raccoons out, it's blocked to keep the void in. There's another set of stairs over here. Let's go around here. Jesus Christ. Well, the bags are just here. All right. Bring them home. Overkill much of the block here. I don't even know how that's going to stop a raccoon. Like, they'll just climb over that. All right. Got the bags. Great. All by yourself, huh? Yep. Guess you're gonna have to get used to that. Oh my god, you are so mean. <laughs> At least I'm honest. Oh, okay, here we go. Okay, you're not telling me the whole truth about you and Emma, are you, son? Mind your own business. What about you? I... What's going on? He, he, he... Jacob looks like he's on something, too. He, he's not contemplating this question too well. Oh, okay. So now I'm the one who's not telling the whole story, huh? <laughs> oh, well, this is the bait I just got to take, Jake. Oh. oh, sorry. I just got so distracted about that rhyme. I forgot what we oh, were. Oh, no, 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 no. Uh, you, you were telling me how you totally have a thing for Ryan. Wait, are we talking about Ryan, the sailing instructor with the sexy brooding loner thing that totally doesn't do anything for me at all? Mischievous sex of what? <laughs> what are these options? I don't care about these kids' relationships at all. I just want to make sure they're not fucking, like, murdered with an axe in the middle of the night. <laughs> that smile! 
That's a big smile. <laughs> Can we see that in slow motion form one more time? Hang on. Give him a mo because it reset. Here it comes. <laughs> I knew it. <laughs> knew it. Who said I was hiding that? I'm not. I'm just saying, you know, I feel like if you really did like the guy, you would have made a move by now. <laughs> so she really just dumped her ass, huh? I don't... Okay. Her whole thing is like, how are we going to make this work? Different schools, blah, blah, blah. My whole thing is like, you know, maybe long distance, blah, 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 blah. And she was just like, Jacob. She gave you the look, <laughs> huh? Yes. Yeah, do not pass go. Man, she has got you wrapped all the way around that dainty little finger of hers. How does she do it? Defeated, maybe I like it. Or brave, it's just a fling. What? I don't know anything about these guys' it's like relationship. And I don't want, like, in the middle of the night when the axe murderer is chasing us, it's like, Jacob, you said we were just a fling? After seven months? Where is he looking at? Oh, I don't know. He's going his own direction. <laughs> look, look at this. Like, mm. That's some good pasta I had for lunch. <laughs> he's, he's just out of it. Uh, defeat it, sure. Okay, okay, you know what? Maybe you're right. Maybe she does have, like, this superpower over me. But you know what? Maybe I like it. <laughs> oh, likes it. Bless you. Check. Totally not in denial. Oh, Check. Okay. Wow, the um, the fumes of, of jealousy are just stifling over here. Excuse me? I'm just saying, I guess some girls don't have what it takes to hang with the big dog. You're a real charmer, you know that? Is he? <laughs> I'm not gonna be able to take anything seriously. <laughs> He's so out of it. He's lost his mind. Uh, that's right, sure, I don't... That's right, because I could charm the pants off a snake. That's maybe the dumbest thing you've ever said. No, no, I've definitely said dumber. Yep. Okay, so are well, we hope sure Jacob that doesn't this die old now. bucket's roadworthy? <laughs> we'll take a look. It better be. One more night in the great outdoors might actually kill me. Hey, what doesn't kill you will make you stronger. Well, oh, I haven't don't killed stand you that. yet. You're still pretty pathetic. Hey, shut up. <clears throat> uh, okay, so, um, total hypothetical, but if I was, like, a huge asshole and I wanted to break down the van so we'd have to spend another night here, uh, what exactly would I need to do? Well, you'd probably break the fuel line or, I don't know, rip out the rotor arm. And yes, that would make you a total asshole. Okay, and what does a rotor arm look like again? It's like an arm that's all rotary. You know, some, has someone else done that already? Or? Jake, you do realize that even if we somehow oh, no, do Jacob's stuck good. out here, don't do that. Emma wouldn't make a difference. Trust me, chick's made up her mind. Yeah. Sure. Don't sabotage the car, man. Guess we'll just have to find out. No, I don't. Okay, this is this is why everyone hates Jacob. Yeah, no, we, we've worked it out. Why are you sabotaging the car? Can I just choose nothing? I don't want to break the car. I want to go home. <laughs> I just, I just want to leave. If I break the fuel line, I'm not going to be able to fix that as easily as if I steal the rotor arm, am I? He 
Yeah, so I should steal the rotor arm. Like, this is like the best of a bad decision. I don't understand cars. You're an asshole, Jacob. This is why no one likes you. Come on with me, buddy. I'll put you right back tomorrow. No harm, no foul. Up here, my dudes. Why do they look like they're up to something? Hey, Jacob. What? No, dude, please. Do, 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 Go along. Oh, dick. Okay, they're all assholes. Oh, shit. <laughs> Oh, come on, man! I'm so sorry, Jacob. Rough. Hey, maybe uh, you should have put it in airplane mode. <laughs> I hate you all. I don't want to save them anymore. Oh, I'm tempted to do a fuckface run. <sighs> Shit. What's up, man? Shut the fuck up. Oh, yeah, no, no doubt, no <laughs> doubt. God damn, my mom's gonna kill me. Your mom? Oh, yeah, to, uh, to tell her I say hi. <laughs> I'll pay to fix it as soon as we're back, man. Jacob was well, not able to reach the gang for help because his mobile oh, phone God. broke. Huh. Not a peep. Either got zero signal or everybody's already forgotten I exist. Meh. 50, you know what? 50. Whatever. I can go one more day without a phone. Day? The drive's not that far. You know what I mean. I've already sabotaged the car. Why else? Why, why would I know that? Mm -hmm. Sometimes you know stuff I don't. Look, I don't, I don't even know how to respond to that. You say, Nick, you're way smarter than me, and you're a super hot stud who gets any chick he wants. Okay, yeah, keep dreaming, Junior. <laughs> I hate them all so far. <laughs> the girl seems nice. Is that Emma? She seems okay. Is that Caitlin, was it? All the men are going to die. <laughs> right, here's Abigail. She's an artist. Kind of spooky how expressive they could like they've been able to make hey their there, characters through the years. Status well. report: We are officially empty nesters. High five up top. Oh, who are you? <laughs> <laughs> you failed the high five. You're about to get your phone I back. I character you? perishes. Let's go collect our bags and away from this mosquito-infested backwoods dump. Doors locked. Bags inside. <sighs> Fuck me. Yep. Well, it's obvious what we have to do here. Find someone with a key? Shape our destiny. And by shape our destiny, I mean shape our way through this crappy lock and grab our bags. Um, yeah, just break in, sure. Okay, let's do it. We better not get into trouble. I won't tell if you won't tell. Mr. Hackett's gonna find out. So what? He'll just think it was a bear or something. Have you ever seen a bear in these woods? No, but that doesn't mean they're not out there. Fair point. All right, let's do this. On three. One. Let's commit property damage. Two. Three. Ugh. I've oh, chosen. About the power of positive thinking. Why do I ever listen to you? I sprained your ankle. Because I'm always right. I'm sure is proud think of you. Oh my god, relax. It's not like we killed someone. Alright, well, I'm just gonna take another look around, make sure we didn't miss anything. Go nuts! Room 10. See what's in here. What, what have we got? Uh, there's something here? I can't believe I'm actually gonna miss all those lumpy, loose springs. Okay, uh... Oh, jeez, oh, God! Okay. I got flipped into the mirror dimension there.
Why would this place be in the news? Newspaper headlines. Let's have a look at this. From the local newspaper, the North Kill Gazette. Doesn't look recent. Something about a fire. Was it here at Hackett's Quarry? People keep saying, like, don't get burnt. Freak show goes up in flames. Okay, so something happened. There's ghosts around here and the area's been haunted. And there's, like, vengeful spirits or something to do with it. Real quick, guys. I'm gonna just quickly use the loot. I'll just be back in two minutes if that's alright. Give me one sec.
Hey folks. I'm back. How y'all doing? Sorry about that. Ugh. Jump scare. Boo. <laughs> no, you're good. Uh, how y'all doing? Sorry about that. Let's uh let's dive back on into this. Yeah, let me get my alerts back up. Thank you to everyone that's subbing, and thank you to everyone that's giving bits too. Good to have y'all here. Thanks for bearing with me. Is there anything else in here that we need? Aw. This was little Izzy's. Aw. I wanna play a game! <laughs> it's a little cursed. <laughs> Uh, little Izzy's. Okay, right. Two pats here. If we keep it, she might get angry that we took it from her. If we leave it, she might get angry that we don't have it later. I'm not really sure. I th Cause like this could fuck us over either way. Also, like facial expressions again. Look at this, like. <laughs> I can't get over these. That was a good sandwich I had earlier. Okay, we're gonna keep it. Let's get you back to Izzy. Pat, update it. Wait, Pat, update it? What do you mean a Pat's been updated? Broke into the cabin. Floor in the cabin. I'll put the forgotten toy in your bag. Okay, I thought it was going to be something like... Because you took the bear. After being honest with the cop, child will die. Okay, alright, we'll take the bear. Is there anything else? I think that was the main thing to get in here. I'm kind of glad that we broke in and got it. Uh, yeah, it may maybe it's important. Oh, we can see the text as well. Uh, doesn't skilled in fire a traveling show. Last night in Hackett Woods, the wildly anticipated Harum Scarum ended in tragedy as a blaze ripped through the show's attractions, burned the entire site to the ground in a matter of minutes. Uh, though firefighters were eventually able to contain the flames, it is thought that dozens perish. There's been no official statement on the confirmed dash toll yet, however we can reveal that one of the deceased is known as Sheriff Hank Miller of North Hill, North Kill. The cause of the fire is still unknown, however the North Kill Police Department released a statement earlier today uh, indicating that preliminary Investigation showed no signs of arson. Looks like it was nothing but a tragic accident. It's no secret how quickly fires can go up in dry wooded areas. And though Harem Scarum uh, follow all the all the correct safety procedures, sometimes acts of gods like this are sadly unavoidable. My thoughts go out to Hank's family and all those who lost their lives in this tragic turn of events. A question on the, how the Hackett family reacted to the news of the fire, being the proprietors of the land on which it occur on which it's occurred, authorities declined to comment. Priorities right now to ensure nothing like this ever happens again. The bodies of all those who perish are identified, and are next to King informed. Members of the public are being asked to avoid the area whilst the investigation concludes. And also reminded that Hackett Woods is our private property, known to be licensed grounds during hunting season. A candlelit vigil will be held in Town Square next week to pay respects to Harum Scarum's show members and the attendant residents of North Kill who all tragically lost their lives. Details will be published in the coming editions. So, a, the, a sheriff lost his life. Maybe related to the police officer who was here. The police officer was trying to get the two of them away from here. Maybe he know he might know something that's up. He, oh, he definitely does, considering, like, um... He said, like, go to the motel. You know? He was very angry about that. Cop knows something. 
at this birdie. Hello, friend. Hey! You stop <gasps> that! <gasps> Don't turn off the electricity. Can I go in here? To draw attention to that. Waking up to Dylan's morning announcement. Something in here. Hmm. Oh. Okay. I mean, the place is haunted. Like that much is clear. Over here? It is a tuft of grass. Nothing around here. There's blood on the box? I I think that's rust. Have you have you never seen rust before? Twenty FPS. Yeah, it, it it is a little choppy performance-wise. Uh, I don't really know what's going on there. Like th that's freezing the game just to open the graphics tab. That can't be good. Like, d yeah, this should not be freezing on the options. Try set to that. Maybe that's a little more consistent. Gone a bit hard on the old bloom. Too much bumpscosity. Borderless is low performance. Okay, let me let me let me try um Pop it in full screen then. I, I don't normally like going full screen. Because it... Oh, it fucks up a bunch of other stuff. Oh, God. Why are they doing it like this? Okay. There we go. Is that way worse? <laughs> Oh no! We go back to borderless. Okay, we're good, we're good, we're good. Back to where it was. Back to where it was. Can you see? I'm wondering what we can tweak. Cause yeah, the sound uh, uh, performance-wise is actually kind of rough. I don't want to limit the FPS, but I don't know how much it matters. Put that on medium. Turn in V-Sync on. Let's see. V-Sync like fucks up so much stuff sometimes. It could just be the area. They've gone they've gone all out with the bloom. How's that? It's better and then other people are saying ew. <laughs> better but it still kinda sucks. Alright, let's uh put it on low. Pop it on low. Maybe it'll ease up once we get past the bloom.
That's pretty good. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna stick with this. It may not look as pretty, but that's that's okay. We have to compromise. Yeah, cause I think something's going wrong with the performance on this game. Let's hop over here as like the the shadows consume us. Get in the golf cart. Can you turn motion blur off? No, I actually can't. Which is atrocious. <laughs> There's actually no option for that. Wait, check the camera options for motion blur. No, it's not there. Yeah, you, you actually can't turn motion blur off, which is which is kind of horrible. I don't know why they wouldn't include that. Try accessibility. Why would it be in accessibility? It's not, it's not there. It's sad because the motion blur, the motion blur is really just what's ruining it a bit. I, I hate motion blur. I wish by default it was just off. Every game. Display, no, we checked, we checked. We get, we just have to make two. Ready to roll? <laughs> what is this? Mmm. <laughs> The, the expressions are just, they're so good. I don't think this is the actor's fault. They, they just made a weird decision with the faces here. I can look at it, it just, eh? <laughs> Let's do it. Let's do it. Finally. It's an LA Time noir type face. It is. This caboose. How are you so dramatic? Annoying. Confident. It's just acting. It's what the people want. So you're faking it? I mean, in a way, faking it is just being yourself, but louder. You should try it sometime. You never know who you might impress. No. <laughs> It's too late now, anyway. For what? You and Nick? You never know unless you put yourself out there. Oh my, I don't. I hate these kids and their teen drama. Oh! <gasps> whoa, whoa, wow! Oh. <gasps> nice steering, Tex. Jinkies. So Stacy likes Megan, but okay, Megan's so way into Patrick. If I were to put myself out there. <laughs> Who cares? I'm being a dud, <laughs> kind of like you and Jacob. It's actually really sweet. Then why'd you quit it? Summer fling. We're going to school like four states away. I, he gets it. Yeah, sure. But that's us. You and Nick. I uh, who's Nick again? I can't Hazel. remember. Hit him up. <laughs> oh, I already have his email. It was in the package they gave to us on the first day. Have we met email? that character? Are you 93? I know Jacob. He sucks. The rude dude. Really yeah, which one? Happy. Which one of the men? Oh, hold up. Oh, but the lodge is that way. Go right here. What? The Aussie one. Come Thank on. you. Scenic route. One last victory lap around the camp. This is how the kids died. This is how the kids died. But I think I think we need to impress her. I think that's important. Scenic route. Yes. Sure. What's the victory? Two months. No technology. I kind of thought it was nice to be offline. Ugh, I didn't. Plus, my subs need. Wait. Me. Oh no, she's not like an influencer, is she? Oh no. How could they live without you? Am I right? Oh, how'd they even get by for two months without you? 
I will have you know that I have a very loyal and engaged subscriber base. Oh no, that she is an influence. Very important educational lifestyle advice in the form of entertaining and hilarious video monologues. They rely on me. Oh, totally. You're a big deal. Ah, uh, yeah. He probably has four subscribers. I mean, I'm, I'm sure they're gonna be like One of really them is happy mom. to hear back. <laughs> My favorite spot. The fire pit. TikTok star, probably. <laughs> Mad secluded, right? Is, is that smoke? Uh-oh. Should we tell someone? Mm, it looks pretty contained. It's probably just Mr. H burning some stuff. Oh, the before, fire. You know, he it's a ghost fire. Some. Yeah. Speaking of which, we should, we should probably, you know, get back. Oh, yeah. Worried Nick's, you know. Gonna leave it at you? Well, no, they're probably like all waiting for us. Mm hmm. Everyone's waiting for us. Everyone, yeah. Nick, waiting for you. All, everyone, same. Away they go. I can't be good. <laughs> oh, that can't be good. Shouldn't have said anything. Yeah, you've cursed it. Is that gonna be Laura? We don't know. We don't really know what happened to her. Don't worry, Jacob. I got you. I got a full tank of gas. So. Oh fuck me. <laughs> <laughs> oh idiot. <laughs> Does nobody own phone chargers anymore? Hey, there's no signal out here, anyways, dude. Okay, this place is like patchy as balls. <sighs> Your balls are patchy. What? No. <laughs> I hate the ball. It's okay. I'll just go get some juice from Mr. H before we go. And... Uh, you. <sighs> Let me get some juice. Who's, who talks like this? I think it's just the men. I think hey, it's. I think it really is just the men. <laughs> what did you like to know? Oh, and her because she's her, an influencer. Please. Let's go. Just gotta get these bags up on. We've two yeah. kids. We'll oh, save. Hey, hey, here, let me um, let me get it for you. I can take care of my own bag, thank you. What? Are you sure? Because I mean, it's really not that big. She of a can deal. take care of her own bag, thank you. We can both take care of our own bag, thank you. Can we just kill them all, Dad? No, Ooh. we sh we shouldn't. We gotta save these kids. I just don't know anybody. Is that like, is her necklace a padlock as well? I just realized. <laughs> Nudge. Uh, uh, Abby, do you need? Yeah. Can I? Oh, is this Nick? Thank you. It, this is. So awkward around each other. Hey, has anyone seen Ryan? Oh yeah, he's probably off being all brooding and mysterious and alluring somewhere. <laughs> I'm here. What were you doing under there? Having a little me party? Uh, I was listening to a podcast, actually. Oh, podcast. Nice. That's cool. They're so What's it about? disinterested. Is it about me or mind your own business? I gotta see what the uh, the face transforms here. <laughs> I gotta see if there's any change. He's turning away for some reason. What do you mean a podcast? The eyes are quite bloodshot. Be friendly. Yeah, what's it about? Is it about me? You think I was listening to a podcast about you? <laughs> so awesome. If anyone here had a podcast about them, it'd be me. Yeah, if there was a podcast called How to Look and Smell Like a Butt. Oh my god, you are so childish. At least I don't look and smell like a butt. <laughs> no, it's a, it's a paranormal podcast. This episode was actually about this place, weirdly enough. Oh. The Hag of Hackett's Quarry. The who of the what's it where now? What's the Hag of Hackett's Quarry? You don't know about the Hag of Hackett's Quarry. Uh, if I did, would I be asking, dumbass? 
tell her about the Hack of Hackett's Quarry. I want to learn about the Hack of Hackett's Quarry. Don't you don't know about the Hack of Hackett's Hack Hack Quarry? Oh, can we just please stop saying the Hag of Hackett's Quarry? It's just this campfire story for the kids. It's, um, there's supposedly an old woman who died in a fire a few years back. Oh, I think we met her. She haunts the woods looking for her lost baby boy. There are, like, reports of whispers or whatever, and then this figure that floats around, you know, textbook ghost stuff. Some people say that if she catches you alone, she'll try to turn you into her son. Or kill you. Or something. I don't know. It's never really been... Okay, so stop Anyways, splitting up for clues. Give me that up. It's right here in the podcast, man. Cool story, bro. <laughs> Is his neck broken? <laughs> Fucking jump scare. <laughs> I can't take any of the dialogue seriously because we just cut back to this guy every time. <laughs> the Kubrick stay. Uh, it's so hard to take seriously. Uh, uh, supportive. Seriously though, you should have seen the first time you told the story to the kids at the campfire. They were scarred for life. We gotta be friends. I mean, not for <laughs> life. You gotta be careful with this stuff, man. This shit's true. Come on, dude, bullshit. What's the holdup, Hacketeers? Uh, yeah, uh, nearly done, Mr. H. We're up to it. Get those butts in gear. Sorry, Mr. Something H. What's going on with his cheek Yeah, there. deliberate some luggage. Shut up. Maybe if somebody didn't spend so much time trying to press the ladies ball as ghost stories. You asked. Ghost stories? The Hag of Hackett's Quarry. Oh! <sighs> Hey, you still have the van key, Mr. H? We like Mr. H. Well, yes, I do. Don't think he's gonna murder him. But you know, I'd lose my head if it wasn't stuck on. Back to the office I go. But don't let that be foreshadowing. Give me a hand, would you, Ryan? Oh, okay. Does Yo, he Mr. have like H. eight bees in his mouth? It does look like, like something's going on chance. there. I could get a little <laughs> charge. I want to have some uh, tunes for the road. No can do. <laughs> what do you what do you mean I can't have tunes <laughs> yeah sure it's fine cool cool yeah no worries good man uh no big deal you can share my earbuds What's wrong with the faces? I don't know. I have no idea. <laughs> made by the same team that made Ally Noir. So, Who knew? Uh, Chris, I I'm actually glad we got a moment to talk. Uh, uh oh. I'm not fired, am I? <laughs> no, no, it's, um, it's just, you know, about the whole thing w with the. Oh. Hold that thought, partner. I'm going to have to take this. Oh, yeah. Okay. Oh, uh, sorry. Hello. Don't stay alone too long. Uh, we probably need to know information. I would try eavesdrops here. Is this a horror game? What? To shoot the kids. Don't be so much about. They're almost out of here, all right? You're cutting it pretty close. We don't want to have... Just hold your damn horses, all right? Everything's A-OK -okay on this end. Bobby and I are geared up. If he's in the area, we'll get him. This is a waste of time. You know what? I know it. No, should I have? He's gone quiet. Probably staying out of the way. Speaking of which, the longer you keep me on this damn phone, the longer it's going to take me to get rid of these damn kids. Oh, well, it seems to be okay, at least. Yeah, of course. Adios.
Sorry, I, I wasn't. I, I wasn't listening. <laughs> Dude, you got to move I was away. Just, like, <laughs> waiting. Like, I mean, I heard. Chris is disappointed. I, I mean, I was. I didn't hear what you were. We're saying. cool, champ. Just come on in. Sorry, I pushed you out like that. Joe just listened to the podcast. Yeah, the podcast might have given help too because I was talking about the surrounded area. You, uh, you need a hand looking for the keys? Uh, no, end of summer, busy, busy. You know. Anyway, you were asking me. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah. It was just the whole animation school thing. What you thought I should do? Right. Y you know, listen, whether or not I should like leave my sister with my grandparents since I'd have to live on campus. You know. And my mom's not exactly around, so I wouldn't want to leave Sarah on her own. You know, fam our family's small enough as it is. Well, family is important, right? Dang it. He's lost. Them. Uh, be concerned. Yeah, we got to make it up to him. Don't get frustrated. Is everything okay? You got a hot day tonight? Oh boy. If you only knew. <laughs> what, what does that mean? So, uh, what, what did you need me for? What? <laughs> You're one of my favorite counselors, Ryan. You know that. One of the good ones. But, do you know how many calls I get from parents, letter after letter, with these terrified kids that they send home? Huh. I, I didn't realize that. Believe it or not, scaring kids away from sleepaway camp is kind of bad for business. So maybe just ease up on the ghost stories? Uh, just a little fun uh, or apologetic. Just be apologetic to him, but like have no actual remorse. Like, fuck yeah, we're telling the kids spooky stories if they're out in the woods. You got it. Th that sounds like part of the experience. So we're just going to lie. Sorry, I didn't realize it was such a big deal. Gotta understand the repercussions of your actions, Buster. It's a big part of being a counselor, a leader. Yeah. Just stick to kumbaya next time, okay? What's that? You guys don't do kumbaya anymore? What's kumbaya? Good grief. I'm outgrowing my own cliches. What? Seriously, Chris, what's going on? I just want to get you guys safely out of Dodge before the sun goes down. Um, should we ask him about this? We might, we might get some information. I do get it, but I feel like we should ask. I feel like we should ask. People are saying, don't do it. But yeah, we should know. Like, inquisitive. Yeah, just curious. Why? It's getting dark, Ryan, and it's not safe to drive in the dark. Oh, uh, fair. And safety is the first step towards fun. I don't think he believes that. Just give me a minute. Where not buying that good one goddamn moment. Goddamn, are they? Please say goodbye to Caleb and Kaylee for me. They sort of just snuck off. Well, you'll see him again next year. Caleb works at the scrapyard during the off season, and Kaylee, well, she's still figuring out what she wants to do. She's got her whole Ryan life Vance. ahead of her. <laughs> they both just come and go as they please, really. Teenagers, am I right? Actually, could have used the help packing up since we were short staffed. Hey, you guys seem to manage all right. But I'll tell them both you were sad you missed them. Unlocked the van, put the keys in my pocket, came in the office. There they are. Where I left them. Uh -huh. Let's skedaddle. Let's get these kids home safe. Nothing bad's gonna happen here. Oh Make God, sure is this David Cage? This does feel more go. like David Cage than Until Dawn did. 
Until Dawn was great because it was like not David Cage. Wait, how did you get? Your but this phone feels back like they've doubled down. I never turned it in. You sure did turn it off before you handed it in, Dylan. Them's the rules, you noob. Who says noob anymore? Honestly. I try not to dwell on the past, man. Good. Because it's time to dwell on the minivan. Get on with our respective lives. Move it. Let's go. Let's head home. What's the problem? Ugh. Oh, dude, I don't know. I, I think there's something wrong with the engine, Mr. H. Yeah, I can see that. Yeah, dude, it's just like kaput. Uh oh. Right, let me try. What, dude, I'm telling you, all right, it's busted. Well, maybe you're doing well, it wrong. Well, maybe you're doing it wrong. The fuck, dude? Enough. Enough, both of you. Can the kids stop fighting, please? Come on, come on. Chill. Chill, dude. We need to stay alive. Damn it. I thought I told you kids to check everything. No, we did. It, it should be working. Yeah, well, coulda and shoulda doesn't mean it is, does it? He's very upset about this. God damn it, Jacob. Okay. Uh, okay. Well, uh, look, it's not that big of a deal, okay? We'll just spend one more night here. No! No! Just stop. Let me think. It's not an option to stay. Okay. Damn it. He, you're right. Who you're screams right, yeah. at the car like that? What? Yeah, you're right. Catch him. Hey, Brian. Come here for a sec. What? What is going on? Make sure that everybody is inside the lodge for tonight. Lock the doors. No one in, no one out. No one. Got it? Okay. I'll be back first thing in the morning. And we'll get you all He road. knows what's up. You just have to keep everyone inside. Can you promise me you'll do that? Why does he know what's up? I'm I'm pretty unsure. What's going on here? <laughs> Why would he leave them? Yeah, he's inside a car right now, but there's not enough room in that car to take everyone. Then you get the van. But he knows what's going on. Oh, he, Ryan's staring deeply into his soul. <laughs> Wait, did he not fully blink in his other eye? I don't think he did. That was like a twitch. Why is he winking at him? <laughs> his right eye ain't closing. <laughs> okay, uh... I gotta ask. He knows Wait, what's up. We have to stay inside until tomorrow? Why? Where are you going? Ryan, I need you to trust me. Like I'm trusting you. Can you do that? Lock the doors. He's just leaving. And for God's sake, keep the noise down! He's gone. Everyone's in danger, and he knows what's going on. So, what was that about? He, uh, said to stay inside, that we're not leaving until the morning. Are you kidding me? Um. Are you kidding me? What are we supposed to do? Well, we should go inside, like he said. We could go inside until morning. Yeah. This or... is how people start dying. Or we could do something else. We we, sh we should really follow Chris's instructions here. We absolutely shouldn't be doing something else. No, 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 no. We should really listen to what Chris told us to do. Of course. Uh, 
Who cares what Chris told us to do? He's not our boss anymore. P-A-R-T. Why the fuck not? All right, it seems like the stars have aligned If he for dies, us, I'm kind of okay with okay, it. Okay, okay, okay. One last epic bonfire blowout. He said epic and ironic. Yeah, no, he needs to go. Oh, dude. Fuck yes, I'm in, Nick. You're in. Yeah, I'm in. Dylan's in, obviously. My man. Caitlin? I go where my people need me. Yeah, okay. M, what do you say? Mm. <laughs> yeah, I'm in. Mr. Hackett seemed pretty insistent we stay in the lodge. He, he was just trying to freak us out, you know? Like, um... Like one of Ryan's stupid ghost stories. Why would he want to scare us? No, the ghost stories aren't stupid. Uh, he did seem freaked out. Yeah, he was. I don't think he was trying to freak us out, Jacob. I think he was really freaked out by something. Jesus Christ. Chris seemed real serious about this, guys. Just say you're in, man. Come on, one last night. Yeah, Dude, he won't even know. I, I promised. No, 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 dude, dude, dude. It's all good. <laughs> Chris right, is get getting it. You, know, you, uh, <laughs> you don't want to disappoint daddy. <laughs> oh my god, these kids are dumb. Listen to Mr. Safety over here. Someone's got to give a shit. Yeah, well, someone's got to give a shit. Oh. You know what? <gasps> I don't even care what you guys do. Oh. I'm doing what Chris told no! me to do. Ryan, come on, man. Wait. Is he already gone? <laughs> all right, all right, all right. Hacketeers. Party planning committee. Let's do this. Um, okay. First things first. That's bad because Ryan's gonna be on his own now. Get some firewood. Uh, M and I will go to the stores for some supplies. And uh, Dylan, you just—I don't know—figure out how to charge the phones or something. All right, let's do this. Yeah. One last summer party. Why is it so happy? So happy. There's a fucking sniper. <laughs> Oh, this can't be good. This, this can't be good. Who the hell are these guys? Why is this guy covered in, like, blood? Holy shit! Is Carol from Detroit become human? It actually does look like him! <laughs> What's he doing here? David Cage, he's done it again! <laughs> This can't be good. I was hoping you'd come back to me. This can't be good at all. Let's see what you've found. Empty-handed. You need to look around you, find my cards, and I can help you. Where I'm from, we Oh, look out I for didn't each find other. any cards. Find them, please. Oh no. Um, You'd better be going. She's not going to give me it's any information still this time. Early and the moon is bright, but time won't wait. Not for those with a story to tell. Where was the card? I, I don't know. Look out for yourselves. And look out for my cards. Oh, I hope the kid doesn't die because of this. No, no, no rewinds. No, we're doing like one clean sweep. 
chapter two, truth or dare. Okay, we got it. We got to look for the carrots this time. So here we are. Oh uh, no! In the great American wild, with nothing but our wits to guide us, will humanity prevail, or will we grow ravenous and resort to eating the flesh of the deceased, like I saw in that one plane crash movie? TikToker. First course, filet au Jacob. God, I hope so. Full body, this rare beefcake may leave an irritating taste lingering on the palate. An acquired taste, some would say. Wow. Well. What? <laughs> I just hope he's eaten. I don't agree with anything else you say. Thread a needle with a packet of loose hater. Oh my god, I'm almost done, okay? Jesus Christ. And for the record, your analogies are very hurtful. <sighs> Please just okay, let the monsters come already. We gotta second. save them. Hey, what's this? No, don't kick the door. There we go. And Viola. Uh, Your hair clip, madam. Yeah, you can keep it. It's not too Wait, shabby. Wait, Viola. Yeah. Voila. Playful, good with your... I don't... No, leave room for Jesus. Took you long enough. Well, I got it open, didn't I? It's okay. It's not a race. Okay. So... If I were a beer, where would I be? Tired of these kids flirting with each other. You beep, need to focus on beep, staying alive. Beep, <laughs> beep, beep, what beep, are you doing? Beep. Oh, <laughs> uh, it's my beer dar. Helps me dar for beers. Huh. How am I just noticing how super lame you are? Oh, uh, welcome what? to the club. But it, it's my beer dar, dude. I'm just gonna, I'm gonna go over here. Wow, the kids really wiped this place out. Yeah, what have we Mr. got? Mr. H loved his accessories. You really need to go home and stay inside. It's a safe. I <laughs> think it's locked. Why are we stealing money? Don't know what I was expecting. Oh. Oh, hell yeah! <laughs> oh! Jackpot! Hey, uh. Check out my giant melon. Oh, that's oh. a low hanging fruit, Jacob. Come on. You just cut a hole in it? Mm hmm. You pour in your vodka. Cool, <laughs> melon! Party time. You just Come on, Jacob. Right You're in. more mature than this. Yeah. It's the most fun you could have with a hole in watermelon. Or, well, second most. Okay, I'm gonna leave you two alone and go look for some more party supplies. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Turn this fucking game off! <laughs> oh, I don't wanna save these kids. I really don't. I've already had enough to hear with them. But we should, we should. That's how you know this is going to be the road less traveled playing this game. Because I think almost everyone playing this is going to want them to die. Not us. The path less traveled. We'll save them from themselves. Because God knows they fucking need it. Harem Scarum? Okay. Harem Scarum. Oh, I missed a clue as well. These flies wrote a traveling show called Harem Scarum. The date listed indicates that it took place over six years ago. Over six years ago? It was, the fire was older than that. Was it not? This. Okay, we, we need to look for tarot, uh, tarot cards as well. I, I don't... I'm not seeing any. Door's locked there. Is 
is a jail cell. It is unreasonably creepy here. Especially with how the store is let out. Who buys this crap? Yeah, like, why is this room let out like a maze? Oh. Be good. Did anyone see a card? <laughs> Looking for the tower. Here. <laughs> Hello, old friends. Oh, yeah. No, don't scare. We need to stop trying to fucking Maybe kill I each other. Break. <laughs> he deserves it, the prick. He does, but I need these kids alive. I, I need to not get them all killed. No, you don't. Jacob doesn't count. <laughs> We're gonna get these kids out of here. Is that a tarot card? No, it's not. It's just a piece of paper. Is it just me or is the camera, like, uncomfortably close? All the time. <laughs> like, I'm just trying to turn the corner here. I don't- I don't see any cards here. Okay, let's go into this back room. You can taste the hair. I wonder where this goes. Locked. Uh... I would get Jacob- stick- stick together. Stick together. Jacob! Come check this out. You can you can pick the lock. Oh, uh, <laughs> alrighty then. Door, buckle up because you are about to meet your maker. There he goes. <laughs> we know you can pick locks. <laughs> Whoa. Fucking mother love. Good golly, Miss Molly. I wonder if this place is the up. light or is there like a spooky ethereal mist? What? No. I mean he left us stranded here. It's like um <clears throat> human rights or whatever. Sure. Yeah. Alright. Now let's see what we are working with. Hold that. The door will latch otherwise. Oh, hell yeah. In and out. Job done. Boom. I want to look around. Go for it. Is there a playing card in here? What a big freezer. Oh, cool. Oh, this is what? what is it? Yes, Guy. take this. Oh, cool! And, uh, code. 7739. You should not be swinging okay. that like that, but I'm done. it's really dangerous. <laughs> Take the gun. That's pretty good that we got that. 
Victoria Jacob, unlocked evidence. Check this out. What? what? I can't move or else the door will latch. You look like camping supplies. Oh, okay. Um, there's tents back at the fire pit, so just let's let's go. Evidence collected torn bags. Torn hiking bags dashed with flecks of dried blood. Okay, uh, uh, yeah, uh, Mr. H has killed some people. Clearly, yeah, he knows what's happening here. Oops. Probably just ketchup. Oh, gee. Had a very messy spaghetti. Okay, there's absolutely nothing there. The freeze is not full of like human flesh or something. Oh wait, no, zombie flesh. I stand corrected. Along with gooey eyeballs and brain candy. I'm not far off the mark there. What, it said there was a tutorial about evidence? Wait, where are the tutorials? Blues. Yeah, I want the little animated video to play. It's in settings? Why the fuck is it here? Everyone likes a scavenger hunt. And at Hackett's Quarry, that's no different. There are secrets in these woods. Fun secrets that should uh -oh. you uncover them could help protect you from criminal prosecution. After all, the stories you'll take with you are only stories without the proof to back them up. So it's time to dive into the mystery, take pictures, or find pieces of evidence. And you may just prove your innocence. Or not. Wait, so, they, oh, so we don't collect enough, they're gonna kill us. That's not great. Okay, uh, no one saw a playing card, did they? I think we're good. Maybe give me a heads up if you see a playing card as we go, okay? Give me a big shout. Oh. Yeah, seven seven three nine. We need we need to unlock the safe. So you're uh you're really gonna keep the gun, huh? Yeah. For bears. Okay. I'm gonna make a TikTok uh, well, about I this. I'm gonna find something to haul this lot back to camp. God, he just fucking bolted. Oh, what's this? Quote too high, look for cheaper next time. Okay, you gotta press that bumper like immediately when it pops up or it's not gonna let you investigate it. I'm amazed there's not a playing card or something in here. It seems like the place there would be one. Don't forget, you also gotten a clue in the freezer area. Damage memorabilia. Oh, is there like layers to them? Yeah, there's like question marks. The minivan failed to start, so the councils couldn't leave Hackett's quarry. Yeah, we gotta go back and get the safe. Let's just traverse the twist. No, don't traverse the twisty maze. Monsters live in the twisty maze. The safe was in the front room, wasn't it? Yeah, it was. Was that it? All right. <sighs> uh, 
There we go. I'm in. Hey, very nice. <laughs> Shot. We're gonna need these. What else is in there? Uh, just some fireworks. Oh, oh, fireworks? Yeah, but I don't think we should. No, 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 Emma. Jacob. Fireworks. You've already made it so everyone has to stay in their night here and die. Oh, but they could be a weapon. That's what I'm thinking. We could just, like, shoot fireworks at the monster. But... Uh, uh. No, we probably leave him, because he's. if we take the fireworks, he's going to set them off. That's so loud, yeah. Noise seems to be very much a thing here that you have to consider. It's giving you a lot of options to kick down the door or be quiet. Forest fires are good. I think we leave them. If we have a shotgun. I feel like fireworks are crossing a line. What? But you got a gun. Why can't I have firecrackers? Because the gun is for bear protection and the fireworks could start a forest fire. <sighs> Stupid forest fires. <laughs> no, Jacob. Hey, Stupid you. <laughs> I found these, like, torn up bags back there. They were pretty messed up and I think they might have had blood on them. Oh, oh, stop. Stop. Stay right there. <sighs> oh, dude! Peanut butter butter pops. Dude, peanut butter fucking that butter That bag pops. looks disgusting. <laughs> no, don't be judgmental because like then they're going to be assholes to each other and someone winds up dead. Oh my god, that's a creepy eye open if I ever saw one. What are butter pops? <laughs> no. What? I can't believe it. Um, okay. Um... <clears throat> Pop, pop, peanut butter, butter pops. <laughs> pop, pop, pop them in your mouth. What the fuck is going on? Oh my god. They're like the greatest snack of all time. What are they? Are they like popcorn? What? No. No, 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 no. They're nothing like popcorn. They're like their own thing. Like their own subgenre of food snack. You know what? I haven't had these since I was a kid. You are in for such a treat. Okay, wait. Is there an expiration date on that bag? Um, no, they're still good. Oh my god, they're like 20 years old, aren't okay. they? Okay, look, they predate expiration dates. Blah. That's but, how you get food poisoning. Blah. Oh well, <clears throat> I saw a wheelbarrow out front, so we can load up all our booty in there. Uh, I'm sorry, what? Booty? Oh, it means like, um, like treasure. We don't need this explanation, <laughs> Jacob. <laughs> no, Think of your virginity. Before. You need to keep it safe if you want to live the night. Uh, yeah. Um, okay. Uh, it's like, um, it's like a barrel with wheels. You can put stuff in it and just wheel it around. Oh, I see. It's not so Christian of them. <laughs> Ladies first. Um, yep. Which way? Wait, she don't know what a wheelbarrow- Oh, fucking TikTokers, am I right? <laughs> did they leave the melons behind, too? I think they did. Yeah. They forgot to take them. Even after the, the... Very immature joke you made. Alright. The inner sanctum. It's just an office. This is where the magic happens. <laughs> okay, yeah, let's just make this quick. Sure, just give me a sec to yeah, get What are we looking going. for? And engage. Phone is charged. Podcasts. Yeah. All right. <laughs> Every time we get a still of this guy. I feel in danger. <laughs> I'm very uh, on edge. What are you listening to? Uh, what's it called, the one that you're listening to right now? Uh, bizarre yet bona fide. So like ghosts and stuff? It's like, um, 
yeah, like the the weird and the wonderful, digging up weird mysteries and discussing if they're well bona fide. Boner, fide. <laughs> Get it? My Boner. God, can you stop with the with dick no jokes? Like, ho <laughs> ho ass, ho <laughs> ho. So, penis. Check out Mr. Uh, give us five minutes, sin. please. Uh, <laughs> just I don't know, stop. Man. I feel a little weird going through his stuff. <laughs> just okay. stop. Okay, well, I don't. I mean, come on, what kind of dirty secrets is the owner of a summer camp full of impressionable oh, children going to have anyway? God. <laughs> Not Mr. H, I know. He's cool. It's always been cool to me. <laughs> they can't help themselves. I just want these kids to survive. Can't you, like... Speed it up at all. I can try to encourage them. Go for it. You guys can do it. It's not working. I actually was really quite <laughs> It's a good response. Okay. What's this? Oh, let's talk to him. So, got anything going on when you get back home? School or? Uh, jury's out. Understood. Girlfriend? Uh, These damn kids. <laughs> not exactly. Boyfriend? Don't you guys have any hobbies? Like aspirations for college? Free agent. Cool, yeah. Me too. Are the uh, phones? Uh, they could probably use a little while longer. Ah. Uh. Okay. Very pride. <laughs> it's just like everything's like, so! Are you hooking up with Sandra? What does Becky think? You know Michael's into you, right? And it's just like, oh my god, like, stop, just. <laughs> Whoa, look at this old thing. Hey, give me your number, I wanna try it out. Why? Um, just be sarcastic. I don't want to encourage him. Oh, no reason. I just thought it'd be nice for somebody to call you for a change. Good burn. Thank you. I thought it was pretty good. <laughs> Hello? What? Who is it? Oh, uh, no. It's weird. I thought I thought I heard someone. Maybe we should stop touching stuff. Fine. Don't make the joke. Okay, thank you. Let's look at the Ryan Reynolds family. Kaylee and Caleb Packett. Weird kids, huh? I like them. Yeah, me, I, me too. Um, they are pretty reclusive, you have to admit. Pop them back down there. Yeah, there's a cellar door there. Cellar door is probably gonna move it on. They're a tarot card. Me on the dresser. Yeah, what's the gun for? Uh, Chris, Get as many firearms as possible. Mr. H told me it was for um, bears. Bears here? Yeah, yeah. He said they don't really come around because he's got the gun. To... Yeah. Just leave it alone. Just leave it alone. Take the gun. Take, take. What if we need it? Just be serious, yeah. Because cause he was more serious about this. What if we need it? Dude, what if we're out partying tonight out in the woods and we end up in a sort of most dangerous game situation? Like when people hunt other people? Yeah. I mean, that's yeah, a bit of a but, jump. Yeah, think about it. It's camp is over and <laughs> hunting season has just begun. True. Where are you what pulling if, this what from? If, okay, bear with me here. What if what's on the menu tonight is us? Well, then I guess we would need to protect ourselves. Exactly. That's why we need. I, like gun. this is heavy foreshot. Yeah, this isn't subtle gonna... at all. What about for fun? No. So what if it's hunting okay. season in the game? Yep. Yeah, yep. Yeah, totally. 
Is he in on it too? He might be. Well, we know where the he gun might is be. if we need it. Your call, man. Yo, leave the gun alone, man. You got it, boss. We need the gun, man. We need... Dylan, what the fuck, man? <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> it's getting I just really, time. really want to know what it feels like to hold it. Um, I told you to leave it alone twice. Yeah, sorry. Cut it out. What if I take it a fourth time? No, oh, you could only just look at it now. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, I could really use this. Uh, do you want to try the cellar door or this door? Yo, my guy, toss me the keys. Uh, so you can poke around in Chris's private area? I I'm sorry, is that something that only you're allowed to do? Party har har. Come on, what's the harm in looking? It's, you're not a little bit curious? I'm not gonna touch anything. Fine. Don't let me regret it. Can't promise that, but. Catch the keys. Come Nothing on. Nothing but net. <laughs> you're using that wrong. Oh. That's so awkward. <laughs> Huh. Okay, right, there's the stuff in there. What's this? Fashion icon. <laughs> Mr. H knows what he likes. Sure he does. Wow, there's Yo. Hey, hey, maybe we shouldn't uh Oh, that's a little spooky. Uh, Brian? Whoa, what the fuck? These monitors, this is the camp. Huh. Why is this Mr. so hidden? No, no. I mean, no, no, he can't be. These are just, they're all different trails in the woods around camp. <laughs> sure. Most of the cameras are pointed away from camp, so it's not like he's spying on the kids. Unless they wandered out into the woods. You know, these are just... Probably just trail cameras. What are trail cameras? People set them up to... Catch weird, random shit. Okay, yeah, like what? Like... Uh, Bigfoot sightings, you know, that kind like of he, thing. He knows what's up. Maybe he listens to that podcast. Yep, take him seriously. I didn't know that Mr. H was into that kind of stuff. Shit, maybe he likes that podcast that you listen to. Secret hobby, I guess. Expensive hobby. Yeah, well, I mean, what else are you gonna do out here? Yeah, I guess camp probably does get pretty lonely when there's no one else around. Yeah. Okay, but why go through all the trouble of hiding this room through a secret door in the closet? Uh, I mean, it's not exactly secret, right? Like, it's just hidden by yes stuff. That, that's what secret means yeah right. that's what a secret is ryan it, it's weird <laughs> it's majorly yeah, weird i don't disagree with you but it, it's it's gotta be something juicy in here dylan okay. it's it's none of our business and if you really want to know you can ask him tomorrow I'm sure that won't be an awkward conversation like at all okay yeah maybe i will all right I, I'm leaving this secret layer you know ryan is taking it seriously hey, but he's also not investigating layer. anything which is kind of also awful. Like, surely you'd be at least remotely curious if you found this. Why is there a microphone? What was that? Oh, no. It's, what do you mean it's probably- someone just took the camera. How can you ignore that? How- 
Do you just not believe your eyes? No, it's not coming back. Okay, these are boring. <laughs> you just saw a man take- Oh my god, these kids. Oh, I'm trying to save you, dumb shit. Artificial, thank you for a thousand bits. Thank you for another 500 bits there as well. Oh my god, can I take the videotape? There's nothing else I can get in here. Look at that. Oh, look at this. Huh. Max Brinley. This is Max and Laura. Oh my god, he's totally in it. He knows they didn't make it to the camp. Oh no. Yep, he's, 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 he's in on it. He's hiding the fact that they never made it. Go get the gun. Let me try for it again. I don't think anything's happening on that camera. Well, let's leave the secret lair. Phone's getting some battery. Down here. There. Don't make noise. Oh, this is like his bedroom. Okay. Ending here. Doesn't seem it. Play it. I don't think I can. Take a nap. Whoa, there's some pretty heavy-duty stuff in here. Yeah, maybe let's not touch that. Yeah, there's nothing fun. But, no, this might be important. Was there anything in here that looks like... Oh, it's just ibuprofen. Paracetamol. Toothpaste for great white teeth. Kind of worried that there's more going on there. Well, he's st he's still looking at me about the gun. Okay, let's look at the uh, this door here. Well, hello. What is this? You hear that? Is that a trap door? <laughs> That can't be good. Secret sex dungeon- nope. Yeah, I guess it goes to the basement. Huh. But why would Mr. H have a secret trap door in his office that goes to the basement? Because he needed another way out. This was his office. He's like a million years old. This has always been his office. It's probably for storage. Yeah, or so that he can make a quick getaway when the heat comes down. Uh, That's exactly what it is. Or it's for storage. Go ahead, open it up. And we go. All right, well, it looks like a pit of eternal darkness, so. You're being dramatic. Climb down, take a look. Look, you can squeeze through there. You opened it, you climb down. Climb down. We need to investigate this. What's down there? Oh my god, Ryan, you will what? not believe this. What? 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 It's nothing. Oh, 
Oh wait, no, I maybe we shouldn't have gone down second, here. Didn't I? No. Maybe. Just shut up. It is uh, pretty spooky down here, though, and it smells very unnatural, so... Yeah, maybe you should go. Yeah, okay, I'm coming back up. Oh, no. Oh, we damaged the ladder. Ooh, that's a nice chair. I could get used to this. You better hope Mr. H is <laughs> He damaged the, the ladder, the no! Oh, why, why is he swaying? He'll never know. Come on, he's not gonna know. Okay, just be careful. What do you think I'm gonna do, break it? Come on. Oh. <sighs> he's okay. <laughs> That's a design flaw. Mm. <laughs> God, so there's a lot of scenarios where kids might die now. I'm hoping the tarot card wasn't like, don't go in the basement. Oh. Laura Kearney and Max Sprindley. Oh yeah, those are the ones that never showed up. Yeah, it's because of these goobers that we had to work extra shifts this summer. Okay, it didn't end well though. Listen to council's names, personal details, and the tasks at camp. Two names are crossed out. Why didn't they show up? I mean, I can hazard a guess. I can hazard a guess what happened there. <laughs> Can I take the gun again? <laughs> no. And there's Ryan Reynolds. Uh, our phone's charged. Nice. Full up. That's a, What do you mean, full? <laughs> nice. 28%. That's not what full means. Get a little more charge. The drawing of someone called Chris. I don't know if we have Chris. Uh, is there anything else I can do? Was there a tarot card? Didn't let me. They didn't let me do anything with the letters of that, did it? Not gonna piece together. Hey, why is there letters addressed to them? They never showed up. Okay. Well, we're just gonna leave. We're just gonna leave. Uh, real quick again, if that's all right, folks. I'm just gonna take another little bathroom break. I'll be right back. I'll just leave you as to it. Give me two minutes. Be right back. Getting some water too.
Hey, sorry about that, folks. I'm back again. Sorry for the breaks in there, yeah. We're all good. Here, let's keep playing. We got water. I'm prepared. Let me take a sip. You survived. Blurt more? No. No, this is gonna be a sexless playthrough of this game. We're keeping these kids alive. No flirtations. I don't care who has a crush on who. Absolutely not. I need these kids to stay focused on getting to the end and surviving. Absolutely not. We need the kids to stay on top. So, if you do go to school in the fall, have you, like, picked out a major, or...? I don't know, man. It's kind of hard to talk about right now. Oh, have you not decided what you're gonna do with your life? Hey, are the phones done yet? <laughs> He's just done with them. <laughs> nice. Full up. Full up. 28%? I can't wait. If they run out of battery later, right? I'm gonna be pissed. <laughs> I'm gonna be so mad if it's like two hours from now. It's like, oh no, my phone's gone. <laughs> hey, Dunzo. All right, cool. Let's go. All right, let's go. Thank you. Okay, we're good. We notice the gun. We have the security footage. He's a glass almost empty guy. <laughs> Were there any tarot cards? I feel like I'm gonna talk to the hag again. She's gonna be like, Jesus, you're not doing well. Oh, here's these two. This would be a lot easier with Mr. H's chainsaw. It's really very pretty out here when there's no kids around. They can get kind of obnoxious, huh? Yeah. They always seem to listen to you during painting class. You've seen my class? Just walking by. <laughs> the art cabin's all the way out of the way. Yeah, well, there's this shortcut that I take that goes by. But we won't talk any more about that. We need to not die tonight. Which way should we go? Why don't you choose? Shady Glade or the Rocky Road? Which which way are we feeling? We did see someone get crushed by a boulder in like the animated cutscene when they went to the Rocky Road. Like, a lot of people want to go to Shady. Okay. Let's get Shady this Shady Glade. <laughs> oh, <laughs> no! Oh. He's okay. Oh my god, are you okay? I'll be okay. Oh my god. <laughs> Come on, I'll spot you. Immediate pitfall. I can't tell how much I should be looking around here. There's not going to be like a carriage like all the way over there, is there? I feel like I should be kind of following the path. So, um, I heard this joke about artists. It's pretty bad. Oh, yeah? Yeah. You want to hear it? Okay, here it is. Why couldn't the world's fastest painter ever keep a girlfriend? Hmm, why not? Because he always finished in one stroke. Oh. It's dumb, sorry, Jacob told me about it. Uh, isn't that about golfers? Because of the stroke thing? 
Yeah, sorry. Can I don't know. we just not? Jacob Can probably heard it from just the campers. Not? That makes sense. So of course, Jacob sense. did. Yeah. Those kids Fucking have Jacob. Filthy minds. Woo! <laughs> <laughs> just a bird. Just a bird. That was a mean oh, bird. I'm, I'm so sorry. I've just been on a little. Just been a little edgy lately. <laughs> Hey, just be reassured. Hey, don't worry about it. It's just the forest playing tricks on you. I used to go camping all the time with my dad and you think you hear and see some pretty weird stuff, but you just realize it's nature doing its thing. Did you just say thing? No, that's the forest up to its old tricks again. <laughs> They're in danger. I've never been camping. It's pretty nice if you open yourself up to it. So you have to be open-minded to enjoy camping? No, I just mean there's a lot of stuff you have to overlook. Like basic comfort. You really just have to try it. I could take you some time. Why are you like camping in the woods this want. entire time? Why, why are they uh, against um, camping maybe... all of a sudden? Let's just make it through tonight first. Let's. Yeah. Oh, I agree with you there, Abigail. Okay, off the beaten path. going on here uh. a ranger box a box in the woods unlocked inside is a change of clothes bottled water and supplies provisions for a ranger perhaps I haven't learned any of this yet but okay I think it's a ranger box oh huh. like a supply cache for rangers or whatever if they're out in the woods naked rangers <laughs> so it would seem <laughs> oh yeah the, the other guys the other guys seem to be stripping down a bit they had like blood paint all over them in the hunting season i don't understand what's happening there yet something over here There is. There. There. Hello? Hello? So where does the stream actually go? The lake. There oh, we go. Yeah. <laughs> Just wanted yeah. to check out the fence. <laughs> Oh, I passed the carrot apparently too. Hey, where, where's the carrot? How how do you guys see this? Where was it? Wait, where did you guys see a carrot? Where? It was in Rocky Road. Well, like, why is people saying card now? 50? Alright, okay. <laughs> we can't be doing this. <laughs> we can't, we can't play this game. I'm trying to save these kids' lives, right? And the heat of the moment, I don't want someone screaming about a tyrant character that doesn't exist for me to get one killed. <laughs> I just don't. That's probably the best for spoilers, too. Because I'm, I'm going in blind. I did not know there was one in Rocky Road, nor did I wish to know. Like, the only time I want to know if there's a carrot is if I'm, like, literally beside it and I can't, just don't see it. Then I appreciate it. Because that's me just being blind at that point.
But otherwise, like, we're going, we're going spoiler free. I think we're back near the path again. Nice walk through the woods. Oh, I know where we are. Yeah? Up here. Here, hold these. Sure. This guy's not as much of a dick now, which is nice. He's calmed down a little bit. This view is just... Wow. But I don't know if we want him to live yet. This is kind of awkward, huh? Be, be sincere. Be genuine. Damn, Abby, you're really good. No, no, this is nothing. <laughs> no, really, I'm not just saying that. This is rough, but if I can get a little bit of it down, then I'll remember it better later. It's really cool you know that about yourself. Um, yeah. I guess so. I mean, not everyone knows what they're capable of, you know? I'm sure you're capable of a lot, Nick. I mean, of course. I'm capable just... of not dying, Nick. Don't know what. You'll figure it out. <laughs> it's like, good luck. You're on your own. <laughs> <laughs> no words of encouragement whatsoever. Uh oh. Did you hear that? Hmm? It's probably nothing. No, listen. There's something there. Oh, God. Oh, it's a little pig. Look! It's so tiny. Tiny pig. Oh, my God. He's so cute. Uh oh, hold on. There might be a big pig. <laughs> Save Abby. <laughs> Don't breathe. You're in danger. Hunted by a creature of indeterminate origin. Don't breathe. You need to stop breathing. Tricking the beast into taking you for nothing but a corpse. And where's the fun in hunting them which is already dead? Watch the visuals alter or listen to the sound change as the Oh approaches. god, I'm not gonna like this mechanic. When the danger is past, run. Pick the right moment and run for your life. Be warned. Exhaling or running at the wrong time may just mark you as the creature's quarry. Oh no! Consequences. Okay, how do I how do I do this? Release A when it's safe. He's gonna. I gotta release. <laughs> no, we're good. Jeez, oh, I couldn't really tell what the, the safety looked like there. Just wait for him to walk away a little. I'm sorry. I guess. I'm sorry. Oh, little piggy dog. <laughs> There they go. It's actually a board. <laughs> Don't be an asshole. Come on. At least we gave her a good story to tell her pig husband. How do you know it was the mommy pig? Mm, I got a pretty good look. Ew. I think she was coming on to me. Aww. 
Got yourself a little girlfriend. Can we she just a little stray away from <laughs> relationships in general, please? Uh, I've, I'm just getting uncomfortable at this point. I don't, I don't need to know any of this. Please. Guess we should head back. All's well. Nothing bad happened. Apparently we missed a tarot card. Something creepy going on over there too. Hackett's quarry. How you doing, Caitlin? Finally get my phone back and it's just a big dumb brick. I used to look around. Uh take a photo. Can I zoom or anything? Just get a nice picture there. No, I feel like we should probably take that in. Hey, Caitlin. Guess what? Mr. H is a voyeuristic creep. He has hidden cameras everywhere and a secret room. No, that's not... Uh, whoa, now. Back up. What? His eyes are everywhere. He's always watching us. Look it off, man. He he's just got trail cameras set up, you know, forest surveillance, that kind of thing. Oh, you don't think that's weird? Well, he's got a perimeter to check, kids to protect. You know, probably just a. Oh, yeah, also, when the cameras went offline, no I figure like so, uh, attacked it. What's going on here? No reason. Everything ready? The weird light in the treehouse. Uh, I did see a weird light in the treehouse across the lake. Yeah, that was pretty spooky. Maybe it's your girlfriend, Brian. The Hag of Hackett's Quarry. I told you never to say Hag of Hackett's Quarry again. What's wrong with saying Hag of Hackett's Quarry? Are you done? I feel like a lot of the reviews of this game will mention you know, the Hag of Hackett's Quarry. I just realized we may never see each other again after Repeatedly. tonight. You can't have just realized that. Just trying to set the mood. What mood? The mood, the vibe, you know. Speaking of setting the mood, I have work to do, okay? Because playlists don't make themselves. I mean, I guess they do, but... All right, right guy. Time to get wood. Yikes. Wording. Oh, I know what I said. <laughs> How many lines Abby, of dialogue Nick, have we gone without some kind of innuendo? We wood. <laughs> We've already done or that a connection joke. being made by these kids. I, I, just I feel, I want to say seven. There's already a big pile <laughs> like, of logs here. I don't think it's been many. We could have gotten more, but there was a hog or a boar. But Nick was very, very brave and took one for the team. Are you okay? Uh, are you sure you guys are okay? Nobody got gored? We're okay. It wasn't a bullfight or anything. Though I think Nick did make a new girlfriend. Oh, do tell. Oh! oh. Special delivery! Did you fire the gun? Whoa, whoa, whoa! Where the hell Why did the that hell gun would you do from? that? Dude, relax, okay? It's not even real. Uh. Well, I mean, it's a real gun, but it's just for shooting bears. Found it in Why would you just shoot the gun? Okay, fine, fine. We'll put it down. Thank you. Guns are no joke, dipshit. And and. We bring you a hand-picked selection of only the finest that Hackett's Quarry has to offer. No freaking way. Yes, freaking way. Pop, pop, peanut butter, butter pops. Pop, pop, pop them in your mouth. Pop. This is terribly upsetting. Okay, let's carry on. Pop. I didn't even know you could still find these anyway. Oh, hey, hey. Cool your jets there, cowboy. All right, these are spoken for. Dude, you can't just shove those in my face and not expect me to want to pop, pop, pop them in my mouth. Come on. Emma, please hand me the shotgun. What, you're going to shoot me over them? 
No, dumbass. Okay, we are going to shoot for them. Why? Why can't no. you just share? Absolutely not. No. That's, that's not a great idea. Like, but if I mock, right? I don't think I'm gonna get true. But if I go stern, it's like, okay, Mister No Fun. Please, for the love there of God. There is no way I'm leaving you dillweeds alone with a gun. Oh, come on, look, the shooting range is like right over there, okay? It'll be fun. Okay, look, you and me, old-fashioned shootout. First prize, peanut butter butter pops, all to yourself. These peanut butter butter pops Dude, aren't worth it. I guess you don't really want them then, huh? These kids are so stupid. Fine, you're on. Yeah, boy! Jacob, hand me that gun now. I mean, nobody's handling any firearms if you're gonna act like a dick about okay, it. Okay, then you can be the ref. We need an objective third party. Okay, we're trying to get a party started here, Jacob. Okay, well, the main party's not gonna die just because you're off on a little side quest. Come on. Please. All right. Yeah, no. An old fashioned shootout. <laughs> Look, there's a clearing we can use as a shooting range back there, but if I see the happy music should around, not be playing. I need to bring this car around. Oh, oh they're man. so stupid. What's with the happy-go-lucky music, too? It's like so random. Okay, so anyone just can tell so us you know, idea. I was an expert marksman, <clears throat> third class, three years in a row, ranked highest in camp each year. I'm just letting you know that your goose is cooked, Nick. But if you back down now, I might let you just have one little peanut butter butter pop if you're lucky. No way. You've never even seen me shoot. Yeah, that's because you've never shot before. Yeah, not that you know of. <laughs> okay, I I've think killed I'm a man, Jacob. Okay, boys, I'm gonna have to stop you right there. As much as I'm enjoying your charming machismo, the moment we step foot on the shooting range, we're going by my rules, okay? And what I say goes. Got it? Okay, good. Now I'm gonna go set up some targets and get more shells. Do not move a muscle or touch his gun until I'm back. All right, so oh, it's stop just splitting me. up in the woods. Like I'm always hot, pencil. Yeah, deck. okay, thank you. Bye, bye. Stop going this direction of conversation. So, um, how's your little one on one with Abby in the woods? Just take the gun. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I don't want you being hopeful. Yeah, <laughs> I don't. Fun. How was your little one on one with Emma? Oh, dude, it's incredible. She's totally still into me. Really? Yeah. Just gotta figure out this whole long distance thing. Is that what she wants? I want to know what she wants. Well, I mean, you could ask her. <laughs> I <could> that's, <laughs> that's funny. Well, speaking of, let me show you how a real man shoots his gun. Are you guys seriously still thumping your chest at each other? No, I think he's got brain damage. <laughs> okay, please. Kay just Caitlin's the like, most uh, sensible character you'll here have it by when far. I say you'll have it. All right, huddle up, boys. This is how we're going to do this. You're Even if everyone else left. dies, we want Nick her first, alive. Then Jacob's turn. Like, please. Keep your fingers off the trigger till you're ready to shoot. You got it? Aye, aye. All right. Two things. Remember the spread, remember the recoil. This is a shotgun. We're not sharpshooting here. The flashlight shows you where Oh, no. <laughs> the combat tutorial's been unlocked. I'm sorry to have to say, there may well be times during your stay at Hackett's Quarry where you'll have to defend yourself using potentially deadly force. When engaging in combat, simply aim your weapon and shoot where the flashlight is pointed. Okay. Take note, if you're up close and personal with your target, you'll do more damage. The farther away, the larger the spread. Oh, okay. And injuries may not be fatal. There's a time and place for the use of weapons, and you may want to consider all your options. Remember, it's not always wise to pull the trigger. That's how people get hurt. Okay, so proximity is key. For the love of God, don't shoot everything. Ops.
just can't believe we're doing this. All right, Nick, one point. Okay, we're two. Keep nature in balance too. Yeah, don't shoot squirrel. a squirrel. And uh, fuck these guys up. But we just got <laughs> these watermelons, and now we're just shooting them. All right, Nick. This time for real. I just turn around. <laughs> Nice shot. I'm lucky. Let's get the bottles. I can get every single one. Point to you, Nick. Good job, Nick. All right. Let's see what you got. I want to just take control right. of them and just you might want to, uh, shoot at a tree or something. Eyes, Nick. I don't want to give you any more performance anxiety. Uh, all right, all right. Just shut up and shoot, Jacob. Huh. I thought you were an ultra elite pro marksman. Yeah, with like a rifle. Whoa, okay? oh. what are you doing? Whoa, Jesus. <laughs> shot. Nah, it's okay. You idiot, Jacob. Hey. Okay, disqualified for being a dumbass. What? No. Like, Jesus Christ, that's the one thing you don't do. That's the one thing you don't do. Oh my god. Butter pops theme. Ooh, what's that Jaggy, huh? Huh? Pop, pop. Peanut butter, butter okay, pops. Okay, I get. I regret this dialogue decision. Okay, let's carry on. I get it. I get it. Jacob doesn't like losing. That's too Blame. fucking bad, Jacob. She just destroyed them, as she rightfully should. <laughs> Wasted all the ammo. Go, Emma. Is it Emma or Caitlin? Real quick, I keep because I keep forgetting. It's Caitlyn, is it? Yeah, he, here's the gang: Caitlyn, Abigail, Dylan, Emma, Jacob, Nick, Ryan. Okay. Emma's the influencer. Okay. Just trying to make that. Yeah, just trying to clarify that because. Caitlyn, we really want to survive. And then I'm kind of indifferent about it. Jacob could die, everyone else shouldn't die. Caitlyn, we want to get out of here. Abigail, I think we want to get out of here. Okay. New idea. The rest of them. <laughs> uh, Come on, people, we might never see each other after tonight. Let's make some memories. Well, what do you have in mind? How about the ultimate game of secrets and lies, truth or dare, but Dylan style? Mm. Okay, house rules are someone asks you truth or dare, then you choose. They're supposed to be and standing inside right now. Do. And there's no ifs, ands, or buts. So, like, normal truth or dare? Yes. So we can, like, make people kiss? If they choose dare, yeah. As long as everyone consents, of course. Cool beans. It's important. I mean, keep it in your pants until it's your turn, but... Well, who does get to go first? Well, it's house deals, I wish none of this so... was happening at all, but... <laughs> Abigail. Truth or dare? Um... Sure. You really dodged a bullet, huh? All right, here goes. Have you ever slept with him? Oh my god! Oh, I, uh, I. <laughs> Fucking gang. Interrupt. Hey, take it easy, man. That's too far. Yeah, I didn't know Come who I was on. playing. I, I'm not finished. Um, 
Have you ever <laughs> slept with anyone at this camp? <laughs> no. Nope. Sorry. All right, Abby, it's your turn. <laughs> All oh, right. Okay. Um. Uh, Abby. Oh my God. God. Just pick someone. Okay. Okay. Um. What's going on with Nick? Uh, I don't know. Ugh. Ding ding ding. Too late. My turn. Ryan. Truth or dare. Go for truth. Truth. I'm an open book. Okay, okay. Let's get right down to it. Let's do. You and Mr. Hackett. Here we go. What were you doing in his office? Um. Being mischievous here might be good because it infers some information about the hag. Uh, but I don't want to spook him out. Like we, I need to keep these kids alive. I really need to keep these kids alive. <laughs> well, I know what you're fishing for, but it's actually super boring. If you must know, I needed some life advice. Advice, huh? Oh, whoa, whoa, M. Um, okay, I got this. Okay, so uh, if you go to settings, <laughs> there's an option called incognito mode. And if you press go that- Go fuck yourself. No. Yeah. Life advice about school. And that's no fair. I've, I've already answered my question. Maybe we can help. Uh, I don't know. You've all got your own shit going on. Besides, I figured just the He's mention the worst. of school would cause We wouldn't be in this situation so. without him. Whoa. Dude, what the hell did I do? Alrighty. Who shall I pick? Well, uh, me and Jacob haven't gotten a turn yet. Good point. I don't want to ask Jacob anything. <laughs> Caitlin, what do you say? Truth or dare? Truth. Yeah, truth. Let's see. Ever hook up with Jacob? Nope. What'd you want to be when you grew up? When you were a kid, what did you want to be when you grew up? Uh, that's kind of a boring question. Got to an answer. <laughs> well, the answer is, I don't know. That's the truth. Sorry. Not, this is a very sober oh, party you were having. Nope. What? I smell bullshit. Okay, fine. You got me. I wanted to be a street performer. <laughs> no way. Well, um... <laughs> a street performer? You mean like... Actually, it's a fun answer. Like... No, asshole. Like a mime or, you know, one of those statue guys Jacob, that stop. give him a dollar. Fucking hell. Caitlin is a mime? Yeah, no, I just can't imagine that. Thanks, Ryan. Well played. Now it's my turn. Emma. There. Emma, so you have to Caitlin, kiss. no! You're the good child. Jacob? Or... You like it oh. with my Nick. Uh. Well then. Um. Uh. Sorry, Nick. This is not uh, even there, obviously. I don't know if that's a good this. idea. I choose Nick. Oh. Oh no. 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 Stop this. Someone intervene. Someone, please. No. Em, seriously? <laughs> no one likes Jacob. Oh, this is horrible. Guys. <laughs> Abigail is pissed. Uh, okay, they're both, they're both awful. Guys. They deserve each other. Hate them both. Thank you, Nick. Caitlin and Abigail, we're gonna save you. Baby Ryan. He's good. You like kissing my girlfriend, asshole? It was just a game. Hey, I am nobody's <laughs> girlfriend. The fuck it was? It was just a game. Yeah, the fuck it was, man. Jacob, we need you out of here. Jacob, grow up. 
Well, I guess I should probably... Just get them all gone. Get, get them all out of here. <laughs> you should probably go find Abby. So, anybody want to play Bargeezy? What? Not the time, Caitlin. <laughs> How did they not notice these people here? How did they not see them? They're so close. Carol's sick of this as well. Oh, we didn't get any cards again. Welcome back. I am, <laughs> as always, delighted that you're here. Oh, I don't so know if I'm going to be able to save these kids. What more has been found? You return without <laughs> no. any more of my cards. Yet you return nonetheless. Why is that, do you think? I can't help you without the cards. I want them found. I want them returned to me. Please, my friend. Hag, we're trying. <laughs> we just... That's all I have to say for now. We've not had much luck. The secrets remain buried and the night grows darker. I'll see you again. You can count on that. Be careful. Where the wolves go, the ravens follow. Where the wolves go, the ravens follow. Okay, is that like... If you see a raven go in the direction where we don't follow the raven because there's wolves? I don't know how to read that metaphor. But things are getting worse. Stupid. Abigail, you shouldn't have got off on your own. Middle school? Why should I even care? Anyway, I can kiss anybody. Stupid. Stupid. Great. Where the hell am I? This was not your brightest move, Abigail. Oh, I hate this. I've had nightmares like this. Like, no, no joke. Look for the card. I can work out where I am in relation to the river. I think I know where I was and where I have to go to get back. Back in the Shady Glen, yeah? Does it want me to go there? I think it does. Go to the ranger box. I didn't see the ranger box. <laughs> this is not good. <laughs> oh, thank God. If I call back, I have to. Nick! Abby? Shout again! I'm over here! I'm coming, coming! Nick! Thank God. They're not alone. Hey. Hey. Um. Hi. They're well, not alone. You ran off. Stay together. Got a little intense. I think that game just got a little too intense for me. Okay. Yeah, I know what you mean. 
Yeah, Nick, you were you were a real asshole there. <laughs> Should we just be direct? I'm so sick of managing these kids' relationships. <laughs> God, look, I, don't, I want nothing to do with this. I just want you... I don't want them dead. There's so much drama. Just be direct. Guess Emma's had a thing for you all along, huh? <laughs> what? I... No, 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 no way. <laughs> she was just trying to make Jacob jealous. I was just. This is what I mean. Like, I don't care about this. You seem to enjoy playing along. I enjoyed helping Emma make Jacob. Listen, you're all gonna go to different colleges That's anyway and try long distance. It. it won't work out, and you'll all break up, right? Yeah, just strip. Fuck it. Like, who cares? <laughs> Nick is falling for you. I hope neither of you die here. Did you hear that? Mm hmm. Should we look? Mm hmm. Uh oh. We, we really need to go. I don't think this is another pig. Like, why are they just walking towards it? Did you hear like a bear cry? We should approach it. Oh my god, you're kidding me. <laughs> Gotta get Nick! Hide him up. Hide it is not working well. <laughs> Go on, Abby. Climb the tree? Go! Go! No, I shouldn't have done that. This is getting more and more precarious. Wait, wait, oh, mash it! The situation is getting infinitely worse. <laughs> we need to get Nick still.
Oh my god. Hold it. It really looks like she's trying to suppress a laugh. You're good. No! She's okay. She's not dead. I thought it might have been scripted. Way too soon. A fun game. <laughs> oh no! Wait, how does that? Okay, how does the whole the Brett mechanic work then? She opened her eyes, and it seemed like yeah, we're in the clear. Can I even say Nick? Wait until the red on the edge of the screen goes away. I thought it was going red because I'm holding my breath. You have to wait for the surroundings and sounds to be clear as well. Ah, oh, fuck! <laughs> oh, these kids aren't doing well. Okay. I'm just gonna hold my breath as long as I can in future, right? Is Nick dead? Is that no? He's still here, so apparently. Yeah, I feel like the game's unclear on that mechanic. If you hold too long, you'll take a deeper breath and give yourself away. That's the thing, because I thought you had to hold it for, like, the ideal amount of time. Which it seemed to be it, because he went away. <laughs> this is why he's switched to the accessibility thing. I, I'm honestly tempted to. Hang on. Don't breed. Don't be automatically succeed. <laughs> okay, I feel like that's a bit much. That that actually is cheating. That that's straight up cheating. Journalist mode. <laughs> ah, no, I can't. I can't do that. Oh fuck, like, th that mechanic- I'm gonna watch the tutorial again. That mechanic feels so unclear. You're in danger. Hunted by a creature of indeterminate origin. Don't breathe. You need to stop breathing. Tricking the beast into taking you for nothing but a corpse. Okay, so the bar and goes right. fun in hunting then which is already dead. Watch the visuals alter or listen to the sound change as the threat approaches. When the danger is past, run. Pick the right moment and run so for your So red life. is danger. Be warned. Exhaling or running at the wrong time may just mark you as the creature's quarry. Yeah, that's Causing what happened to us, unfortunately. Okay. Uh, can, can I rewind that? I don't think I can. Oh, Jacob's been crying. <laughs> it's still really unclear, isn't it? You can try to rewind. I don't even know how to rewind the game. Honestly. Dil oh, no. <laughs> I became the Nick's aid at least. A 
Okay, no, we're gonna keep going. I just hope they're not dead. I hope they're not dead. And it's cutting me so deep, half a close. Now to burn up on the Jacob, no one cares about you. It's only worth it if it hurts. Listen to Ed Sheeran music after his friends die. <laughs> Take Not my Galway girl, Emma. Hey. Uh, yeah. Yes, you found that. Of course. <sighs> Sneaking down here was a little more fun when we thought we could get caught, huh? Yeah, yeah, I guess. Jacob, I thought we agreed that this, us, was just supposed to be some summer fun. Yeah, no, no. I know, I just... You're you both awful. Out of your mind, so. oh, Jacob. I mean, you. I can't believe you, like, you fucking Frenched him. You know, in front of everyone. Jesus wept. French, are we 12? No, but Nick is. Kind of. You know, I love the guy, but I don't think he's actually ever seen a girl naked before. Well, I hate to break it to you, but he just had his tongue down my throat, and he definitely knew what to do with it. <laughs> you, you I'm really not sad that Nick might be dead. Lighten up, Sarapus, please. This is not how the night was supposed to go. What? You know what? Nothing. No Nothing. Never mind. Jacob, yeah, yeah, Jacob's the worst of them all, though, because he got him into this situation. You can stand here. By sabotaging the car. Driving yourself crazy imagining Nick's tongue in my mouth. Oh, come on. Or you can go grab us some towels. What do you need towels for? Well, we agreed. Some are fun, right? Apparently. Oh, you're the worst, Emma. Is not quite. There's a tarot card here. That's all I care about now. Okay. <laughs> I don't give a shit about the relationship drama. Where's the card? Please. Sex will fix this. No, it won't. <laughs> oh, no. What the fuck are you? Oh my god. Thank you. Oh, please. Pl no. Where did it go? The camera angle changed. Oh, why would you do that? Wait. Where's the fucking carrot gun? Next to the boats. How do I get it? Pick it up. Oh my god, I'm gonna scream. I can see it! Pick up the damn card! Oh, okay, right. That's how you're supposed to pick it up. Not go over to the card like a logical person. Use fucking magic and is in your wallet. Okay. No swim inside. Oh, they're gonna die because there's a monster in the yeah, we'll water. We'll see about that. 
These kids are so stupid. I I'm trying to save them. Snack wrapper. Check it and thack it, huh? Oh, well, check it must mean Mr. H. Chris Hackett. Beta cam photograph from the 1970s. According to the names printed below, two of the, bo two of the boys in the picture appear to be Hackett's. Who the hell is Thackett? Damn kids, is there anything up here? It's like you're playing that dad simulator where all the babies keep trying to hurt themselves no matter how hard you try. <laughs> Nick, don't put the fork in the electrical socket. No, Nick. No, Jacob, you're not supposed to play with the oven like that. Zero. You dick. What the hell? Just get back down here, Jacob. No tiles. Is there anything else? Hmm. What are these numbers? Manageable but unsustainable. Oh, please actually look at it a little. Silent rules. Remember for counselors. Be vigilant. No swimming. Properly store boats to avoid damage. All campers must wear life jackets. If boats capsize, remove kids from lake immediately. Do not jump in after them. Sail over and retrieve from water. Okay, so that's like a, like, yeah, like hack. Mr. H knows everything that's going on here. Being that strict about no swimming when like someone is literally drowning, get the boat. He's absolutely aware of what's going on. Oh, there's going to be a jump scare here with the binoculars. Brace yourselves. Br brace yourselves. It's going to happen. That's something on the water there. Any moment now, someone's going to come out and say boo. <laughs> no one cares about you. I heard the ominous music, but I didn't see what it was. Scary lamp, like that's what it sounds like. <laughs> oh, my God. Okay, well, we have no towels. I can't wait for I have to save one of you stupid kids from drowning. Are any snacks in the fridge? At least wear a life jacket. Like someone's gonna yoink her. Yeah, like you can see it coming a mile away. Someone's going down under the water. Okay, well, this is I such a we bad idea. Like drip dry, or and you could shake it out doggy style. Wow, you really know how to talk to a girl, don't you? I hate you both. Look, you can't just pretend that it didn't happen. Fucking PS2 oh, has water I physics. Can. Did you see that? You <laughs> see? Oh, help! Help! I'm, I'm drowning and I, I need a big, strong, not at all insecure man to come save me. <laughs> He's just naked! <laughs> Wait! I just fucking cut. <laughs> what? 
Oh, just go. Yeah, just fucking cannonball. Who cares? Okay. Where did his clothes go? This, a female in need? Fear not, fragile thing, for Hurricane Jake is here. Cannonball! <laughs> Let's get some nice campfire music going again. Oh, okay. Okay. The, the water is it. oil. Switch. <laughs> 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 oh, stop. Uh, Anyone remember the PlayStation 2? Don't splash. Don't make noise. <laughs> this is a terrible idea. Dick move. I don't want I oh here's the fucking smile returning. I'd rather just this. I don't want a photo of this moment. Like, I don't want this to end. <laughs> I'd be happy to stay out here all summer, but I think we'd get a little prune. Oh, you know what I mean, like this. Jacob, I had a great summer with you. Well, it doesn't just have to be this summer. <laughs> Jacob. Okay, oh, look, how about this? Um, <clears throat> if I can do a backflip off of here, you let me come visit you, okay? How about that? This is like if you're right. seven. Hey! If I can hold my breath for come on. two minutes, we get cake for dinner. Oh no. Are you fucking kidding me? No, 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 no. Oh. Fuck, 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 fuck. Oh, help Abby. Emma! Jacob, over here! Did you hear that? What? Uh, it was like a, like a scream. And it, it sounded like Abby, but like not the good kind of scream. I can't hear Why was that in his underwear? Look, just, just hold on. I'm gonna go check it out. What? Seriously? I'm also going to help out because I don't really care if Emma gets pulled underwater at this point. <laughs> Wait, I know we need the arm, right? I know we need it, but I don't want Abigail to be dead. She's like one of the two good characters we've got. It's her and Caitlyn. That's it. Still being called out here. Do better. That was some mighty fine social disruption there, Caitlin, I have to say. Ah, or was it just the nudge that Abby needed? You're an evil genius. Who do you think is going to make the first move? Nick or Abby? Ooh, good cue. My bet's on either. I don't know. Nick's got the beast in him. Uh, if by beast you mean some sort of mild-mannered baby deer. Hey, don't let the cute, preppy aesthetic fool you. It's like a steel barbecue grill under that shirt. <laughs> so you noticed that too, huh? Can we can we so, stop having these conversations? Now? We can keep playing. Yeah, just the three of us. All right, Dylan. Truth or? Oh, because the gunshot was oh not gosh. Caitlin. Uh, we gotta help her. <laughs> Wait, where did it come from? I was thinking it might have been. This way. Come on. That wasn't her. Abby! Help! Please! Nick! Help him! Okay, where's Nick? Where's Nick? Go 
after Nick. Go. Uh, we gotta just do it. Fine. Okay, I got this. Ryan and Caitlin are gonna keep this gang alive. That shotgun's got a hell of a spread. Be careful. Oh, don't. Okay, don't kill Nick with the shotgun. Like, that's foreshadowing right there. Do not get Nick killed with the shotgun. Take the shortcut. We learned this from Until Dawn. You gotta be like the action hero here. Come on. Come on. You're alright. You're alright. Take the shortcut. God, it gives you that direction so late. Don't trip. Okay, he's all right. He's alive. Wait, no, that's that's not Ryan. Shout at him. Hey, get the fuck off of him! Stop! Stop! I'll shoot. I can't shoot. I can't shoot. I'll kill Nick. I can't shoot. It's got really bad spread. There we go. Okay, we can shoot him now. What? Oh no, that means it's like Holy werewolves shit, or something. Gotta get, we gotta go. Oh no. Come on, let's get back to the fire. Okay, right. That means trouble for Abigail. What are you doing? <laughs> no! He hasn't got anything! Oh, Jesus. There's a half naked girl waiting for you back there, Jacob. What are you doing? Okay. <laughs> what are you doing? Oh, Jacob's dead. I'm gonna try save him. Okay. Fucking Tarzan here, going through the jungle. Uh, I'm gonna try save him. Do not call out. Hello? 
Why are you calling out? What? I told you not to! This can't be good. Ah! Shit! Oh no. Be kind. Please, I don't think that was for please, me. Man, just, just let me down, okay? Just don't hurt me, please. Oh, Jesus Christ, what the fuck are you doing? It's not much I can do here. He's helping me. Okay, thank God. Son of a bitch. Who is this man? Oh, what are you doing? Shh. Quiet. I, I trust him. All right, I'm going to trust him. Helps if you close your eyes. Oh, oh. What are you doing? Shh. Stop. Help. Shh. Help. Tastes bad, don't it? It's for your own good. He knows more about the situation than us. Where are you off to now, girly? It's John scene. <laughs> John's gonna save what us. The fuck? What the fuck? He was hunting the boar. Yeah. He just left. Oh, we got a card. <laughs> Can we save Seems Abigail? Like just a blink and you're back to see me again. So, then, what have we got? It's star. the star. Stars, stars in the night, sky, beacons of light. Give us something good, please. Dreams of hope, purpose. Or a reminder of our insignificance. Fear of despair. Trust in the light of the star. With it comes clarity. And sometimes truth. Remember, there's always more than meets the eye. Would you like me to show you? Please do. See more. the fuck was that? Back to it then. Back to Hackett's Quarry. Back to Hackett's Quarry you go. Oh, the fun you'll have. She took a picture. Now, okay, wait. So wait one moment, right? The last warning showed a car fire, right? And that was because... Possibly more. The last war hint was basically, do not set the car on fire. Because there was a way of doing that before. But is that fortune telling me to take the picture or not? That, I, I don't understand. Because the last one specifically was not. The last one was don't take it. This is a recommendation to have evidence. Yeah, they have been encouraged in taking pictures, I guess. Oh, but that's going to lead to a horrible scenario for one of my characters. The fool have been the card to describe what not to do. Okay, whereas the star is... Yeah, okay, so this is like a good fortune. Beacons of light. 
Trust in the light of the star. With it comes clarity. Who's that? That's Emma, yeah? That's just a picture of the monster. Where is that location? I have no idea. Doesn't like the flash. Is that not Emma? Has to be Emma. Yeah, that's Emma. Okay. All right. It was. It was. I. I don't. Chapter four. Don't panic. And there was a. There was a hunter, and it was just. Oh, Abby. Here. What? Oh, try drawing. Drawing what? Oh, can you draw what attacked you? No, oh, Abby's been bit now as well. Because the fucking game mechanics. <laughs> I don't think we can save Nick. I think he's gone. Nick, hey, buddy. Can you tell us what happened? I'm a little attacked. Where's Abby? He's super out of it, man. We need to know what happened. All right. There was... There was a guy there, but... There was some kind of... Some kind of animal... The hell? What fucking kind of animal does this? Is Abby? Yeah, hey, she, hey, she's okay, dude. She's right over there. We're good there. Teeth were on top of me. I think it was a bear. I don't think that was a bear, so Nick. No crush him. There's no way. I thought we don't get bears right here. Oh fuck. Look at that. Oh shit. That black stuff? That's that's infection. That's and it's it, it's spreading. This is bad. This is really bad, dude. Do I apply pressure? <laughs> uh, sorry. sorry. <laughs> Wound 101? Has anyone got an axe? You're okay. It's okay. Oh, fuck that. We should amputate. <laughs> what? Oh my god. We should god. cut it off before the infection spreads. They're already jumping what? to that. Why? Why would we do that? Why would we do that? Man, look at that black stuff. What what do you think it is? Do I look like a doctor? Tim, why are you stressed him to amputate the leg? I know you're right, but still, you can't. It was way too fast. Call it this time. Hey! You got a gun! And I know how to use it! Sort of. Might be the stranger. Might be Jacob. Ryan, what if it's Jacob or Emma? What if it's not? Be careful. Oh, God. It was probably nothing. I'd not yeah. see him. But is it gone? Yeah, you better run. Very brave. All right. So, uh, Lodge is sounding pretty good right about now, yeah? Uh oh. Do I shoot? Do I shoot? Pause the game. I'm a little scared. I'm a little anxious. 
But it really could just be Jacob. It really could just be Jacob. <laughs> Wait a minute. If it's Jacob, then I shoot either way. Fucking fuck! <laughs> what the hell, man? You almost shot me. I didn't know it was you. Sorry. Jesus Christ, what the fuck is wrong with you? Holy shit. Nick. Is he okay? Nick and Abby were attacked. In the woods. Hey, does anybody Jacob, know close why didn't you say anything? Bags are still in the minivan. <laughs> Of course they are. Ah, uh, I don't care about you. Where's Emma? Jacob, where's Emma? Oh, fuck! Oh, Jesus Christ! Um, I I left Emma on the island, and I told her I'd be right back. Ouch! Wait, the island? Yeah. Why? Oh no! I just, I just. I thought I saw someone over there before. Someone? No, I, you know, I, I don't know. It's, it's probably nothing. God, I left her out there alone. Well, I think we're going to head to the lodge. Also, why are you covered in what I hope is strawberry jelly? It's not strawberry jelly. Oh, yeah, jelly. no. Um, I'm pretty sure it's blood. There was this guy with like a, he had like a bottle. Thing. I don't know, dude. It's like a really long story. Ew. Yeah, no, oh, it's super fucked up. Got a big smile. I gotta go get Emma. Uh, excuse me. Hey, I need this, okay? It's not safe. No, you don't. Dude, we gotta protect Nick and Abby. Yeah, and I need to save Emma, all right? She's out there alone. You don't even know if she's in trouble. You don't even know if you're in trouble. Are you trying to piss me off? No, I'm trying to save my girlfriend's life, asshole. Yeah, I don't think she's your girlfriend, dude. What? Stop playing with the gun. Oh my god. Oh, I don't want to let go of this. I need the gun, but... There we go. Yeah, give it to Caitlyn. Fucking stop! We're in a real mess here, guys. You're acting like pricks. Both of you. Jacob, we're keeping this. Nick and Abby are injured. We need protection. There's someone around here. <laughs> Ryan! Sorry. What was that noise? This is bullshit! Make sure she's safe. If she's on the island, she's definitely fine. He's not and even going to get, like, run -in with Captain shoes Deliverance. or anything? No thanks, okay? There's probably another boat by the zipline. Either way, I can make it to the island from there. They're going to, like, put on some pants or something, dude? Like, we, we've closed here. How? Nick can't walk properly. Wait, I have an idea. We all better. Probably actually need it. Yeah, but no one cares about Jacob. <laughs> Look, he got it. He got his like good blood. See what tonight brings. Oh, what the fuck is Emma doing? Don't tell me your okay. TikTok. Here's a riddle for you. What's got two thumbs and is suddenly riding solo on a freaky island in the dark? This fool. <laughs> well, one thumb, one available thumb. Okay. And it was here. On a strange, uninhabited island that this brave young soul found Stop herself. making content. Oh, it's totally werewolves. Okay, full disclosure. I've suddenly found myself on a, a strange, tiny little island all alone with nothing to do but show you guys around. So, there's a treehouse over there. I'm going to go and see if I can't dish out some of that sweet, sweet panoramic goodness. Because here's the thing, not that I want to go back because I don't, but even if I did, I can't because then I'd look like the super needy one when he was the one who, who stormed off in the first place. God, what know, is this I'm camera work? Oh, I've never understood this for most you know, vlogs okay. or TikToks Let's in general. To the treehouse, fellow explorers. Is it supposed to like make it more dynamic? Why like y'all like, just hold the camera fucking still? <laughs> no. <laughs> Oh, one sec as well. I gotta eh, do a thing in my end real quick. There we go. Give me one sec. 
Yeah, we're good. You're supposed to, like, sit down and hold it up steadily. Why doesn't she put her clothes back on? I don't know. She just left them. Oh, they're gone. It's for the dynamics. People get all bored when it stays still too long. Isn't that, like, just tricking people into making it more interesting than it actually is? Well... I just walk on back. Oh, let me know if there's a tarot card around here, too. That you, Jacob? Oh, that's Carol. What? Do, how did you lose sight of him? He's not fucking Houdini. Like, pay attention. <laughs> Was there a card there? Oh, hang on one second at my end. Just real quick. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Guys, I'll just be one second. I just gotta quickly go get something. I'll be right back. Be right back two minutes. Hey, old folks. Sorry for the apparent jump scare every time I come back. I just have to get something there. Oh, let me take another sip of water, too. How y'all doing? Oh, God. Yeah, I'm going to try open up the chat again, too, right? Because I don't like having it on sub mode. It's almost just like necessity sometimes that I do it. Don't, just don't be weird, right? Just don't, don't just start like spamming shit. <laughs> okay, we'll give you this a go. Be good, okay? I like keeping the chat open. I hope people understand why I have, have to ha pop that on, uh, sometimes. You're all good. Okay, well, let's keep, let's keep going. Let me, let me get my alerts back. I hope everyone's enjoying the playthrough. I'm going to be honest. So far, first impressions. This is no until dawn. <laughs> this game has problems. Some technical, some just, I think, to do with the characters. It's starting to get better, though. 
It's starting to get better. Technical problems, there's no excuse. I don't have any sympathy for it. Like, why can't I turn off motion blur? Fix your performance shit, you know? There's no excuse for that. Um, oh my god, can the characters stop talking about their relationships for like two minutes? Because they did that in Until Dawn to a bit. But it took the back seat very quickly. Compared to like the main plot of the game. It's a lot. I, I can't keep track of the triangles happening here. What's wrong with that? I don't care about these characters' love lives. I don't care how they're making constant dick jokes. <laughs> you know? It makes me rooting for the demise. Like, Jacob, I just kind of hate him. It's not a triangle, it's a sphere. Okay, there's probably a card out here somewhere. This is definitely the place where I was to take like a picture. Of something. Oh, the screen, sorry. Hang on. Whoops, a professional streamer. Okay. Let's do one more thing. There we go. Okay. Uh, we're looking for a tarot card. Like, we, we seriously need them at this point. At the dock. Okay. You guys can see the screen now, yeah? Is it all the way back here? I just didn't see it, if so. They seem way harder to spot compared to like... I like, that's the thing, like... How am I supposed to uncover that? I have to just stand in the correct spot and if the camera doesn't pan to it, I'm not gonna find it. Yeah, that, that's rough. I kind of prefer it with the totems just being on the ground. Magician. Receptive manipulation, the work of a magician. Now you see it, now you don't. Blink and you miss it. The ravens are hints for the cards. I I didn't see a single raven there. Yeah, it's just the bet the light. The crow even. The crows are ravens. I thought they were crows. There was some crow noise, I think. Oh, okay, so it's like an audio cue, is it? Right. I think I prefer just finding the totem. No prizes for guessing what these are. Can't say that I've used them. A little too au natural for me, TBH. I hate it. You know, I've never thought about where the waste goes. Oh. Well, please, God, no. Okay. We're gonna just go ahead and ignore that. What was that? Just where the- Oh, cause the waste goes in the river, right. That's probably why they say no swimming. I can't get in this house, I think. And this have a lovely is seat. the meeting shelter. It's a shelter where you meet at. Okay, I'm trying really hard to make this interesting, but sometimes a thing just is Stop what it is. Stop vlogging, please. I think I made my point. 
You're talking when you have nothing to say. So this island is like Squirrel. an unexcavated part of the quarry that rewilded itself after it flooded into the lake. Pretty cool, huh? You know, when He's I was an little, influencer dad, and that's all I they can do. That islands just kind of would that's float in the middle of the water, kind of like an airbed. But I'm older and wiser now, and realize that not everything's always as it seems. Kind of like how you thought you were just having a hot summer fling, and then it turns into babysitting a big hairy man child. Why would you vlog sad. this? Maybe you don't want to go steady with him and write him. Oh, you're the worst kind of influencer. You're, you're one of the drama you influencers. About it, right? This doesn't even Why? matter. Why is it up to me to justify my feelings when he's the one who got all blah about it, you know? <sighs> oh my god, I don't want to save you. Oh, look. A metaphor in the narrative. I mean, a fork in the road. How fitting. Here's the big question. Do I take the high road, literally, and forget about it? Or do I continue on the path I'm on and... The high road. Absolutely the high road. Stop talking. I guess since this isn't live, the choice is up to me. Up we go. Okay, moving up in the world. Let's do this. Now you might notice the darling rustic vibes this walkway is radiating, and that's no accident. I don't know what y'all are doing with your walkways, but if you're not spending a full hour pulling a splinter out of a snotty kid's finger, don't you dare call it authentic. Don't worry, the kid was fine. I'm a good counselor. And what doesn't kill you will make you stronger. Her phone battery's gonna run out. <laughs> His stupid, stupid person. Did you even see that? I, I probably didn't see something. I probably missed like a ghost in the background because I'm so upset at her vlogging. <laughs> oh god, okay, there's the house that we gotta get to. Did someone hear a car? Cause that can be a tarot card. I, I don't like how this game is doing the hints. No, I, I really don't. I heard a car. I, I don't see any cards. They could be down below. There's a car, yeah. This is where we're heading. Not too shabby. Well, literally is too shabby, but these views, oh man, you're gonna blow your tops. There's also a zip line, which eh, I guess you can watch me crap my pants on we'll that. We'll be thing. taking what the, the zip line to get out of here. I'm here, aren't I? I'm gonna carpe this DM so damn hard it won't know what hit it. But first, we gotta get there. And there's still so much to talk about. Is there him? I don't care what content you make for your stupid vlog. Oh, just turn your phone off. <laughs> like, I just don't care. Why does this matter? I don't even know. Oh my god. I hope, Abby's, I hope okay. Abby's okay. She ran off earlier. If you didn't see it, I kind of sort of made out with Nick. But it was a dare. I'm not like a big Who is this recording for? Oh, and for context, Abby likes Nick. Well, actually. Why would you upload like this? This is like a Facebook post where it's like too much information. I just wanted to fan the flames a little. Watching them you know, you know those angry Facebook posts where like someone will make it was like, Ugh! Just had a fight with my mom. She's so on my case. I just want to live my own life. That's what this is. Why the fuck is she recording this? 
No, this is no one's business. <laughs> Absolutely no one needs to know this. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> Get a diary or something. Yeah, like exactly. Like, you don't need to share this with the world. Is anybody dead? Unfortunately not. <laughs> oh my god. Tumble around each other like drunk jellyfish was exhausting. Poor kid was like a deer in headlights. It's cool though. They're smart. They'll get it. I bet they're out there in the woods right now. Just absolutely going for it. Because, like, they, they did the sort of semi-influencer thing in Until Dawn as well. Uh, with Josh. Because he's recording a lot of it. But there it's kind of like an after-the-fact thing. More than anything. Which I thought was, like, a much more interesting way of doing it. Still fucked in the head. But here, like... We're just vlogging. <laughs> Vlogging in the woods after hearing like a scream. We need to go back for the card. Oh, for the... do we really? Is there a card down there? No. no okay, let's just keep going. And here we are. As promised, one extremely I need to take a photo. and even more underwhelming Press the star. tree house. In another world, perhaps young Jacob and I would settle down here and play house together. Honey, I'm home. What's that now? I forgot the children's bedtime. Well now, that's a fine how do you do. Uh oh. Take it all in, folks. What's happening? That's the summer camp experience right there, and oh look. Oh, it's these things. Okay, all right, we're you fine. You to clear the place out. I guess one of the kids left their stuff, or maybe one of the guys back there. But I don't recognize this. Did you hear that? Oh no. Looks like we have a choice on our hands. Do we snoop through someone else's belongings, or do we open? The spooky trap door and die a horrible pain. You know, it doesn't sound that horrible anymore. <laughs> I need to open that trap door. I, I need to take a picture of this thing. And I kind of need to search the bag too. What should we do first? The fortune, yeah, the fortune said take a picture. I take it I do the bag first. The, the, the trap door will actually kill her. We need to keep her alive. I know she's insufferable. We're still trying to save these kids. These stupid, stupid kids. <laughs> okay, let's get the bag. Bag it is. And you know what? I'm putting some clothes on. This is all you're getting. There we go. What did she take there? Hmm. Taser. Fun. It might be handy. Okay, so I think there's something up there. <laughs> and it is not gonna make me jump, I can promise you that much. Hey guys, there's a burglar breaking into my home. I think I can hear him fumbling with the kitchen the back door. Ho oh, ho! How am I gonna get out of this one? Goodbye, cruel world. The final curtain is calling and there's no time for an encore. 
Take a picture! Take a picture! Wait, 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 wait! Neither of those are a picture. Neither of those. I don't think the bear spray is gonna help. I don't think it's a bear. Days of time. Take a picture. <laughs> Evidence collected. That's <laughs> whoa. I was getting a bit excited there. That's uh, that's cool off for a minute or two. A blurry close-up photo of Emma being attacked at the treehouse. Wow. What a precious memory to hold on to there. Good. L oh, I'm gonna have to quick time it. Come on. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Saving these stupid kids. Stop. I'm so scared. I'm so scared. I don't know what to do. Mason! <laughs> I need to do something. The bear spray attracts bears. It doesn't repel them. <laughs> Could you imagine if that's all it was for? <laughs> I was like a clump of fallen trees in the woods there. Better call the cavalry. <laughs> Bear allies. Okay, uh, yeah, I think we need to spray it. I need to slow him down. Stun him. Oh my god, go. The game is frozen. Okay, we're okay. Why did it load there? Uh, lock the door. There's a window right there! I need to start it again. Go, 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 <laughs> Jesus Christ. Oh, we're still alive. And the bears will save us soon. Easy. I got it. He's okay. They're on their way. Are you in pain? No, no, sorry, I'm just... I'm really hungry. We'll get you some food inside, okay? Yeah, okay. Come on, come on. Oh, man. I can eat a horse. <laughs> well, I don't know if we'll be able to find you a horse, but maybe some granola? Oh, no. Oh, yuck, I hate granola. The strength card. Did I get it? Wait, where the fuck am I? Oh, okay, right. I was there. This will open the nurse's station. Should be plenty of stuff in there. Well, hopefully we can just get him cleaned up for now. I'll get you something to eat.
You and I are gonna find a landline. Oh, uh, yeah. Um, isn't there one in Mr. H's office? Yup. We'll come meet you. Oh no, the ladder. Copy that. I think it has their scent. Um. I hope they're gonna be okay. Uh, be cautious. Do you think that whatever attacked them out there is, I don't know, has their scent or something? What? I don't know. Like, what if it got a taste for blood and now it's gonna track them down? I, I doubt it. I just feel like if we stick with them, we're sitting ducks. I don't know. I really don't think that whatever attacked them out in the woods is gonna get into the lodge. Okay, yeah. Yeah, you're, you're probably right. <sighs> Come on, let's go call for backup. We should it's really shut the door. So dead. You never came down here at night while camp was in session? What? No, did you? A couple times. We're just, yeah. gonna, we're just gonna leave that open. Oh, no, 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 Dylan, Dylan. Where are you going? I, 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 I thought I just heard my name. I didn't hear anything. Dylan, you need to stay with him. I don't think Nick's injuries are as bad as we thought. <laughs> are you kidding me? He's been fucking mauled. Yeah, he's, he's gonna be okay. Yeah. That's good news. We don't know that. No, it's true. Caitlin said. So all I'm saying is that we are not professionals. <laughs> what the fuck okay? is he we on about? Don't know. We he could have rabies or something. Way to be optimistic, man. I'm just being realistic. We gotta call for help. Brian's losing Who hope. Call? Oh no. Uh, Mr. H. The only number I got is to this phone. Okay, then ninety one one. You mean nine one one? Who says ninety one one? It's not the time. Uh -huh. Call the fucking anyway, police. Yeah, but like, what should I ask for? Like, police, ambulance? Huh. Like, get them both. Like, yeah, we need them both. Get the fucking Would fire brigade in. Specifically, ask for an ambulance, or can you just say like, "Help, help"? So they'll Call say, "Call the military." What's your emergency? And I'll say, "Help, help." My friend may have been attacked by a bear, or maybe not a bear, but definitely an animal with teeth. And he's been attacked by a sure person, and uh, he's injured. Right now. That'll yeah, get bold. And, or how smart they are, so they may be mounting an attack on us right now. So just like send a whole bunch of ambulances just to be sure. Injured and yeah, attacked. Yeah, that's, that's good. Okay. What's wrong? Dead. <laughs> Great. Well, that's weird. Phones go dead sometimes out here. Right when you're about to call the cops, though? It's a coincidence. Did you try the hang-up thingy? What? Here. He's so dismissive. Well, phones go dead. What are you doing? I don't know. It's what they do in movies when the phone goes dead. You tap on the little thingy. We're not in a movie. Okay. Well, you know, how do you know that? Maybe that's just what they want you to think. You right? gotta earn that meta reference, right? You gotta earn it. Okay, so you can't just do that. Go. No one has signal. You're it's not allowed to just break the fort wall. Has a landline. Well, not a landline. What? The radio hut has some old broadcast gear. Where, where you do your announcements? Where I curate my sweet summer jams, yeah, and where I do the PA announcements. It has some old equipment there. I think we could probably break something up and get a message out. All right, yeah. Let's, let's head over there and see if we can contact somebody. Put that back, Dylan. 
You you gotta be crazy. Like, uh, give me the gun. Like, we've just been mauled. Okay, be calm. Be calm. Why why is he confronting? What you're taking a gun? After two of our friends have been attacked? Like, surely not. You're not gonna try to defend yourself from the monster. Imagine until dawn, but like. Mike's like chasing Jessica through the woods, and it's like he just leaves the gun. <laughs> like, ooh, I don't have a license. Like <laughs> the plot demands this. We, <laughs> but he's losing hope, so only temporary. We're taking it. I will put it back when we're good and safe, and help is on the way. <sighs> he's holding okay. the gun. Ryan! He's holding a fucking gun! <laughs> Are you shitting me? Just careful with it. I'll be fine. Oh, put that gun down! We don't want to hurt anyone. Uh, Only me. Probably the weather. What weather, Ryan? Ryan. Maybe, maybe it was <laughs> bears. Oh, Bear. And why does everyone blame? Oh, uh, Ryan, I'm okay. sick of your so, shit. So, for the sake of argument, the bears. Bear, the bears are coming for help. Cut our phone line and just cut out all the power. What if that bear is waiting for us out in the hallway? Fair point. Thank you. Yeah, like this is stupid for the sake of the plot. Like this is is so ridiculously unbelievable. We should probably tell Kayla what's happening right now. The radio hub probably freaks. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Let's go. Like the brains aren't working. There's something wrong with these people. Oh my god. Yeah, we should probably leave that with Caitlin. Ryan wants us to hand over another gun as well. But I do want to save Caitlyn. Do you think she really needs it, though? She's the only one with a brain. Uh, she needs it just as much as we do. If she's staying in the lodge, we're going out there. You literally just said there might be something dangerous in the lodge. But don't take a gun, though! Like, 20 seconds ago. Okay, sure. But that's because I really wanted the gun. Just give her the gun, man. My god, you're the worst, Ryan. I'm giving Caitlyn the gun. I, I'm giving Caitlyn the gun. Not because- I think Ryan's full of shit. But, I want to keep Caitlyn alive. <laughs> uh, Alright. You're right. Hey, we'll still have mine. If you're extra nice to me, I'll, I might let you hold it. Don't write a check that your ass can't cash. My ass has got quite the bank account. What is this? <laughs> what? Am I interrupting something? Caitlin, take the gun, please. Liberate us from this hell. Chin up, big guy. It, I wouldn't really know what to do with it, okay? I trust you. Oh, thank you so much, Dylan. You're so generous and handsome. Yeah, no problem. Don't mention it. Okay. Well, Kate, Caitlin's got a gun. That's the main takeaway here. Oh, how's Emmett? <laughs> Yeah, Emma's in a bit of a pickle, to say the least. He really needs that zipline. I don't know that toolbox is gonna work forever. Thank God she stopped vlogging. Mm. 
slow. This game has been huge on noise. Yeah. The game is huge on noise. Speed up! I'm scared. Oh, fuck it out. Go! It's just... <laughs> just jump! Oh, I meant just like into the water. I didn't think she was gonna go for it. Fell. What is this music? <laughs> what? What is going on? Oh, the taser's dead, but her phone's perfectly fine still. Yeah, streamer mode strikes again. Oh, my God. Can I make oh, a suggestion for a streamer mode game? To see you. Good to see you. If you have the budget oh. and it allows it, maybe make your oh, own Donna original again, score or soundtrack. Maybe, maybe that might be better. <laughs> to prevent Strength. these awkward, really awkward fucking moments. Strength can be surprising. Knowing one's own raw power, tapping <sighs> into it, tapping into a previously unknown energy. I suppose there are forces at work within us all, and with one hand it gives, yeah, and we with got the some other it could rip away. The magician! The incredible, the unbelievable, the mystical, sensational. Perceptive manipulation. The work of a magician. Now you see it, now you don't. Blink and you miss it. Okay, I don't know you how to read it. these cards then. As always, there's more to The magician, see. it's gonna be an instantaneous moment. And what was strength? As always, the choice is yours. Because we need to like discern what, what advice the cards like give. You have to actually read more. into them a bit. We have to see more. Choose one. Choose wisely. Why can I only choose one? <laughs> sure. All right. Great. What's the point of collecting them if you can only pick one? Uh, we're going in on the magician. Okay, so we're gonna have to amputate. So it's goodbye again. I'll leave you with this. Remember who Great. your friends are. Remember who's looking out for you. Fantastic. <laughs> and for my next trick. I shall saw you in half! <laughs> That's why it's the magician. <sighs> hey, I couldn't find anything to eat. The kitchen's <laughs> pretty cleaned out. Oh, oh shit, I left my God. bag. I, I brought you this. Fuck. I don't even know what happened. It was all just a blur. How are you feeling? How are you? I uh, no, like you have to answer the fucking question, Nick. I'm okay. I'll be okay. 
thanks to you. No, no, I, I just helped a little. It was all Caitlin and Ryan. You're here with me. That helps. Oh my god, these kids. All right, they're off to find a radio or something. Oh, hang on. Actually, yeah, we, before we go any further, right? We, we just don't get to see this one. That's Ryan cutting... What's his name's hand again? Dylan. That's it. We have to cut off Dylan's hand. The mystical sensational per perceive perceptive manipulation, the work of a magician. Now you see it, now you don't blink and you miss it. Do we want to follow the magician? Or is that, don't do that? Yeah, this means Dylan's gonna be in trouble here. I don't know how to read the cards here. The incredibly unbelievable mystical sensation or perceptive manipulation. The work of a magician. It, it's, so, it's so hard to tell, like, if that's a good thing to do or not. Maybe if he gets bit, you do that. Otherwise, no. Don't want to miss it. I would love to see what the strength card did, but... Okay. What's with the, um... The... Oh, uh, we found another in Mr. H's office, so... Just in case. Oh, what happened to the lights? Not sure. Any better? I'm doing okay. Kinda. Wait, are they going to the radio hut? <sighs> Phone's dead. They're gonna try to send out an SOS or something. We're holding down the fort. Uh oh. Do not speak up right now. Jesus Christ. I thought you said Dylan and Ryan already left. Wait, stay here. I'll check it out. Yeah, be, be careful. Yeah. We'll be fine. Just be careful. Stay alert. This all could have been avoided if they just stayed home. Bit late now. Oh God, Caitlin, please, please get out of this, okay? Like this is the best character. At least she has the gun. Was that distortion behind her? Uh, I think that's just the game. I think that's just a tactical thing. I don't think it's a ghost. <laughs> Unfortunately. Come down the chimney. Okay, remember, at close range is better. Oh no, the upstairs was blocked off. That's why he didn't want us going up. Oh shit. It's John Cena. It's okay, he is a friend. I think he is a friend. He's not hunting people. But we should still be wary, just to find out what we can about him.
No sign of him. When you find them, He's not talking about the kids, he's talking about the the werewolves. No, wait, no, he is talking about the kids. He means it in a friendly sense. I should release. Yeah, I should release. I want him to find me. No, don't, don't run, Caitlin. John Cena is here for you. Let it hit you. Oh, jeez. Oh, I didn't mean like that. What do you want? Oh, you should have caught that or something. <laughs> I'm not gonna shoot. It's okay. Trust him. Trust him. Trust John Cena. Oh, damn it, he was so close to helping us. Hey, so this may not be like the best time per se, but like. What? Did he just take my gun? Yeah, so oh, like, my... I was just, you know, thinking about like the start of summer and when we first met and started camp and well, like now that summer's over and, you know, is that like the last time we're going to see each other, you know? Sorry, Nick, what what are you saying? <sighs> don't worry about Caitlin. Hey, don't worry about Caitlin, she's tough. I know. I'm sorry, Nick, I'm just distracted. They're just gonna, oh no, I just thought, fine, really, okay? they're gonna get shot if they're found. They might be in trouble if John Cena finds them. Oh, what are we talking about? Maybe I was misreading the situation back then. It's okay, though. Caitlin's safe. Look, we can't save Abigail at this point. And just do what we can for Caitlin. Well, did you want a little bit more to happen? Oh, okay. Are you dumb? Hey. Why are we talking Sorry. about this right now? I just mean... Of course I wanted it to happen. I just didn't know if... You Your leg take... has like an open wound. Seems like such a long time ago now. You did want it to happen, though. Uh, um, I, you can tell me. Yeah, I, I guess. <laughs> You're just saying that because I'm hurt. Nick. <sighs> what is going on out there, Caitlin? We've died. We've died. It's okay. I got this. Here he comes. <laughs> oh my god. What happened? I don't have a gun anymore. Jesus, where's the gun? We gotta get out. No, we have to hide. I may have fucked this a little. We do have to hide. Quick. We do have to hide because Nick's not gonna make it out. There's no time to run right now. Okay. All right, I gotta wait for the red to disappear. This dumb mechanic. There we go. Garden safety there. Yep. So the radio hut has like an actual radio. I thought it was just. Like, Caitlin's safe with the blood now. Oh too. yeah, yeah. It used to be more I of the actual radio station actually. Um, 
uh, you know, I mean, it is still technically, but nobody brings their radio to camp anymore. Yeah. It's weird, actually, that there used to be... Lost a gun. Yeah, I, I may have fucked up. I probably should have, like, tried to resist that. And, you know, nowadays, everything we need is on the phone, but Mr. Hackett takes it on the first... Where the camp. fuck is Jacob in all this? Distracted by technology. <laughs> Where did he go? Technology. It giveth and it taketh. So is, is that we just haven't seen him in a while. Camp radio? Keep an eye out for a card, no, please. Like, uh, DJ, Let me know if there's one here. Music something. Oh, um, yeah, I mean, I like music, but I think I want to major in um, quantum physics. Wait, what? <laughs> yeah. Uh, this can't you don't be good. seem like a science guy oh yeah I mean you know not not here um. oh good god did anyone see a card <laughs> I'm, I'm sorry I'm so completely fascinated by this what do you mean by not here not here at camp I do that at home, and then here, I, um... You're a wise, wise, cracking smartass? <laughs> uh, that's a little harsh, but... Uh... No? Okay, so maybe I was a little nervous when I arrived in an uncomfortable social situation, and I overcompensated a little bit by making a bunch of jokes. You played into it. Yeah, I mean, people I'm kind of kind insecure, of guys. I know there's a deadly werewolf on the loose that's today. trying to murder us all. And like two guys with and guns. Do, do you enjoy the blase? Let's just talk or? about our feelings for like five minutes. Not yet, like, you know, whatever, man. Oh, thanks for the raid as well. <laughs> Thank you very much. Um, How's it going? I folks? like Dylan Dylan. Well, it's nice. Welcome to, to this, you, like, Dylan the fucking Dylan. train wreck. <laughs> well, actually, I'm, let's get the fuck out of here, Ryan. Yeah, I like him. He's That makes a lot of sense. We're talking about our feelings while the werewolf stalks us in the woods. Good to have you on board. Is there gonna be a tarot card over here? I, I need the tarot card. That's a bit inconspicuous. Why, why is this just sitting here? I don't s there's some counselors here I don't recognize. On the back. Oh, that's like actually shooting, is it? Oh, that's to tell you who's good with the gun, isn't it? Hang on. No, it's it's just Caitlyn. Ryan is really bad. Who is named Sharpie? <laughs> Go in there? No. Guess we're going towards the big old tree. Something etched here. Oh, what in the name of voodoo do do is this? Oh, that's some blood. No, don't pull it back. You really need that. Take it. Stupid, stupid kids. I heard a crow there too, yeah, but... God knows where we're looking. Something over here. Sorry. 
letter. Letter to camp nurse. Chris Hackett has, has written a note to the camp nurse suggesting that she take the, uh, take off a day early. Maybe that's a little irresponsible when kids are still around. That's the so get that's him clear of the camp. Kelly went home early. Unless Nurse Kelly is one of the wolves. I, I don't I don't, I don't know. It's kind of hard to... She left, though. Go swing on the tree. Is there a swing there? <laughs> Jesus Christ, Ryan. Don't scare the shit out of me like that. Higher! Hi! <laughs> Um, I heard a crow, but I'm not seeing a card. Is the one here? That's a chimney. Wait, there's the car. It's in the bench, like this bench? The devil. Okay, that, that one can't be good. But that restriction like a shadow torn from one's corporeal form. Pay close attention and act before the demons unleashed. Each of us have one, even those who are pure of heart and say their prayers by night. That, okay, that's probably one to avoid. Keep the boys safe. Good. Huh. Claw marks is evidence. Yep, that's important. Large jagged claw marks on the wall of the radio hut. This is just evidence in general. We missed some evidence, clearly. There seems to be there's a piece of evidence every chapter, from what I can tell. Oh no. How we missed something in the first? I missed something in the first one. There's a carrot on the left, is there? The hermit. Here we have the hermit. With the hermit comes isolation, loneliness, but reflection too. Perhaps given some thought, the hermit who chase gives chase can guide you to safety. Okay, that one, that one might be important. <laughs> Whoa, it's me. <laughs> All good? All good. All good? Going. He's got a big smile on his face, considering oh, the circumstances. This is kind of a dump, huh? Okay, when I was a camper here, it was barely working. It hadn't been used for years, and it took me a really long time, actually, to get this place cleaned up and looking the way it is. So, I'm sorry if it's not up to your standards, but I've been putting in a lot of TLC. Okay. 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 Let me get this set up. All right. Let's do some radio broadcasting. Anything over here we can use? That flashlight looks nice. No. Um, that's Mr. H wanted more storage, so it's kind of how he lets me keep the station going. <laughs> gotcha. So, uh, how far does it go? 
Oh, um, well, it was designed just to broadcast to the PAs around camp for announcements and to, you know, portable radios and whatever. So I think the range is about a mile. That's not great. Uh, but don't be dismissive. How do you even know all this stuff? It's oh, something. I just kind of picked it up. It's something. We'll take what we can get. The tech technical stuff has always been a little uh, hard for me to get a handle on. Well, if you like, I could show you the ropes. Like a class? Yeah, it's easy. Like climbing. Yeah, we should take up a new hobby. Sign me up, teach. Anyways, this thing's gonna need a bit what of a What modules are you taking in college uh, next year? That's where this comes in. That's magnet. It's supposed to be a signal booster. It's kind of janky looking, but it's worth giving a shot. So, we can actually talk to people? You with heard of Pokemon Go? <laughs> yeah, well, it's not a two-way radio. It's come back. So, um, you know, we can talk, uh, but then the best we can do is switch it over to the receiver and see if anyone broadcasts anything back, which is unlikely, but... Well, it, I mean, it is what it is, I guess. You wanna yeah. head out and catch a Piplup? So, what should I say? Uh, just, like, make it sound urgent. Okay. Hello, how's it going out there? This is, uh, w uh we need help. This is, uh, we are counselors at Hackett's Quarry Summer Camp. And there's been a horrible accident attack. Some stuff's bad here. We need your help. Uh, there is a swarm of bears, and they are oh, no. everywhere. And there's these hunters too, and they seem to be shooting at the bears, but also at us, um, which is not good. And a few of our friends are hurt, and um, we are in desperate need of help. So please, I mean, there's vicious bears, and the bears uh, are the help. The bears are coming to, do, to so save please. us. Uh, come help us, SOS. Uh, this is uh, an emergency. S save our ship. Come on down, please help us. Yeah, I do good. Was that that, that was swarm of bears? That was yeah. terrible. Heard of bears? Yeah, I've heard of bears. What? Oh, oh my god! god. <laughs> All right, I, I guess I should just like switch this over to the receiver and see if we get anything back. Yeah, okay, yeah, I'm gonna keep an eye out while you do all this. No, 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 my brains stuff. Okay, yeah, sure. Except Caitlin. Don't put your face up. Don't just like press up against the wind. Like, duck! Duck, take cover! Check it. Hey, Dylan, I think there's something out here. Wait, did he did he say lodge? I don't know, huh? Two males in the radio shack near the cabins. Another couple unaccounted for. Copy that. Um now. They're talking to each other. They might not mean us. <laughs> yeah, that's us. Holy shit, they're talking about us. How? Because we just told them on the fucking radio. Fuck. They know where we are, man. We can't stay here. Shit. No. We... Shit. Hey, hey, hey. Let's, let, let's stay calm, okay? Um, let's, we need let's the help. And everybody, okay? Okay, yeah. Okay. Oh, no. <laughs> even mention it aggressive fuck you <laughs> what is that why is that even an option <laughs> but i'm so morbidly curious no i keep the kids alive i i, I wasn't sure man fuck what the fuck was that i have no idea keep the kids alive <laughs> why is that an option Fuck you! I hope the bear gets you. 
Uh, Ryan? Is it a bear? Shh. Oh my I god, shut up. Like that. I'm not gonna have to take a shot and see. Oh, I'm gonna miss this. <laughs> Abby and Nick, they're coming up the path. Oh, shit. They're coming toward us. We, we, we gotta warn them. Oh, right? my. Why? What about the PA? Up top? Yeah, okay. Right. Yeah, yeah, All we right. can tell them to hide or something. Yeah. Uh. Oh, fuck, no. Oh, shit. This is not good. Uh, the... uh, hold the button. Uh, Caitlin, get into a building now. Do not come up here. There's an animal outside the radio hut. Get, in, uh, get into a cabin now. Go! Go! Yeah, at least they used a brain there. Oh, fuck, dude. <laughs> They're gone. <laughs> oh, fuck, dude. Oh, gee. Oh, it's getting bad out there. Oh, no. Kids have one brain cell, I swear to God. Um, we gotta try to kill it if we can. Uh, I mean, I don't care. These guys are expendable as far as I'm concerned, right? <laughs> All I care about, like, what will make Caitlyn safer? I feel like being aggressive means we're gonna die. Yeah, we're probably not prepared. Probably not prepared. Stay inside. Is, is there anything we can do? I don't know. I, I don't know. It's just an animal, right? I mean, maybe we can scare it off? Uh... Well, it, yeah, I mean, if it, if it has hearing like a dog, maybe it, we, we can play like a like a really high-pitched feedback loop. Clever. And just blast it, and, and I mean, it would hurt like hell, but, you know. That, that's, that's brilliant. Try that. Do it. That's a brain. Dylan, you're thinking. Dylan, my God. <laughs> Dylan, just take a breath. I'm sure you can figure it out. Okay, yeah, right. Screaming at someone is not gonna help him think faster. There's something missing. I do. What's missing? Oh crap! I pulled the wire. Fix it. I'll cover you. Come on, lads. Do it now. Go, quickly. This is how the hand gets injured. Oh, no. Well... Cut it off! 
Okay, I'm th th let's see what the magician says. Here we go. Fuck. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Just, just hang on, hang on. Here oh, we oh, go. Oh, fuck. Use the shotgun. <laughs> just stand still, Dylan. <laughs> It's up. It's up. Are you sure? <laughs> yes, fucking do it. Fucking shot. Do they don't want, like no. their brains are working against them. Oh my. Oh. Jesus Christ. Oh, fuck, 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 fuck. <laughs> the game just gave me an achievement called just a flesh wound. Well, I appreciate the Monty Python reference in this moment. Um, I don't think it's the time. It's really killing the tension. The wire. Get the wire. Get the wire. What? Get the wire. The thing. Get it. On it. Plug it. Plug it into the thingy. I don't think Keep it's the time. Ah. Fucking hell. What do I do? What do I do? The button, the button. Oh, I can't cover his other ear. It did work though. Oh, we blew the speaker. It did the trick. Uh, nice work, Dylan. <laughs> Don't die, Shock. Oh, right. oh, fuck my hand. Right, right. Okay. Uh, uh, just hold on. The adrenaline. Oh, thank How God, did you this do is it. You told me to. Oh, that was a bad idea. Look, the magician. The magician gave us a tip there, right? We must trust the magic. Is it safe? Be a bit reassured. We need a moment of I think we're okay calm. for now. We ran into one of those hunter guys. Ah, oh, crap. Yeah, okay, chase us out of the lodge. I think we lost him on the way up here. You get a message out? I think so. <laughs> They're not gonna right. address that Dylan's business fucking end. <laughs> no one's gonna going touch on, on that. No, oh, there oh we my go. God. There we go. Dylan, okay. What happened? Oh, um, I'm okay. I, I, I mean. I, I'm not, um, but it's, it doesn't, doesn't hurt. Okay, you're in shock. Holy fucking shit. Uh. Did that thing do this? No. Well, sort of. It... Uh-oh. Caitlin, where's your gun? I lost it. One of the friendly locals wanted to say hi. That's unfortunate. What the fuck? Did she shoot at us? Who's there? Wait, is that Emma? Who was she? What? Should we follow her? Who the fuck is that? Is that Laura? Ah, oh, shit, Dylan. What is that? <gasps> oh, my God. <gasps> oh. Um, uh, who's that? Is that Jacob? We haven't seen him in a while. <laughs> oh, what's this? Fucking... <laughs> Why give the option for streamer mode music if this is what you've chosen? Yeah, grooving, man. We're just telling a couple of campfire trails. Getting some songs going.
That's the music that plays when you have like a heart to heart moment with your mom in a Disney movie. Why is that here? Oh, you're back. Looks oh, good like to see that's you, one less vermin in the world. Let's take a look once more. The devil. Without restrictions, like a shadow torn from this the is an unfortunate two to have to choose form. between. <laughs> Pay close attention and act before the demons unleashed. Each of us have one. Even those who are pure of heart and say their prayers by night. Here we have the hermit. With the hermit comes isolation, oh, loneliness, but reflection too. Perhaps given some thought. The hermit who gives chase can guide you to safety. But that all depends on your actions, not his. Which one we fail in? I want to show you more. Would that be all right? See more. Two futures to see. I don't know why I have but to choose. But only one can be seen. The devil Make is going to be something, choice. like, really, really bad. But the hermit is a guide for safety. Like, these are both, these are both really important. I'm gonna let chat pick it. Uh, can one of them? Oh, there's a poll. Okay, thanks. I was about. I was just about to ask. Who set that up? <laughs> I didn't even need to say anything there. You too good. Me, thanks, Banda. <laughs> Shit. Okay, what does the poll say? Oh, it's almost fifty-fifty. Oh no. It's gonna be very close. Which one wins? Let's see. I have no idea what the fuck is happening, but this is my favorite game of all time now. <laughs> I'm glad. I'm very glad to hear it. The Hermit won with 53% of the vote, so that was very close. That was, that was down to the wire, yeah, okay. Spend <laughs> so much time looking toward the future. It's easy to forget that the past holds secrets too. Worth remembering that. Was that the cop or was that Carol? So it's goodbye are, again. I'll be here. Are the cop I'll and Carol the you. same man? Maybe? Cop was a bit less old, yeah. Emma! Jesus Christ. Hang on. <laughs> Jacob's not looking too good. Um, let's just quickly see what that was. Okay, uh, so this is... Uh... The hermit who gives chase can guide you to safety. It all depends on your actions, not his. If Jacob steps in a bear trap... Then Carol's gonna have to help us. Okay. I think that's what that means. Why is his face in the trap? Wait, what?
Uh oh. Uh, how... Just don't get trapped. Just <laughs> simply avoid it. Jeez. Fuck! Oh, now the ghost girl's back to me. Man. God, this thing sucks ass. Oh, no. Emma, is that you? Fuck. He's on his own this time. <laughs> Why would that be Jake or Emma? Is that my girlfriend? Oh, gee. Where the fuck are we? Anna needs a strap, so she's not sound too good there. Yeesh. I'm gonna fall off this. And let's not. Jill. Fucking hell. What was that? A bad plank. Okay. Oh, it was a footprint, was it? Okay. There, there was a car as well. Um, I mean, if I had to guess, the car's over there. at the memory card. Memory card from a broken and dirty camera lost in the woods. Okay. Huh. Maybe there's something on here. Put that in your undies. Keep it safe. I heard a car, but I'm not seeing where the crow is. Does anyone know if the carrot's back there? I, I don't know. Go back down and under. I can get down here, and then I can go under it, yeah. It's so fucking dark. Okay, over here somewhere. Justice. Okay, that seems like a good one. An eye for an eye, not exactly, in some cases, but cause and effect. Actions and consequences. Balance to everything, we all play a part in making sure the scales aren't tipped. Oh god. Flu, thank you for the 100 bits. Thank you as ever, everyone was subbed and given bits of the stream. I hope you're enjoying it. What is the- oh, is the ghost trying to help me? Oh god, Emma! Ah, oh, Jesus Christ! Oh. That was a bit frightening. Uh, am I glad to see you? Oh my god, no way. Am I glad to see you? <laughs> oh no! Oh, Jesus Christ! Oh. You left me back there, you asshole! God, Emma, come on. Oh, God. 
What the fuck is going on? Look, I don't know, okay? Some, like, bear attacked Nick and Abby back there. Yeah, me too, but it definitely was not a bear. What? Who? When? Why? Still alive. Sorry, I'm just... I'm glad you're okay. Yeah, barely. I mean, the thing that attacked me at the treehouse was like... What? It was like what, Emma? Like, out of a horror movie? Could you be a little more descript? Um, well, it, it was probably just like a, a bear. Rather than relying to, like, on some itself. meta cliches like, oh, to describe it. You know it wasn't a fucking bear. Well, you're right, you're right. And now we have these fucking the, the hunters running all over the place. So that's a fun new wrinkle. <laughs> she, she has a photo of it. They did this to me. That's a lot of blood. Yeah, well, it's not mine. Mm, got quite the funky bouquet. No offense. Um, okay. Okay, we've got to get out of these woods. Yeah, no shit, Sherlock. <laughs> you know, Jacob, you don't have to be a dick about literally everything. Oh, I, I don't like Emma either. I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, shit. Okay, you know what? You're right. Okay, you're right. I'm sorry. Oh, you're so annoying. Oh my god, can we please not do this right now? Okay, seriously? I literally came looking for you as soon as I heard there was something out here. What a heartfelt apology. Like plural? As he screams at her. Really? <sighs> Run! Oh, uh, we're going. Come on, gang. Oh boy. Oh, it's time to dodge. Sorry. It's okay, she'll be safe. Run, the hide last time did not fucking work. Be very careful. There's a bear trap there. D don't step in it. Don't step in it. Don't please, please. I've already seen it. Oh, fuck. Ah! oh Jacob. <laughs> you idiot. <laughs> You absolute... If you hit his foot, might have been okay. But the last time we hit it, ended really fucking badly. <laughs> At least it's his ankle and not his face. Okay, well, th I mean, this one's happening, so we better, we better remind ourselves of uh, what to expect. I don't know what to do with this knowledge. Don't fall on your face Shit. into one. What do we think? I think Brian's gonna do better than trying to pull. Oh, this is gruesome. Oh, fuck! Ah! 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 Shit! Ah! 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 Jacob, you need to stay with us. Ah! 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 Look, you could. Ah! We 
We we did it. Carol saved us. <laughs> and someone is very dead here. Is she like one of those hunter dudes? I don't think so. Um, we should, yeah, get, rally morale. We need it here. You okay? I don't know who that other girl was. I've never seen her before. Me neither. But her? Yeah. That's Kaylee Hackett. Mr. H's daughter? I thought she went home with her brother. Oh, shit. Kaylee. Yeah. I thought so, too. Oh, man. Poor Kaylee. Nick. You smell so good. Uh-oh. Intervene here. You all right there, bud? Maybe dial it back a bit, huh? Fuck off, Caitlin. No. Getting more aggressive. He's turning. Nick, what do you? I want to taste you. Hey. Come here. Oh, Nick, what? Oh the no. Uh, get off. Oh, watch out! Nick, get off. PS2 water got him. Nick. Wait, is that like a pool of holy water? I just wanted him to stop. Nick, dude. Uh, or is it just acid? <laughs> you doing okay, Abigail? Hey, hey, it's okay. I'm okay. I got you. I got you. What did I do? I... I don't know. Oh shit, there's blood in the water, that's right. He's so cold. Okay, let's get him in the pool house. Dry him off. <laughs> oh, Nick's transforming. Abigail's- uh, did Abigail not get bit then? She just get clawed or something. Just try to rest. I'm sorry. She must have, cause like, she's been holding up alright. Ah, quit moving so much. Compared it's to Nick. from what I could tell. I mean, it's not bleeding. But you need to see a doctor. This is all I've got left from the nurse's station. Ooh, fun. You better hope uh, we find you some real help before they wear off. We need to be keeping a record of everything that happens for the police. Oh, this is what the game was implying yeah. too, yeah. Dead girl in the pool needs some explaining, huh? <sighs> Easy, man. I mean, like photos, whatever we can. We might get the bad end because we missed a bit of evidence. I don't want to any of this crazy shit unless we've got some hard proof. From now on. If you got your phone and you see something, take a photo or a video or whatever. Yeah. You okay over there, Abby? Look, why don't you look around and see if you can find anything to help make Nick more comfortable? Use this to walk. Stay away from Nick. There's a note over here. Just want to save Abigail if we I can. I wonder where Caleb is. Recent pit piece of camp history. A younger Ryan enjoying his time at camp with Chris Hackett's kids. Caleb and Kaylee. Okay, I think I'm starting to piece some of it together. The H family and why he's so protective of them and he tries to lock them up for the night is because he knows that a lot of the family are werewolves. 
but there's hunters coming in to basically just get rid of them because they've obviously got loose at some point. Is that maybe what's happening? I think that's why Mr. H is so in on it and knows exactly what's happening and why even he's disappeared for the night. Like, that's my working theory, and it's just like hunters who are just sick of the wolves because they got out and killed someone, obviously. Working theory. But what's going on? Why does the blood protect them? I don't understand that quite yet. The blood? The blood is that of a wolf. Which marks them as one of their own, which means they're less likely to attack. And that's why the hunters have doused themselves for the night. That makes sense. That makes sense to me. Go in the back room here. The lovely shower. In there. Was there a card? Oh, I might have missed it. This place was so different like 12 hours ago. Pookie drawn. Among the miscellany of these forgotten belongings is a scribble drawn of a woman in the woods. Those ghost stories seem to have really left a mark. Looks like the hack. Wait, what was that? That was investigate the locker. Okay. I think I'm close, yeah, because Jacob might have actually drank some of the blood. I thought they were trying to do that to him. Maybe it's not the wolf blood. Is there anything in these showers? Is is there a card here? I feel like there should be a card here. Thank you. Give us the moon. The moon. How... Oh, I can never pronounce that word. Uh, English major. Tonight of all nights, to harness your fear and anxiety. And turn them into intuition. If you can do this and plan ahead, your cunning might just save your life. Okay, so that's going to be like, you want to do this card. That's a guide. Poignant, is that it? Thanks, guys. Me struggle with English. And who is Ian? Ian might be just been like a kid that got bit by a wolf or something. Former counselor, maybe. He could be a member of the family. So fucking spooky. Is there anything here for Chris? Get some toilet roll. Not Chris, uh, Nick. I get up until dawn. Talk to the gang. How y'all doing? Really don't want to go near him. Uh, I didn't see anything that I could actually use for him. Did I miss something? I think I just have to talk to him. Here, now. Here. That better? Thanks. 
Hey. Don't let him bite ya. Yo, something is not right with that boy. Dude is real sick. Did you see how he freaked out in the water? Yeah, he was like a... He was like a fish out of water. Right? Uh, sure. You know, I think the water is to, to like... Wounds too, I think it is holy water or something. It's mean? supposed to like purge him. Well, all of his clothes were bloody, but I couldn't find where he was bit. Or scratched, or whatever. Laura he killed one of the wolf guys around. and threw him in the like, pool after. see how badly he was hurt. Huh. Hmm. Rabies? And that got him back to being like a know. normal human. I think Abby would beg to differ. Point. It isn't aquaphobia a symptom of rabies? Hydrophobia, yeah. But I think it's more about a fear of drinking, not just getting wet. This was like, like my cat in the bathtub. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Careful, Abigail. Abby. Yeah. Can I ask you something? Don't trust him. Do you like me? No, don't kiss. I'm gonna be aggressive. I don't. I don't want this to lead to a kiss. Stay back. I don't know what's going on with you right now, but I like the old Nick better. I knew it. I knew it. You didn't like me at all, too. But that's not what I said. Why won't you tell me the truth? I am telling you the truth. I only hung out with you because you seem so desperate. Oh, wait. They're getting more aggressive. I'm not supp I should have stayed calm. I need him calm. I die. Uh oh. Pathetic little Abby ready to throw us up for the first guy that came along. Easy pickings. Oh, right off the bone. This isn't you. I mean, this this isn't you. I... <gasps> Holy hey, shit! Whoa, Abby! Uh, Abby, everything okay? Holy shit. Uh oh. We might need to fight here. Honestly? <laughs> do we do it? <laughs> I think we take the shot. Maybe shoot him in the leg or I... <laughs> Uh-oh. Holy shit! <laughs> we might have lost Chris. I, I don't think we can save him. No, Nick. Sorry, yeah, the Chris isn't here. <laughs> I gotta stop calling him Chris. I was just a bit confused. She hasn't really been filled in with the rest of the gang at this point. <sighs> Could I have played that scene differently into a way where Chris didn't, Nick didn't explode? J 
just just a bit curious. <laughs> Ah, oh, shit. I don't know if anyone else has played this. Yeah, it's the first day it came out. Okay. So, if I were a counselor at an off-season camp, partying around a bonfire, and it started to rain, and there were monsters... I was worried he was going to come and try to get Abigail in close so he could bite her or something. That's, I, I was terrified of that. To the lunch. That's the problem. I didn't feel like I could trust him. Thank God she stopped fucking vlogging. Not good. This is really not good. I mean, you you need to meet up with the group. I will say, Emma, as much as we like hate her just because of like you know our personality and like being an influencer, she has kind of been a t uh, like a, like a trooper for like enduring quite a bit. Going off on her own. She has been doing quite well. There's a lot happening here. She injured Jacob. True. This is the right way. I don't know what the right way is. Got no fucking idea. This does not seem good. You Emma Simp, I can guarantee you. I am not a fan of this person. Okay, there's a pat there, or there's a pat up there. What are we thinking, gang? This place here. is a lot harder to navigate at night. Oh no. Come on, Emmett. Time to go home. I think we're gonna learn more about the ghost soon. The reason the fair burnt down before in the woods. It was because of the wolves that live out here. Of course. And it's like their family and ancestors that are like hunting them. Because you know. Come on! I've never done this before, Pop. Let's do it fast. Here's Carol. I, I need to God damn. see what's going on. God damn these <laughs> fucking kids. Son, what? Ah. Oh. Ah. Hey, stop. Stop squirming. Give me the try. Is she bit, huh? How am I supposed to know? I don't know. Let me look at her. Nah. Get the fuck 
Look away from me. Ah! No. Oh. Don't punch Carol like that. We need to keep Carol in good health. Caitlin! He's actually- they're helping, Ryan! they're fighting the wolves. Abby! This doesn't feel safe. Does anyone know how to close the goddamn door? Also, you really shouldn't be on your own. Abby? You really shouldn't be on your own. Ryan? Popping back to the car at this point. Oh, we never found the thing for it, so we're not going to be able to drive it still. This might be bad. Oh god. I killed him. I killed him. I mean, dead people don't usually jump out of windows and run into the forest. You did what you had to. Yeah. <laughs> Abby, he was gonna hurt you. You were defending yourself. I, I don't. I, yeah, I don't you're good, Abigail. Don't sure. worry. I do. No. No. It was you or him, and well, that definitely wasn't him. Man, this is so fucked. Oh shit. Where the fuck is Chris Hackett? Oh. I'm suspicious. This is this is Laura. Who's there? I need your help. Please. Who are you? My name is Laura Kearney. She's alive. Hey, don't let me in. It's not safe out here. Uh yeah, there's a crazy woman with a gun killing people. I'm not killing people. Holy shit, you Laura Kearney? You're Laura Kearney? Yes. You were supposed to be working, uh, helping out in the nurse's office, right? And you, you never should let her up. in. You and the guy, what's his name? Max? Yes, Max. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, Mr. Hackett said that you had changed your mind last minute. I, I think that we should, I think that we should listen to her inside. Let her in. Let her in. Okay. I'm gonna open the door, slowly. Just keep your hands up, okay? And if she kills Ryan immediately, it's okay. No. We've got a few characters we can burn through still. Oh, how we doing? Here we are again. Just you and me. How you doing, Hag? Why don't we take another look at what you've found? Okay, we got Justice or the Moon. I think we want to go the Moon here. Justice. An eye for an eye. Not exactly in some cases, but cause and effect. Actions and consequences. There's a balance to everything, and we all play a part in making sure the scales aren't tipped. Tell us about this one. This one's very important. The moon. How poignant. That's how you pronounce it. Tonight Thank you. of all nights, to harness your fear and anxiety and turn them into intuition. If you can do this and plan ahead. Your cunning might just save your life. Now tell me. Yeah, yeah, like I, I think we want the moon here. 
one of many possible futures. I'm in high Make school and I know choice. I knew how to pronounce that. Good for you. <laughs> Please continue your studies, where which I clearly did not. <laughs> I'm proud of you. You're gonna be an English major someday. Okay, yeah, give us the moon. That was a long one. Off you go then. Top top. One down, remember. Isn't that terribly exciting? That was a long scene. Okay, let's let's play that one back again. The moon. This, this one is important. This is Laura overcoming the cop. Is that right? Play dead. Stab the cop. Take his keys and go. But is that like a flashback? Is Laura's already here or is that gonna happen? We're gonna need a syringe. Maybe you can look into the past. Yeah, I'm... I'm not sure. That's definitely Laura because of like the eye patch, ain't it? And that's the cop from before. Is it Emma? I don't think that's Emma, no. Considering like the eye patch and that. Yeah, that has to be a flashback. It's a different eye patch. Well, I mean, she got the eye patch later, but that was like a bandage to like kind of heal, cover her wound. Okay, we need a syringe. We need to kind of play dead. Get the syringe. Play dead. Knock him out, please. So, so, uh, why didn't you come? Where have you been for the past two months? We did come. One night early. That was our mistake. We should probably close the door. Yeah, here we go. So this is, yeah, this is the flashback. We're going to get a bit of context here. Yeah, what happens if you fail this one? That's what I'm wondering. Clearly there's a gameplay element here. We have to syringe the cop. Don't call out here. That's not gonna help us. Max isn't looking too good. Dear God. The fuck? Peter down there. 
Holy shit. This is one of the guys hunting the wolves. Yep, what clearly. have you done to Max? Shut up. You can't just- Shut up! This is an interrogation. I ask, you answer. <clears throat> Name. <laughs> Eat shit this probably isn't gonna help. Try our best here. This is not very legal. Laura Kearney. Who are you traveling with? And what is your relationship? Max Brinley, he's my boyfriend. Where were you headed last night? To Hackett's Quarry Summer Camp. You already know this. What have you done with Max? No. I ask, you answer. That's how this works. Like, is there any point in protesting? Like, I feel like if I escalate the situation here, we're just gonna get less context. It's not the time to escalate the situation. We want to lay calm and get the syringe later. And then. And then get out. Fine. What do you want to know? Oh. Well. Ah. Uh, why are we going to hack his quarry last night? Max and I are camp counselors. Oh, bullshit. Counselors aren't due until today. I told you, we drove up and got there early. We figured we'd just go to camp. Why didn't you go to the motel like I told you? Because we were like way closer to the camp and we're broke. Mm -hmm. North Kill County. Okay, Sheriff. All right, yeah, we're trying to get information out of him. Okay, Sheriff. Hackett. He's a Hackett, yeah. Wait, Hackett? Like, Chris Hackett? Don't change the subject. What the fuck is going on Stop here, man? losing his patience. You have no idea what's going on here. Not a goddamn clue. You just stepped in some grade A double prime go ahead and kill yourself cosmic type shit, young lady. And your only option? is to buckle the fuck up and do what I yeah, say. Yeah, he knows exactly what's on. You understand? On. That's who, that's who Mr. H was talking on the radio too. Yeah, please stop trying to intimidate me. Please. Remain calm. Please just stop trying to intimidate me and tell me what the fuck is going on. He's... Is Max alive? Angry ain't gonna help. We need info. I feel like I'm going crazy. In any real life situation, if a cop is trying to get information out of you and keeping you contained without reason, keep your mouth what? shut. This is not a very real life situation, unfortunately. I don't think this cop is necessarily legal. I don't think asking for my lawyer is going to help. Don't lash out here. Wait for our moment. Trust in the hermit. Let's go. The hermit will save us. Hey. Max is there. Hey, you asshole. Okay, so what the fuck's going on? We can hey. we can we can, we can still save me. Nick. Oh wait, no, no, not the, the moon. Not the hermit. Fuck the hermit. Are you okay? Max, are you okay? Yeah. I mean, I'm. I'm kind of all mixed up, but more or less intact, I think. Laura. 
Yeah. Why am I naked? What? I mean, after we got attacked. You exploded last night, the next Max. Thing I know, I'm waking up in a there was jail blood cell everywhere. On, and now you're back again, and, and, and I'm super naked, and there's blood and stuff everywhere. I mean, what the fuck happened? Um. Wanted me to confess. Yeah, so our host was very keen on getting me to confess, but I honestly couldn't tell you what I was meant to be owning up to. Jesus. What he used to try to get you to talk? The pincher, the blade? Three hole punch? No, it, he wasn't torturing me. Who does this guy think he is? Well, Sheriff of North Kill, apparently. North Kill? Yeah. Max! What? Did you even look at the map? Hackett's Quarry in North Kill, that's the town. Oh. And it gets better. I gotta look at his name badge and... Oh. There's some clothes for him. Get dressed. What's he giving you? I'm not gonna be the guest of honor at Fashion Week, I'll tell you that much. Hey! Did I say you could talk to each other? I mean, how are you gonna enforce that? Let's be honest here. <laughs> like, <laughs> realistic, like, how, how do you regulate that? I'm just gonna lie again. Sorry, sir. Sorry, sir, we'll be quiet. We will? Max? Hey, just lie. With my real girlfriend. <laughs> Just lie him though. Come on, Max. God, didn't expect this. See, this is good. We need to earn his trust a bit. Right, buddy. Take it out. Hands through the bars. Come on. Your turn. Let's go. I'm not going anywhere. We can talk right here. Come on. Hey, hey. Let's get the fuck off. Come on. Move. Good boy. He knows. Hey, stop struggling. Just, just calm down, Max. Max, calm down. You're only making it worse. Trust the moon. Trust the moon. What the hell did you do to her? Shut up. Okay. Playing the long con here, yep. Okay. Think, Laura, think. There's gotta be something in here you can use. Yeah, we, fi we finally get the play. Uh. Have a look. What's this? That's quite convenient. If we get something to crack that open, I need some sort of lever. There's a hidden wall here, like game logic. This brick stands out. That. <laughs> While the town of North Kill lay there sleeping, the hag in the woods started weeping. As the bodies decay, the wolves hunt their prey, and the sheriff continues his creeping. Okay, I mean, this is like a story for the game or something. Yep. And or Hill lay sleeping, the hag in the woods started weeping. Bodies uh, decay, the wolves hunt their prey, and the sheriff continues his creeping. So the sheriff, the shit, because the sheriff is part of the wolves, he's trying to accommodate things for the wolves, right? This is how the fair got done in at some point. The rap game is weak here. <laughs> Uh, 
Okay, I, I, I think I'm working out part of it. He is trying to keep this under wraps. He's trying to protect, I think, some family members, maybe. Perfect, we can use that for the brick. <laughs> that could work. Why did the cop leave this in here? Oh, yeah, this ought to do it. What do we do with a brick? Uh... The brick is hollow, but there's nothing in it. Oh, yeah, we can use that to hide the syringe or something later. Perfect. Watch it, man. I bruise easily. Play the long con. Give yep. me a break. I'm figuring it out. Hey, the second we get out of here, you're toast, motherfucker. Laura, we're trying to win his favor a little. The second you get out. I don't want to be fearful. Oh, trust the moon. Wait, wait. Well, answer your questions. You just can't lock us up in here with no goddamn explanation and expect us to be all butter and cupcakes, okay? Just work with us here. You have nothing to bargain with. Come on. Come on! <laughs> oh, this guy's a real piece hey, of work. Just leave us in here! Hey! Come back! Oh, it's desynced a bit. Hang on, let me... That should fix some of it. Fuck! Son of a... Binky Bucky. Did he break his leg? Are you okay? Are you okay? It's just a foot. It'll heal. I meant the interrogation. Oh. Binky yeah. Bonky as well. Yeah. Can't break old Max. Many have tried, many have failed. I'm that's being a, serious, that's Max. That's a curse there. He, uh... He just asked a lot of questions. A lot of weirdly specific questions about us and where we were going and why and how I was feeling this morning and... I don't know. Nothing I said made him seem any less annoyed. He asked how you were feeling? Yeah. Why, well, he didn't ask you? No. Huh. Rude. It was very inconsiderate of him. He's a real bonky binky. Did you get a look at his name badge? You mean it's not really Detective Dick Whippet? It's Hackett. Oh, Jesus. Sheriff Hackett. You think he's related to Chris Hackett? Oh my god, like THE Chris Hackett? Yeah. Who's THE Chris Hackett? As in camp leader Mr. Hackett of Hackett's Yep, they absolutely are related. Last night feels like a lifetime ago. The fuck does that mean, though? You know? Were we set up? Maybe it's some... kind of crazy camp counselor kidnapping ring. That's... I mean... What? <laughs> Ma Max, come on. Not acting like a kid kidnapper. Yeah, just try try thinking. Maybe this leads somewhere. Well, I guess Sheriff Hackett's not exactly acting like a typical kidnapper, but he's not acting like a typical cop either. Well, how do you know how kidnappers act? 
Max, please work I'm with me. I'm just trying to get us out of here, and I can't get us out of here until I have some. You need to believe in the power of the moon, angry. Max. The moon will guide us to safety. I don't know. What if we can't make sense of it? What? Well, you we have to. Sometimes things just don't make sense. What then? We're just stuck in a backwater jail cell for the rest of our lives? Uh, it's not forever. This isn't forever, Max. An extended you, vacation. You can't just hold us here forever. You didn't seem too convinced of that. You gotta stay positive. You can't think like that. Why not? Might as well just accept it, right? No, fuck that. Uh, Max, it's like, it's, it's, you've only been conscious like an hour. Think about the rest of the summer, Max. And school? I mean, I've been dreaming about becoming a vet since I was five years old. I'm not gonna let this fleabag fuckface stop me. We're gonna get out of here. I'm gonna study to be a vet, and you're... gonna, um... What? I'm gonna what? I saw the letter, Max. Oh, this is coming back. What are you talking about? The rejection letter for college. I found it in your bag. I haven't... We haven't seen this in a while. Looking around in my stuff? <laughs> I can't believe you didn't tell like, me. Like, six hours later. I was embarrassed. But your grades were good and you wrote a great essay? Yeah, apparently not good enough. Fuck. Laura, why'd you bring this up? Fans, Max, what the fuck? I like, don't know. why, why you are you bringing up the fact that he's now like a college dropout? Like, <laughs> is it? Time and place. Gotta stay positive. Huh, college not looking too good, is it? I'm sorry, Max. This, this really sucks. Pat up there. Hey, it's not the worst thing to happen this summer. I'm sorry. I shouldn't have kept it from you. Yeah, they at least seem you to be talking you can stuff talk to me out. about anything, right? Yeah. Yeah, I do. Thanks, appreciate your sympathy. That's good. Okay, let's just focus on getting out of here for now. Great, sign me up. At least there's no dick jokes with these two. The beginning. <laughs> True. Like from when we left home? Like from when we ran into the cop. So after we ran into the... Whatever we ran into? Yeah. Actually, yeah, that's when shit started getting weird. The dude acted super weird when we said we almost hit an animal. You remember that? It was like he already knew or something. Yeah. Yeah, that was really sketchy. What if he's not even a real cop? Well, he's gotta be dirty, but... I mean, I think he's a real cop. We're in a police station. I mean, yeah, but there's like... nobody else around. Yeah, that is concerning. Especially the whole hack it hack it thing. Let's just go with the idea that they're both in on it. Okay. So we're supposed to meet Chris Hackett at the camp, and instead, there's nobody there, and we get attacked by something. Good old Ian. And then the cop shows up. That part's all fuzzy for me. Like, I, I remember the steps and a smell like wet fur and a, a dog collar with the name Ian on it. Ian? Ian. I don't think it was a dog that attacked us. Whatever it was, was big. Like, person-sized big. Yeah, it really did a number on you. Like, I'm surprised you're not more messed up. Like, like, like I vividly remember the thing's teeth ripping into you. You exploded last what night, What is Max. messed up about that is... Laura, I don't have a scratch on me. What? Hey, okay, so weird question. Do you remember... before we got lost? You got lost? Well, yeah, but before that, I was all like, whoa, look at the moon. It's so big, so cool to see a full moon Is in the middle of the woods. Just... And you were all like, yeah, no shit, Max. It My God, it's tomorrow. werewolves. Yeah, so? Right, so, you know, full moon. But we're on this page because we have a lot of circumstantial evidence to get to this conclusion, okay? Um, 
This is a bit of a fucking leap from these guys' point of view. <laughs> you know? <laughs> maybe he is- maybe he's the only character with a brain. But it does feel like... Uh, we got attacked at uh, werewolves. Werewolf, like, like... He's getting to this t bit conclusion a bit too quick, it feels. Werewolves are real, and I am one. <laughs> like, that's the thing. Yeah? What if... Uh... Okay. No. Stop. I'm just saying, you know, maybe there's a slight chance... It was a werewolf. Are you out of your... Oh. Oh, that was ominous. Goddamn mine. Well, oh, shit. Oh. What the fuck? That cut did not work very well because there was a load and scream in the middle of it. That would have been much better if the technical uh, capacity of this game was a bit more up to scratch, I feel. Let's look at the moon again. What? 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 What's so funny? I said literally the. I said literally the exact same thing. Okay. Do you, you got anything better? I mean, like zombies, aliens, d time hopping Draculas. Oh no! You got to stop saying that. <laughs> Have you seen Morbius, Laura? You know who Jared Leto is. <laughs> Oh, God. Ryan, right? Yeah? You want answers? I've got answers. Interrupt me again, you're on your own. <laughs> Whatever. Everyone's got a big smile, considering he's missing his hand. Would it really be so crazy? With all the shit that we've been seeing with Nick? With the thing on the roof? Okay, it would really start to explain a lot of stuff. Dylan! I'm just trying to keep an open mind, okay? This is like your ghost stories. How is this so different from your ghost those, stories? Those are those are just campfire stories. Like there has to be a rational explanation for everything, for all of this. I mean, okay, you were we not saw Nick talking explode. so rational when you separated my hand from the rest of my body. You told me to. And if it's bite with which you're faced, cleave limb from torso with great haste. What? You did the right thing. See? She's got a whole poem about it. There's more to all this than you think. Just let me finish. What? And you can decide for yourself if you believe me or not. I don't care. But I think you should hear all of it. Just show like her missing eye or... The next few weeks were long. The cop kept us fed and let us take showers, but aside from that, we barely saw him. Max and I, we talked a lot, as much as we could about what happened that night. It was like trading conspiracy theories. We talked about the cop, the camp, the accident, the woods, the thing in the basement, what happened to Max, we just kept going over it all again and again, and nothing was making sense. All we knew is that we needed to get out of there. M4 offline, I don't know if that means anything. We're back in the police department, it's been two weeks, so... I can't take this anymore! It's not that bad. They're probably in the same crap at camp. No, I can't take being in here anymore. Oh. Yeah, well, that part's pretty tough. We've got to do something. We've got to get out of here. We need a, p a plan. We well, keep saying that, but it's been weeks, so, you know, let me know if you have one. That's really not very helpful, Max. You are forgetting something. What? Just the ETBT 
tiny detail that I may or may oh. not be a fucking werewolf, you Laura. Keep it down. So what? What can we do, really? We run off into the sunset only I, I to stop when I turn into a nasty ass monster and kill you and eat you, and then I run off alone into the sunset with little bits of you stuck in my teeth. Okay, okay, stop. Just one problem at a time. All right, we we don't even know if that's what's really going on, and we won't until we get the hell out of here. Okay. Real relationship problems. It's like well, it my seems partner to me is that a we werewolf. Only have two real options. We can play nice and try to get this guy on our side. What, so he'll let us go? Or... We try to catch him off guard and make our escape. What if we get on his good side? Yeah, that's the thing. Okay, so... Let's say we get on his good side. What then? Brunch in mimosas every Sunday till he sees the error of his ways? Perfect. Yeah, I was being rhetorical. The dude doesn't have a good side to get on. I mean, he don't even talk to us half the time. I don't know, I think we could crack him. Laura, I think he's just biding his time until he can figure out a way to get rid of us. Permanently. I think we should try. Yeah, we really should. I think we should try. I mean, if he was gonna kill us, we'd be dead by now. So what's he waiting for? Look, we just... If this doesn't work, we try to escape. Deal? Yeah. Deal. So. Wait, wait, wait. Yeah, the moon. The moon shows escape. But we're gonna try and be nice to him, and that's how we escape. Is that not it? Objective is still making escape plan. I didn't mess it up, did I? Playing the long con. Yeah, I don't think there's a wrong answer. Right, I think we're supposed fine. to get this guy to like us. We're gonna get out and talk to us. Didn't say Pat chosen. I mean, he's got to have a weak spot, like something we can use. It's not like we don't have time to figure it out. Yeah. Okay. I think we're good. I think we're still following the mooner. Hey, hey, T money. Can I call you T-Money? Why? You can call me Officer Hackett. Hackett? Like as in Hackett's quarry? What's it to you? Just interested is all. I feel like we hardly know you. Well, let's keep it that way, okay? Come on, Team Money, lighten up, man. No reason we can't be buds, right? I can think of seven. Oh. Yeah, just, just be understanding. Why, why seven? Number one, you exploded in my cell. Number two, you didn't go to the hotel. My cousin runs that, and I'd appreciate if you support his business. Number three, you let my dog Ian out. How could you be so careless? <laughs> like, that's very specific. You're right. We've been just awful, and we really want to make it up to you. Oh. He's not buying it. I see what you're doing. Oh, no. Well, it's not gonna work. You think we're just gonna be besties, and I'm gonna let you walk right out of here. Push it too far. Not gonna happen. Asshole! Max! We know what's going on! We know Max is a werewolf! There we go. Full moon's in a few days, right? What, what then? No, ma'am. You don't know the half of it. Well, he definitely does. Hey, damn it, this guy has his brain cells intact. He said, take your fucking clothes off. Fuck off, fuck off! <laughs> Get back! <laughs> Max, what's going on? Get the oh, fuck no, he's being taken. Come here. Hey, could someone give me
send me like a clip of that just quick sync. Someone send me like a Twitch clip. Can maybe a mod in chat? I think we isolate the sound there. That could be a new sub sound. <laughs> fuck up, fuck up. <laughs> I don't know if a mod what would uh, like to get on that. Oh wait, 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 wait. So, so, uh, is this the right clip? Damn it, this guy has his brain cells intact. He said, take your fucking clothes off. Fuck off, fuck off. Fuck off. Get back. <laughs> fuck off, fuck off. Fuck off, fuck off. Fuck off, fuck off. Perfect, thank you. I'll keep that for later. Thanks there, Crispy. Appreciate it. If, anyone ever, if anyone's ever mean to me in chat or something, I could just like have a new sound effect I could play. <laughs> Get off of me! Shit. Get out. Have a seat. Ah! Quit squirming. Said you want to be a vet, right? Call us an internship. Let me go! You're not going to believe it? until you see it for yourself. Just fucking this ask is a dangerous position to put her in. Jeez. Don't get too close. G, come in. What's your position? Over. Shit. Mm-hmm. Just wrapping things up here. Don't call for help. Down to 20. Over. What's gonna happen? Well, I'll tell you. It's not gonna be pretty. But don't worry, I'll be back at dawn. You're really gonna leave me here? You'll be fine. Just don't get too close. Let's just sit tight. Watch the fireworks. Transforming. Okay. Try and try and be cl dude. I I don't know how much I can help here. I'll be honest with you. This is probably how she's gonna lose her eye here. We need details, Max. Max, tell me exactly what you're feeling. Laura, right. I don't feel so good. Not good, like how? I don't know. Just. Bad. Come closer. Let me see your eyes. I think I better stay back. Max, I need to observe you. This is a bad idea. Is this fucking close enough for you, bitch? <sighs> okay, that's great, Max. A little too close there. You can have a seat again. Jesus. Oh no. Wait, is she not handcuffed? What? Uh oh, did he slash the cuff?
I feel like you'd have a bit more reaction than that. Oh, what is this music? <laughs> Fucking superhero origin story. So much for depth perception. <laughs> Sorry, let's keep going. <laughs> oh, that's so cheesy, it hurts. See what that bastard cop's hiding. Maybe I shouldn't go over there. We need we need a syringe. Medical supplies. Check. I don't I don't want to lose the other eye, guys. Yeah, like this. Probably leave that alone. <laughs> Look for cards. I'm, I'm looking. Me in here. We need a syringe. Look for something. It's not in the showers. The tarot card showed like a safe or a locker, didn't it? Where are we thinking? I need to look quick. I'm I'm going. Doors locked. Upstairs. No here. Locked. Figures. But I guess I can't leave Max. Better keep snooping, or I could go back to my cell and wait, I guess. Going back to wait seems like a terrible idea. Does anyone see the locker? Fuck. I'm gonna need to rest soon. Ha. Mama's boy. Love mom. 56. That means he was born in... Check the card for the location. Yep. Yeah, let me let me quickly. I I need to work out where this is. I don't I don't know. I'm kind of panicking. It's just a locker. See. Those are boxes. Next room. Yeah, it's kind of gray, ain't it? Here. Can I not? No, I can't. Blockers. Whoever was wearing this can't be doing too well. Charge Sheriff's badge, because 
the fire. I'm surprised that's just sitting there. In here. Locker. Perfect. This must be what he used to knock me out. We need this. I can hide this in my cell. I need to lie down. Okay, get back. Oh, wait. Check the calendar. Yeah, I mean, full moon. Wait, whose birthday is that? <laughs> July 7th. Is that really the takeaway from that? I can think of seven reasons. Is that... Is that why? He's left us alone because he's going off for his birthday? That seems a little careless. Code? Why, why are people saying the code? What do I need the code for? There. E. What do I need a code for? Don't. Yeah. Don't. Don't be spoiling shit. If that's something that I'm not supposed to know yet. There was a crow upstairs, was there? Seven seven six five was a safe code for the shotgun. Oh, okay, right, yeah, that, that was from earlier. Gotcha. Thanks. Yeah, I was, I was worried. That's something I wasn't supposed to know yet. I think we hop back in our cell and we put this away. Was there a crow? Uh, okay, as long as I'm not time locked here, I can get the crow. Where was the crow? I didn't hear it. What's he hiding? Okay, just head on back. We need to... Eh. Get this out. The range is hidden. Nice. I have exhausted this and myself. I need to sleep. I think it's just time to go to bed. What is this? Let's look at this again. Okay, uh, I think we just call it for the night. Nap time, gang. Continue looking or go to sleep. She is exhausted. 
I'm worried she's gonna pass out on the floor or something. Probably should have closed that door if we can. <laughs> Uh, let's just go to bed. <laughs> Call up there. You want to tell me what happened? I could ask you the same thing. Why didn't you run? Just, I won't leave Max. Yeah, we're still gonna syringe him later. We need to earn his trust. I won't leave Max. We're locked inside. This doesn't mean I trust you. I don't care. I just want to help him. Turn around, hands against the wall. Travis admires your dedication. Seriously? Perfect. I am too tired to argue. But... Ugh. Me too. He pats you down. Happy? I'll brew some coffee. Oh, we're getting a treat. A refreshing beverage. All this time in jail is worth it. He didn't say the coffee was for you. Oh, don't, don't tell me that. <laughs> What's this? An education. Watch. Oh, just real quick here. Um, this is a good time, I think, for probably another water break. Uh, last one of the night, I would say that we need. Uh, we are going to keep going, I think, until we finish this. I'm in the mood for it, if you guys are down for it. Uh, but let's just let's just take another two minutes. Use the loo, get a drink, and we're gonna keep going. Okay, back in two.
Hey, folks. Oh. Hey, how you how you all doing? Are you well? We're doing a real late night stream. Um on America time, so I guess you guys are lucking out uh for today's stream. I imagine it's a bit more comfy for you for you, for you lot uh compared to everyone else. But the Europeans are still with us. I hope you're faring well. Don't worry if you can't stay for the entire thing. Um you know, like we have the vod um, and like, uh, you know, that whole channel on YouTube is there for you, you know? So, uh, you can even watch it on Twitch after the fact, and it's, it's no real issue. Go to bed if you feel like you need to. Um, but we're gonna keep going. Because I'm having a good time with this. I really do want to see it through. If I can tonight. I feel like I'm getting towards the end. Like, like this whole, like, flashback se back sequence, like, you know how in, like, Until Dawn... There's the bit where you meet up with the stranger, and then you're in, like, the final arc. I feel like we're approaching the final arc. So, I, I think we're gonna keep going. I think reckon it's about two, three-odd hours out from here. Maybe four. Maybe. I'm- as, as ridiculous as the game is, I'm still kind of enjoying it. I think I just like this style of game. The David Cage game, not made by David Cage. I like the horror aspect of it. The technical problems, I'll say it again, they just need to be fixed. There is no excuse for that shit. I was kind of curious, because when I bought this on Steam, it has mixed reviews. And I was surprised, because I know from looking at like the review scores and that, they're all very high. And I think that's specifically on PC, just because of the technical issues. I wouldn't be surprised. Especially at the start. Start was the worst of it because of the fucking bloom. I'm not as big of a fan of the characters in this as, as Until Dawn. Um, I hate how much we're focusing on these, like, guys' relationships. I don't care. <laughs> I really don't. I just want them to be alive. I feel like Until Dawn handled that better. Where it would come up a little bit. Mike and Jessica was kind of like the strongest relationship you see, and like a bit of Chris and Ashley. But, like, it was kind of just cast to the wayside and just kind of came up in moments. Whereas here, it's like, oh my god. Like, constantly, like, just gossiping. They have stopped at least now. But, like, Jesus, I could have done without, like, the four hours of dick jokes. It's no one until dawn, but I'm still having a good time playing this. And I hope that it, like, it gets a good patch. In like a week or so. Is it any better performance wise on console? Maybe someone here might know that. It's on PS5, isn't it? Like the four of you in chat that own one. <laughs> God almighty, they've been sold out forever. I hope it's better performance wise there. PS5s aren't real. Honestly, they don't feel it. They really don't. The only games I've played on PS5 is I played... I, I mean, I did play Bloodborne, but that's a PS4 game. I played Bug Snacks, but that's on everything else. I played Demon Souls, which is a PS3 game. <laughs> that's, got, that's gotta be worth something, right? <laughs> okay. Uh, did I... Hang on. Making this mistake again. There we go. Okay. Let's get back to it. At the very least, I'm pretty sure Laura's not gonna die here, because this is literally a flashback. But I imagine it's gonna affect other things, in particular how Max is doing. Trust the moon. Nice job cleaning up. The eye. I mean. It's harder than they make out in the textbooks. Especially when nobody's helping you. You're the doctor. I mean, she did pretty uh, well. Animal. Doctor. And no, Considering she was able to like, make not, a pun about it, too. And I probably never will be. Stuck in here forever. You know, just because you know, 
doesn't mean you know. You know? Uh... What? I'm not. This isn't what it seems to be. He's loosening up. You're gonna have to be more specific. You and Max are in just as much trouble as I am. My family? We didn't mean to hurt anybody. Here we go, yep. We're just trying to survive like everybody else. Do you understand? Not really. We're gonna end this thing once and for all. We? Yeah. How is your family involved? Yep. You need to know. So, how is your family involved? My family. The whiskey's worked like a charm. He's down at the bottom of a well. He's easing up. What? Family is the most important thing in the world. But if your whole family, you know, like every last one of them decided to jump down the bottom of a well and they're all just hanging on the end of a rope, how can one person be expected to pull them all back out? You can't. So you pull on that rope and you're just gonna fall right down to the bottom of the well with the rest of them. You're speaking in tongues, my man. And what's the point of that? Need a, need a little more information. You're the one at the top of the well with a rope? Yeah, even lower, it's like, what? what is this metaphor? Yes. I thought that was obvious. Yeah, okay, yeah, I got it. Just forget it. <laughs> well, <laughs> I guess that's it. <laughs> I didn't get that at all. Let's see how smart you really are. What is this? Information. Well, what does it mean? Read it. When full the moon above shines first, the beast internal shall outward burst. One by one leads lambs to slaughter. It stalks your breath, but shuns clear water. And should you yourself be cursed, armed with silver, and the first. Oh. When moon is full before its wane, rend the beast that cursed you slain. No longer shall you face your blight, or fear the dread of full moon's light. Yeah. You just gotta kill, yeah, you gotta Keep kill reading. the first one. Or like the one that got you. Uh, don't. Don't take the fucking gun. That's not gonna work. <laughs> and if it's a bite with which you're faced, cleave limb from torso with great haste. Perchance you'll save your cursed soul before infection takes its toll. Okay. To get the picture. It's not a lot to go on. And. Frankly, it's shit. Why did they have to make it rhyme? <laughs> I don't know. That's English all we have to go on. Am I right? Kill the werewolf that bit you and you'll be cured. It has to be silver. It has to be full moon. Seems pretty straightforward to me. If you can kill the werewolf, and that's a big if. I just want to cure Max. It's not as straightforward as you think. Uh, I'm not infected. Why didn't you kill it? Yeah. If you knew all this, why didn't you just kill it it's in the storm shelter when you had the chance? It's not so. I, mean, I, I was when I straightforward. No, yeah, it's so not. You... They're not so easy to hit. I was trying to protect you too. By being really creepy, yeah. 
Well, what's the plan? Okay, yeah, we need to learn more. So what's the plan? Well, that's where I'm hoping you'll come in. Me? Yeah. Because your studies. What? I haven't even started. Wait. <laughs> well, you're the best option I got. She's just a vet man. Been like, you need a priest. Damn white wolf under the full moon so long I start to think it doesn't exist, you know? Maybe it doesn't. Surely there's other people you can consult. Maybe there's another way. Whatever you believe, there's got to be some science. And you do science. <laughs> you do science? You science person. Look. Take some time to think about all this. I'll be back in the morning. Oh, what? Seen enough? Be dumb. You smart. You think good. You fight big doggo. Murders? Like a word he just said. If I hadn't, there's some kind of other investigation. If I hadn't seen that, like she's a high school, like literally, yeah. Um. Okay, I mean, I kind of believe what he has to say. Like he, he was pretty honest there. I believe him. You can't tell me you really trust that guy now. I didn't say that. I said I believe him about the werewolf stuff, not the science bit. I don't know what he wants. He's a dirty line kidnapping cop, Laura. We should be careful of anything that fucker says. You did explode, Max. Well, fuck him. He's had his chance to fix this. We're getting out of here and we're going to fix it on our own. Yeah, that means Nick can be saved, as long as we kill the other werewolf we need. Yeah? I saw what happened. What I did to your eye. Yeah. Is it bad? Yeah, it's pretty bad. <laughs> yeah, it's, uh, looking too good. I'm so sorry. That was new. That was new. Do I best to keep the peace here? It wasn't you. I know it wasn't you. I know. But it was. We're gonna fix you, Max. Promise. I promise. Like, is it bad? It's like, well, yeah, you did try to decapitate me. Um, normally that's not quite healthy in a relationship. I know they're in there. The council Ooh. didn't show up. Ooh. Bobby told me. Said you oh, shit. Bobby told me. Said you scrapped an abandoned car. They know, oh, yep. I, I worked out the rest. Why? Well, why'd you think, Chris? Jesus, Travis. They're still here. That's fucked up. Fucking get one of them, Chris. What am I supposed to do? <laughs> what was that? We just had it said. He bit one of them. It's a family of werewolves. Oh, I gotta catch this cup real quick. Whew. You shot me. I'm telling mom. Thank you, lucky star. <laughs> wasn't silver. What's your plan? You can't keep him here mom. forever. Mom, I'm handling it. Maybe if you'd done your job, they wouldn't have been at the camp. He's shooting me again, mom. 
I'd have done my job, you'd all be in prison. You were thinking that, that was all Bobby and Caleb. Are those know. hikers? And that 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 fucking journalist? Damn it, Travis. What are we gonna do now? Whatever happened to those are all the people that went missing together? Yeah. That were locked up. Shit, man. Let's go to my office. We shouldn't talk here. And yeah, so the other guys are just hunting them. They're trying to take Max. revenge. Uh. Max. Uh. What is it? Travis was just in the hall talking. The cop. So. With Chris Hackett. Was he here to let us out? No. He's the werewolf, Max. Chris Hackett is the one that bit you down on the storm shelter. Holy shit, that's... Who would have guessed? <laughs> I mean, I guess Gee, thinking God. about it, I could have... And yet you didn't. It all makes sense. That's why Chris's car was at the lodge that night. Travis was protecting him. That's why he followed us, and that's why he didn't kill the werewolf in the storm shelter because it was his fucking brother. God, it's so obvious. It's family of werewolves. Chris was the one that bit the me. Cop's then. not a werewolf. Yeah, then that's our cure. That's how we fix you. Jesus, Laura, are we thinking the same thing? Tomorrow we're getting out of here. You shouldn't say that so loud. I'm gonna get Travis's gun. And kill Chris Hackett. Really hope he's not listening right now. <laughs> hey, hey, help her! Laura needs help. Oh. Uh. Laura? <laughs> Laura, are you okay? Just resync it real quick. Here we go. <laughs> God damn it. What the hell is going on? Laura! He can see that, right? <laughs> there we go. Apparently not. <laughs> the moon has saved us. Pat chosen. <laughs> well, you really shouldn't unlock this. I'm starting to think you were really sick. Well, maybe I should consider acting as my major. <laughs> I wouldn't go that far. <laughs> we should go before he wakes yeah. up. Uh, Laura, I don't know about this, but the plan. We can't just let Max loose here. We should grab our staff. We need silver ammo. He must have some around here. What is it? One of the hags. I call. thought I heard someone. No, I, I still can't. Well, why is the hag just showing up now? It's coming from behind that door. Oh, because of course it's spirits of the damned. They want revenge, so they're gonna help her. Of course. Yeah, the ghosts are helpful. They're gonna show us the way. There's nobody in here. What the fuck? He makes them. What is it? Shotgun shells. He loads them with silver. That's where he was last month, hunting. Oh, 
Well, I guess I won't be needing this anymore. Uh, but you know, it might still be helpful. Hey, <laughs> I just realized something. We're free. Uh, not until Chris is dead. No, Max. We're not free until Chris Hackett is dead. And it doesn't look like we've got much time. I know, you're right, but... Let's just take the win for now, huh? We'll celebrate when it's over. We're going straight to Hackett's quarry, and we're ending this. Tonight. Oh, but if she only showed up when it's the full moon, that means Max is gonna be in some trouble soon. Oh no, you you haven't thought this through. Oh no. Like Max can't help you. And I made my way here to camp. Left Max, left Max at the island. Seemed like the best place for him, surrounded by water and all. Water and all. So Max is the one who attacked That's them. That's it. That's the story. And I'll but Max got out. At the same time. Wait. The island? Like, like our island? Like the one in the lake? Yeah, why? Because Jacob, he... Went back there looking for Emma, and he hasn't come back yet. Oh no! Enough. Oh shit! It's like re reassured. Ah, they're probably okay. Not there now. Well, if they were there, they're not there now. What's that supposed to mean? Don't make me spell it out for you. I've just come back from there, and there's one werewolf and no people. Oh fuck. All I know is I have to do this. I have to kill Chris Hackett before it's too late. I'm sure Max is fine. After you saw me at the pool, after I shot Chris, um, I went back to the island expecting Max to be back to normal. But... Uh-oh. Wait, did she... She didn't shoot Chris, though. She didn't, this is still a flashback, because th that was... That was the kid. She got the wrong one. She shot the girl that time, yeah. No one told it as multiple. Yeah. Max? Like the girl that was tossed in the pool. That's what she shot, I think. Max! It wasn't. It wasn't Nick, was it? Nick's not been loose long. Crow. Hello. Oh no. Come on, Laura. Might have already shot Max, yeah. Come on, Laura. Let's not scuff this. Quickly paddle. Okay. 
Okay. As long as he doesn't figure out the zip line, we're okay. What was that music as well, yeah. <laughs> so the werewolf I killed can't have been Chris. That wasn't a werewolf. It was Kay Kaylee Hackett, Chris's daughter. Whatever I shot, that was no girl. Unless, I, I guess, it turned back after I shot it when I went to the island. Wait, so how come Max didn't kill you then? Oh, no. I didn't realize this. Go with a bite. He tried. I got away. I need to end this. <laughs> oh, no, Brian. We don't have much time. Don't do it. Wait, who's this? <laughs> oh. Is the hag? So this is our new gas. <laughs> Smell good, don't I? Go on, take a bow. Go on. Uh oh. Dumb fucking animal. This must be how things started, I guess. The werewolves got out from the circus, was it? Meanwhile, completely forgot about Jacob. Please let me go. Okay, I didn't mean for this to happen. Please, please. Oh my God, why aren't you answering me? Oh, oh, oh. Is your is your money that you want? Cause, cause my dad's got money, like lots of it. Oh yeah. I mean not really, but you could get some, probably. Okay, come on, Carl. <laughs> Just let me go, please. I'm so sorry! Can you get a load of this, kid? Oh, Jesus Christ! Did he get bit? No, he hasn't been bit, actually. That's too, Bobby. They're trying to just keep the kids safe, I think. It's with aggressive force, you know? Hey! Hey! That's hey, two. Where are you going? Hey! Hey! Oh, there's the other one. Oh shit! Is that Chris or Max though? Or is it Nick? Oh, we get some more. We get some more music. No, there is a Chris. There is a Chris. There's Chris Hackett now. We're looking for him too. That might be Nick. Careful what you wish for. Careful what you wish for. I don't think anyone wished for this. Who asked for it? What? what? It's so such bad choices for the music. I know it's streamer mode. I know there's some licensed music that's playing, but like, can we not entertain the notion of a always nice original to soundtrack? You know, isn't it fun delving into the past? Maybe so we don't have this. Bad oh no! Shall we have a look at uh. what you found? Hello, card lady. How you doing? Oh, d uh, you nothing to show, nothing to see. What more do you want me to say? Find the cards or stumble around in the dark. Choice is uh -oh. yours. You'll be seeing me a few more times before the night's over. I look forward to that, as long as you follow the right path, of course.
Okay, there's still hope for us. Imagine if you get no character, you get a bad ending. I think, like, the evidence is what's going to determine the ending. We really need that, and we're struggling with the evidence. Where is Chris Hackett? Shut up. Wow, rude. Guys, she murdered Kaylee. We have been over this. Uh, yeah, Ryan, you just need to cool it. Uh, Caitlin, what do I do? Oh, wow, real strong showing on the leadership front. I said shut up. Laura doesn't respect you. <laughs> no way, I am not getting involved. This is all you, buddy. Look, just think about everything that's happened tonight, okay? That's all I'll say. All this over a poem. You heard a woman. Hold up, you, you said you heard a woman crying? When you escaped? Why? What do you know? It's the ghost story he told us about, right, Caitlin? This isn't a ghost story. It's a creature feature. It's really happening, and you're all in it. Your bracelet. Oh. Don't sh- Brian, cool it. What are you doing? I'm trying to help. Worst case scenario, this should give you a fighting chance. And this will kill them? For good? Yeah. Oh, it's a silver bracelet, of but course. But what if it's Nick or someone? Like I said, worst case scenario. Ryan, put that fucking thing down before you hurt someone. Ryan, please. So... Come on. Where does Chris Hackett live? When he's not at camp, I mean. Uh, mean? I won't tell you. <laughs> I don't... Brian, you gotta work with us here. We're trying to save the gang. Go on, do your dramatic slow head tilt. Look at the wall for answers. The wall will guide you. What makes you think I know that? Uh, you guys are counselors, right? You've spent the last two months here? He's not in the storm shelter. I'm clearly getting nowhere hunting him in the woods. I need a place to start. I think that spooky house behind these woods. Oh. Dude. What? We gotta help her, Ryan. Maybe there's another way. Maybe. Listen, there could be another way. Have you thought about that? I've spent the last month thinking about nothing else. Look, when the sun comes up, I am stuck until the next full moon. So is Max, so is anyone else he's bitten. How is that our problem? Why don't you ask your friends in the woods? Don't forget about Nick, dude. We should stop yelling. Okay, any closer one of the spray you two with cold water. Ryan, let's just get out of here. I'm running out of time. If I can't find Chris Hackett, then a lot more people are going to get hurt. This is how we do science. I'm going with you. What? what? Uh, yeah, what they said. There's nothing to do with it. Be friendly. Ryan, I'm please. I'm show you that Chris Hackett has nothing to do with this. <laughs> no. <laughs> Ryan! He wanted us to stay inside God. tonight. He wanted us safe. I, I don't care what you think. I don't care what you think. Shut up. Fine. Do whatever you want. <laughs> Wait. Shut up. You saw okay. What to Nick. He was bitten. Fuck off. Yeah, come on. Everything's gonna be fine. That cop car you stole. Where is it? What is this whiplash? Why? It was a stolen cop car. You're gonna have to try and fix the minivan. Get somewhere safe. How long do you have? An hour or two? I don't know. It doesn't seem like an exact science. Then we better get going. Let's go. Yeah, it's like... It's a... Oh, I'm so confused. 
I don't understand, Ryan. Are you sure this is the right way? Pretty sure. I want yeah. Laura to live. Pretty or definitely? If I can. What do I look like? A tour guide? He's the only character not to make, like, dick jokes constantly. Yeah, have you been there? Have you actually been there before? I mean, n no. Wait, seriously? I know as much as you do. How well do you know Chris Hackett? Mr. H, pretty well. Like you're pretty sure we're going the right way? When I first came to camp, I was going through some personal shit, and Mr. H helped me sort it out. Not a bad a person. Good guy. You don't know him like I do. He just you don't know him at turns all. Turns people okay, into werewolves okay, and murders a few others. Pet. Why are you like this? <laughs> this is dead pants. <laughs> okay, uh, reflective. Keep the peace. Look. I don't think anybody knows anybody, not really. Well, I know Mr. H, and, and he never hurt any of us. That's uh, really well, not true. I know for a fact he's not the good guy you think he is. All he does is try to help people. That's what his whole camp is all about, to help the kids. Yeah, I don't doubt it. You know what I have to do, right? I know. But only if we can't talk to him. I don't think he's going to be way. down for talking. Lead the way. Come on, Ryan. Hey, uh, Mr. Werewolf, can you stop, like, cannibalizing people in the night? Like, I don't- I don't think he's gonna be open to that idea. Your house. Oh, this so isn't haunted. So, he lives in some redneck mansion with his redneck family in the ass crack of the woods? Look at this place. No, but- Oh, Jesus. His mom lives, I think. Never been there, but... If we're looking for answers, it's probably the best place Are we to gonna start. find Jacob in here? So... Uh, wait, how do we get there? What do you mean? Oh, wait! How? With the brothers, right? There, there was- there's three of them, isn't there? There's two. There's the police officer, there's Chris, but then there's the other one. Who's hunting them. Because it's like- what was it? Oh, it was like- Back it or something? Bobby? John Cena, dude. Is one of them the brothers? Travis, Chris, and Bobby. Bobby's not dead, is he? It's a messed up family dynamics. Back it is the cop. Oh, okay, I'm trying. I'm trying. Wait, I'm trying to get them. Cause there's three of them, and he thought there was a typo, and like, well, he must mean someone else. John Cena is Bobby's son. Okay, gotcha. Okay, I'm mixing them up, right. Do we get to the house? That's a really We've worked at the werewolf question. family, at least. We've gotten that far. I can't wait for them to make Maybe a game about don't. vampires. It seems like that's where we're going next. Honestly. <laughs> Look, I understand Chris is your friend. If there was another way, I'd tell When the goes werewolves. Sure. We gotta get a vampire yeah. one. Laura, we have its Morbius. Chris is a good man. This isn't about good and evil, Ryan. Just how can you be so certain? If I let my conscience Ryan's slow gonna me down die now, everything gets a lot worse for everyone. Believe me, if there's another way, I'm all for it. Hey, where are you going? You're on a timer, remember? There must be another way across somewhere. I got you. Careful, it's gonna go. Oh god. Oh. That is a little unfortunate. Oh no, the water. Holy shit. Are you okay? Laura? It's, it's gonna be like burning her. Stocks your breath, but shuns clear water. Oh my god, Laura. 
Jesus, Mary and jazz hands. <laughs> Here's a thought. What are you doing? Relax. Look. What? What big eyes you have, Grandma. No shit. This is back. Can you see yellow in my eyes? Define yellow? Shit. We haven't got much time. Okay, we gotta get going. We know I'm long for Laura. First things first, is there a playing carriage down here? Will have been back. Backpacks, Batman. Oh, what's this? Why did water start to heal? No, she's transforming. That's what's doing the healing. This must be part of the old working quarry. The gotten belongs of a quarry miner abandoned in the tunnels. Letter foreclosure within indicates that this has been down here since the 1930s. Thanks. Wait, that was another hacket. Can I can I actually read it? I need it with the text. The valued employee. Forget to inform me that your services at Hackett's Quarry will no longer be required. It's my intention to return the, the site of the central quarry to an area of natural beauty by flooding it and allowing a lake to form in its place. We be paid until the end of this coming week, then asked to vacate the premises. I'd like to thank you for your continued loyalty and wish you well in all your future endeavors. Yours fatally, Septimus Hackett. White bastard just can't pay us last time I trust a Hackett. It was a lake, changed to a lake to keep the werewolves in, yep. Absolutely. Hell of a name, Septimus, yeah. I don't name them like they used to. It's a pickaxe. These must have been quarry tools. The rusty old tools are leftovers from the Hackett's industrial heyday before the mine's foreclosure. I'm so sad that we- Oh, oh wait, no, that's not evidence. I'm so sad we missed some early days. evidence, though. No duh. Still getting no some out of it. But we definitely missed a lot. Septimus means the seventh son, I believe. Okay. I'm gonna name my kid Septimus. Only your seventh kid. Did you hear that too? Silas. It's her. Who? The hag of Hackett's quarry. It's like she's warning they us off. They both heard it. Or guiding us. I can think of seven reasons. Yeah, maybe there was like, there was seven relatives in the family. That could be it. That's Can not good. That? No, they can't have done. This place keep is not up to code. Yeah, we should keep I walking. Mean, if the code is literally crumbling to the ground, then I think it's doing fine. Laura, you have like possibly 20 minutes to live. Yeah. We really need to go. Careful. Coming over here. It's a collapsed walkway. Ryan's gonna be in a lot of trouble escaping from here. Just look at this place. Oh! Jesus Christ! Make that. I could really do with a hamburger right about now. Oh no. Stop being weird. 
That's the first sign. They get hungry. Creepy smile. Let's not kill Laura if we can help oh, it. Oh boy, this is high. That lit up. Whoa. This. Do you think actually something is in here with us? It's kind of Either that or this route isn't as disused as we thought. Getting a bit peckish. I think there's an in and out down here. A long way down. And a sign. Well, cave in did not end. Cave out. <laughs> Ryan, Look please. Look who's finding their funny bone. And this way. That light so just turns deal, on. Then? What do you mean? The whole mysterious brooding loner thing, it doesn't quite fit with the I love my camp leader vibe. So I don't fit into the right box, is that what you're saying? Uh, what box would that be? You know, that's not what I meant. Be patient. You know that's not what I mean. We really don't have time for this. Years. You get to know a place and it feels like a second home, you know? I mean, like, Laura, you're gonna happen. die. What about your friend, uh, Caitlin? Is that her name? It seems we like she's gonna stop getting to you. know each other. We just need to go. Yeah, she she has the hots for me. Dylan does too. Oh, modesty, thy name is Ryan. I'm not being smug about it. It's just a fact. They're not exactly secretive about it. So, what about you? Who do you like more? I not. I don't know. Answer. Thank you. Maybe neither. Perfect. Like, nobody cares, Ryan. This way. I see a light. Yeah. Or you can just hang out here. Up to you. Oh, no, she's getting no stronger. Eating their spinach. Ryan, so hey. Turn you on your go brain. Into the collapsing nightmare tunnel first, or shall I? I think he's so oblivious. Oh, the Wheel of Fortune, sure. I watched that game show back in the day. It wasn't that great. Looks promising. Oh, no, I'm thinking of winning streak, actually. That's the Irish one. I want to talk like iffy game shows. Do not like the webs. The tree here. Uh. What's this? Careful. Splinters. Thanks. I'm fine. Super strong now. Guess we found the party. Alcohol. From Prohibition. These are rum running tunnels. That would make that liquor almost a hundred years old. Probably still good. Good. Try vintage. Well, I guess the hot Want some alcohol? Liquors. Makes sense. I guess when the quarries are done, they branched out. Come on, time travel later. What? The shutting down winning streak, probably for the best, honestly. It wasn't that great. I think this is it? Uh, beach me, I'm pretty much completely lost. <sighs> yeah, me too. Okay, we can just rip the door open. How can they still be talking and joking like she's not literally about to turn? Like, that's the thing. Yeah. 
Somebody's been eating their spinach. Like, <laughs> you're gonna become a werewolf. Spinach is powerful, man. Uh, this is getting dangerous here. Come on, Caitlin, I trust you. Uh, Will the VOD be uploaded right after it's finished? Uh, probably here? not. You can watch it on Twitch. You can watch it here for a while. Takes time. Okay. My bad. Uh, that's kind of my bad. Had a bit of a tumble with one of the locals. The fuck, Caitlin? This place is wrecked. <laughs> Well, you should see the other guy. We did get the blood, though. What do you think happened to Jacob and Emma? Probably nothing. Hopefully. I mean, I mean should we go find them? Warn them? I think the safest thing, the most responsible thing, is to try and get help. Right. And then we can come back for them. And Nick. And Nick. Here we go. Yeah, so like, Abigail must not have been bitten. We were wrong about that. Like, she's been fine. Wait. She's just clawed or something. What? Here's Emma. That's right, she hid in the car. Is there... Is there something in there? I don't know. Okay, we do. What is it? I... Jacob? Emma? Are they... Should I open it up? Your funeral, buddy. <laughs> oh, oh, she makes me! She makes me! Oh. Hey, it's us! Oh, she geez. just scurries! Oh my god. Oh. I, wait. I'm wait. so sorry. Dylan, I am Wait, so they sorry. called I out to you, I Emma. And I thought it's not Mace. What? Air freshener. Oh. How did she yeah. not hear him? It's all I could find in the van. Why was she jumping up and down in the car? They yelled. Uh, Dylan, <laughs> you're, uh... It's been a long night. So she was in the police station this whole time? Insane, right? This whole time, we were having such a fun summer. We never knew. Jeez. Okay. Can you fix it? No. Oh. Not without some parts. Specifically, a rotor arm. There's a scrapyard up the road. Thank God it's that rather than so making it catch fire from it. earlier. Well, no promises, but if there's hope, that's where we're going to find it. That sounds like a long shot. I need you here. I need, to, I need help. Come on. Look, I need you. We need you. Fine. Okay. Once again, Dylan puts himself in mortal danger for the sake of his work friends. Dylan, please. There's like werewolves on the loose. What exactly are we supposed to do? I mean, the van is nice, but it's not exactly Fort Knox. Well, I expect that. There's a shelter under the lodge. You could be safe there for a while. All right. Abby, oh, you're with no, me. Oh, no, no, but the ladder rung. You're not safe. We know what happened there. Pat chosen. Okay, we got it. We got it. We haven't checked on the packs tab in a while. Yeah, like, oh god, there's been a lot happening here. How we doing? So Laura tried to help Max. Max was concerned about Laura's well-being in prison. Laura was sympathetic to Max over his rejection letter. Laura was supportive of Travis during their imprisonment. Okay. Laura was honest with the cop about the accident on the road. Laura then tried to take Travis's gun. Or use the syringe on Travister and her and Max's escape. I feel like there was no other way to get out of that, though. We, we have to do that one. 
They could remove the rotor arm from the minivan. The minivan failed to start, so the councils couldn't leave. The rotor arm fell out of Jacob's pocket when he was swimming in the lake. Jacob chose not to dive into the lake in search of the lost rotor arm. <laughs> okay, great. Uh, Abby chose to help Emma break into the cabin. Abby was able to explore inside the cabin. Abby put the forgotten toy in her bag. That That's not come back yet. Abby left her backpack in the lodge kitchen. They were to hide in the cabin without alerting the creature. Wait, was that toy gonna go off? But because we left the backpack, we were safe. That toy could have got us killed. And Dylan was bit. Okay, Emma chose not to take the fireworks with her. And we fired the shotgun into the air when we rejoined the others. And found nothing of use left at the fire pit. We got the fireworks, Emma was left defenseless. <laughs> oh, god damn it. Okay. Dylan opened the trap door and he loosened the rung. Great. I became the next save when he was attacked in the woods. I can appreciate it, Abby trying to help him during the attack. Abby shot Nick. <laughs> Abby offered Laura her bracelet to fashion into a silver bullet. Oh, because we did that, maybe that we actually only have a silver bullet now. Because otherwise we might have given it to Nick. Oh, but how are we going to be able to tell which one's Nick now? Ryan raced through the forest in time to see Nick being dragged away by a hunter. Ryan didn't shoot at the hunter. Ryan witnessed the hunter shoot his fingers off. That's how we learned that. Jacob didn't distract the hunter. Hunter poured blood over Jacob's face. Ryan heard a rustle in the bushes and fired the shotgun, narrowly missing Jacob, unfortunately. Jacob was captured by the hunters. Ryan decided to sever Dylan's hand. Ryan used a chainsaw to sever Dylan's hand. Dylan's infection stopped spreading. So we, I think that's how we saved Dylan. I think he would have died otherwise. Uh, Laura did not shoot Travis when escaping her cell. Okay, I mean, that is hopefully good. Uh, Dylan and Caitlin went to the scrapyard to find the working vehicle. Okay. The sound is a VCR tape. Yeah, it's just like a slight, like, rewinding sound. It's like static. That's all it was. How many people here have ever used a VCR tape? Oh god. I realized I might be old here. Some people will have. Okay, how many people haven't? What Specifically haven't. Huh? What was that? Oh, it's nothing. We got we got guests downstairs. We don't what? want any more blood on our hands. He went to see mom. They're, they're just here. Keep it down. You keep it down. Shh. Oh, there's something here. What's in here? Oh, give me that. We be like kind of quiet with our footsteps around there. Have you ever used a VCR tape? Let's see what the poll says. Could be in for a shock here. That's a hat. Jeez, poor kid, head this big. Ryan was supposed to be whispering. Bobby. Who's Bobby? And something of them. Slip on the oil. <laughs> Gotta be quiet here. It's coming from a bed. We gotta not shoot this one that's in here, because this one might be Nick. Here's Jacob. Jacob.
Hey, it's Ryan. Jesus, what happened to you? Ooh, okay, I... Hmm. What do we think? I don't think opening... Yeah, I think this is a strong no. Have you ever used a VCR tape? We're not old! 78% of people said yes! And there's some young... Young ones in chat. <laughs> We're not old. People have used VCRs. Oh, thank God. Don't open the cage. Hey. Bad idea. Oh, shit. Look, you gotta get me out of here, man. How? Seriously. It's electrified. Okay, um, there's a box in the corner of the room. I think that's how they're operated, okay? I saw this old guy, under dude. If we the turn that off, that. that's just gonna attack you. That's what I'm worried about here. Why are you here, Travis? You ought to be out with the others. Like I say, we've been all night long trying to keep those kids safe. Well, she's not the hag, she's just mom. Mom. Ma. Uh. <clears throat> It's Kaylee. She's dead. <laughs> no. The boys are bringing her in right now. Wait, they're... Now I know you got to screw loose in that cop head of yours. There ain't no way to kill her in her Oh my god, yeah, of course. They're, they're, they're all bullet. in. She's dead, Ma. Wait, what? What? No. They're all working together. They're just trying to contain them. God damn. There's no, like, two factions thing not here. My not my only granddaughter, not my Kaylee, not my little Kaylee, not my little Kaylee, not my little Kaylee! You goddamn piece of shit! Mom, please. Not my little Kaylee! God damn you! What did you do to her? Yeah, so, like, the family is trying to maintain themselves. That's what's going on. Did you get bitten? Is she crazy? Everyone here is in on the family. Oh, wait, should I stop Laura? Oh. Oh. Laura. Well, I. What you I didn't know what she was doing. Uh oh. <laughs> I don't think there's any point in calling out. Down. Is that just Nick dead? <laughs> I wasn't paying attention for like a minute. Be careful, make sure that she doesn't bite. Herb you. Oh shit. Welcome back. Did you miss me? Hopefully, you've brought me some more of my cards. Let's have I wasn't paying attention. <laughs> I don't think I can reload it. I don't know how. Uh. Oh no. <laughs> Can I replay a slight sequence, or is Nick just dead because I just didn't pay attention for like a minute? But I didn't know what it was, like stop Laura, like I didn't know what she was doing. I didn't have any idea. I didn't know what that prompt was. You weren't looking, oh god. <laughs> Nick's just dead. <laughs> Try to reload. I don't know how. I've no I don't know how to do that. 
Quit the main menu. There's nothing in paths. Oh well. <laughs> no rewinds. The Empress. Look at her. Ah, Nick wasn't that great anyway. <laughs> Those at the top can fall the hardest. Such a shame to nurture little monsters only to live long enough to watch them kill you. <laughs> but it's no less than she deserves. The Wheel of Fortune. Yeah, let's take that one. After all, fortune is nothing but a spinning wheel. Sometimes you have to take a chance. Karma works in mysterious I wasn't paying attention. Favors, I didn't see what she was doing. I was just looking at her chat. It's like, wait, why do I have to stop her? <laughs> closely. Though the wheel spins, the eagle-eyed can tell where it's going to stop. Details. Okay, uh, see more. Then choose the possible future you'd like to witness. And watch carefully. I'm sure Try it's fine. And find some clarity in the chaos. Uh, what what we feeling? The Empress of the Wheel of Fortune. I kind of like the sound of the wheel. I kind of want to spin it. Let's spin the wheel. Mystery box. Uh... Go. You still got time. Be careful now. Be very careful. That was a lot of blood. Achievement unlocked. Chapter 8. Have you been there before? The scrapyard? Nah. Just seen the sign on my way to camp. What if we just, like, walk to the main road? This isn't the main road? No, this is all Hackett property. The Can't main road believe is Nick is dead. That way. Wait, how do I know so much more about everything than you do? Wait, shut up. So basically, it's another hour walk to the main road, and then at least another three to four hour walk until we hit the nearest whatever? Yeah. What was that? Let's just keep moving. Okay. Hey, come on. So, I guess this is me now. What? You're gonna look great with a hook. We can call you Hooky McHookface. Seems a bit insensitive. Oh, what you, I, but we gotta keep positive. Yeah, I guess it's pretty unique. I could get different attachments for it. <laughs> yeah, man. Lean into it. One hell of a story, too. Yeah, I guess it's something to talk about on the radio station. Change stream to we didn't care about Nick. In a few years. You, me, maybe even Ryan. No, we're good. He deserved to die. <laughs> I would have shot him myself if Laura hadn't done it. We missed her, our shot. The what? Kind of got close at the fire. Pit. Oh, what's going on? Wait, wait, no, what are you? Crazier was something about to happen. There's always next year, right? Well, let's get through this year first. Wouldn't really matter anyway. It looks like we finally know Ryan's type. Confident and heroic with an eye patch. So pirates. Maybe she shivers his timbers. <laughs> oh no. There. Okay, scrapyard time. We need to get through here, okay. I was like the stupidest dash as well. <laughs> Relax, it's motion sensor. <laughs> All I had to do was just not shoot him in his cell. Like he was harmless. Oh look, steampunk's <laughs> back in. Ew! Come on, this way. Oh well. Uh, 
Hey, we're safe in here. So what do we do now? I didn't even well, padlock the door in. I guess we just make ourselves at home. Live up some cocktails, see what's on the TV. <laughs> Uh, just don't be annoyed. Why are you always going. so positive? Ugh, why do you keep asking me that? Uh, I asked you about your confidence, not your whatever is happening right now. Ugh, I don't know. I guess I just don't like to see other people sad. Is this why you do videos? Uh, just be friendly. Oh, please. What? Is that really what you think of your followers? Just a bunch of sad sacks that need you to cheer them up? Well, come after me. Don't come after my followers. My emanation. Oh, God. You really need to come up with a better name for that. Hell yeah, I do. <laughs> Get a load of this. Get a load of this guy. Am I right, RT gamers? Am I right, the Rumble Tumble night, huh? gamers? Yeah. Rumble Tumblers? Come on. I want to hear you say it. Fuck this night. Fuck it all the way to morning. <laughs> Put me down. You know why it doesn't matter that Nick's dead too? Easy, Ma. I keep calling him Chris. I think I said Chris was dead like four times there. What a fucking hell! Bitch. Everybody, just relax. Can't shoot, but you can't see. I don't see even know who Nick one. is. <laughs> Did she just let that happen? Gotcha. Yo, what you did to my Kaylee. We could just Get shoot your hand off. Everybody stop! I think we got it. What the fuck is going on up here? Uh, uh, wake up. I don't think wake that's up. going to help. Wake up. Wake up. I don't think... Oh. She's gone. Little Bobby. Tomorrow's gone. Cuba. Yeah. No more party. No more protecting anyone. Travis. Oh, no. Did he drop the gun? Apparently. Come on, Ryan. Is he going into the laundry chute? Is that his grand plan? He doesn't even know where that goes. Fuck. This is working out. Come on, Ryan. Okay, okay. All right, that's not good. That's a bad place to get stabbed. Uh, you're supposed to leave it in, but it's gonna be bad either way. Yeah, I'm not doing that. Like that knife's all that's holding it together as much as, as kind of horrible as it is right now. You will just bleed out if you pull it out. I don't know if this is the time, but... Just you and me, knifey.
Haley's letter. Haley Hackett's letter of confession addressed to her grandmother. Oh, that's an actual piece of evidence. Along with the flesh. We miss one in chapters. So there's one in each chapter, apparently. That means we're on the second to the last chapter. Can't believe we missed one in chapter one. <laughs> Can I not read the letter? No, normally it lets me. We're just gonna take it with us. Uh, what's under here? Hiding spot. Oh, oh that's vile. Pee bucket? I don't think that was for peeing. Guys, hear like a pop. This is lag. Uh, there's a bucket. There's a door over here. Oh, here's the deck card. Lovely. Oh boy. That takes many forms. It could mean change, transition, transformation. Often interpreted as a beacon for the hopeful. In your case, it just means debt. That's unfortunate. He doesn't know we're in here. We should just hide. He doesn't have reason to suspect we're in here. Maybe. Check in the house. I'm gonna have to hold my breath because of the poop. Red, 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 red. Okay, there wasn't red. I'm close. Stand by. Over. You should probably close the door, man. He's coming. Why'd you just stop being sneaky? Come on. <laughs> yeah, you tell him, Ryan. No, you got him. Uh, we might need to hide him, though. Wait. Carol, please. I 
Don't know where Marcus is. I could hear you breathing, little girl. We're okay. If it, wait, if you can hear us, why did you just leave? We do have the problem that Laura is going to transform soon as well. Don't play the p- <laughs> Don't investigate this. I- <laughs> Why would you do this? <laughs> don't, don't play the fucking piano. <laughs> In what world is that a good idea? There are bears around here. Those are the hackers hunting prowess. You think they want to cover up the bullet wounds and signs of injury, as they serve as a reminder that uh, these animals are definitely dead. I don't think those are bears. I'm not playing the piano, no. It's not the time. Maybe the bears will still come to save us. Door out there, but then there's a door in here too. Stop off in here real quick. Anything over here? This is the family tree. The Hackett family have, have been around for quite some time. Their roots running deep in the local area. Kaylee, Caleb, Amelia, Robert, Christopher, Travis. Amelia? Oh no, like married in. Amelia Grant. Gotcha. Amelia, Amelia must have known what was going on there. That's some Twilight shit. It just should hold Chris, Caleb, and Kaylee. Camp's over, they keep hunting the, the white wolf. Oh, is the white wolf like the ancestor to it all? They'll come back sooner or later. It'll be safe if we use blood. Last thing we need is more casualties. But the family is trying to contain it, yeah. They're trying to liberate themselves of the curse. I don't think it's Garrett or Rivia, no. <laughs> That's quite right. We don't need to play Witcher 3. I love the second one. It is the sun. This is not good. We ain't playing games no more, little girl. Try me, motherfucker. Oh. You know something? I ain't got enough silver to kill you. But I sure to hell can make you suffer. Oh, no. Oh, come on! We gotta fight! <laughs> Carol, you can't- you don't want to do this! Come on! <laughs> A 
attack or run? It's the Wheel of Fortune scene, is it? Oh god, it's some of it! Maybe? The Wheel of Fortune, after all, Fortune is nothing but a spinning wheel. Sometimes you have to take a chance. Watch closely though, the wheel spins, the eagle eyed can tell where it's gonna stop. I think Ryan dies there too, unfortunately. I think we want to run. Yep. Get out of there. Hey, what's your position? What's your position? That wasn't running. Take us three. Is that gonna? Hey, are we gonna look at who it is? No. Where are you? Oh no. I think the wheel's still gonna happen. Shoot her. Take her face off. You know what she did to Kaylee? And she killed your mother too. Wait! It's because we were nice to him. He tried to reason. Oh, thank God. We're okay. We might be alright still. <sighs> yeah, right, Ryan's still in a lot of pain. He's just trying to get out of this house of horrors. Oh. <laughs> Not knock the knife off the wall here. Okay. You ready? Hold. Wait for the red to cease. That's the tell. I think we're good. He's in a lot of pain, though. First, besides, I'll get in trouble. I'm seeing it, please. Uh, what stab? I don't think he's gonna. No, I have to plead with him. 
I have to plead with him. I have to plead with him. If I pull the knife out, I'm in trouble. The wheel, Dan, the wheel. What does the wheel say? I don't think the wheel predicted this. Nice. The wheel says you are Ryan and alive. <laughs> well, I know that much. <laughs> the problem is I don't know how to stay alive. I think he's too weak to stab. I can't take him. Alright, this, this is going to be scary, right? Come on, Ryan. Please. You stole my knife. There we go. Oh no, you've been bit. Pick on someone your own size. Travis! <laughs> He's fucking running. Easy. Easy. What the fuck happened to you? Oh, uh, you know, nothing out of the way. Oh, it's not looking too good. Oh, Ryan. Oh, how bad is it? I'm so sorry. <sighs> that bad, huh? I keep trying to fix it. Whatever this is, people keep getting hurt. Oh, no. First Max, how are you? Not your fault, yeah. Just don't be mocking. It's not your fault. I didn't have to come here. I shouldn't have let you come. Uh, you're not the boss of me. I don't know if we're going to be able to save him here. Am I dying? You've lost a lot of blood. But it'll, it'll heal though, right? Wait. Maybe, maybe oh, it will. Oh, is she going to bite him? What? Ryan, if you let me bite you, what? If you let me bite you, it means you'll be infected, which means which means it will heal. Oh, yeah. God. But it also means yeah, yeah. I got it, Big Bad Wolf. I don't really have an option here, though. Do I? I either die now or Ryan. I don't have much time. I can feel it like it's fighting to get out. If you let me bite you and you heal, then then I have to kill Chris. It's it's not killing Chris. It's killing a werewolf. It's saving your own life and mine and Max's and your friends too. Doesn't wait. Uh, hang on. Quick aside. Wouldn't Ryan have to kill Laura specifically? Or is it just like you stop the lineage for the curse? No, he can just kill Chris. Okay, right. Gotcha, okay. Let you bite Thanks, me. Guys. And live to kill Chris Hackett. Or bleed out and die. Pretty much. It's your call, for now. Uh, we're gonna have to. So we doing this or no? We're gonna have- we don't have a choice?
Because it's either that or we just die. Okay, all right. Here we go. Do it. Pat chosen. Okay. Give me a munch uh. of your finger. Nice and tender for you. Here we go. Don't pull away. You should start to feel better soon, I guess. Fuck. Right, Laura, you gotta go. You got it. Oh, I'm feeling better already. Yeah, let's go. At least none of the family died in there. Except for Nick, but... There was nothing we could do. Oh, you know, and, and the mom who was, like, shotgunned in the face. Yeah, sorry. Uh, no, she's dead, too. That's only two people dead. That's not bad. These guys never throw anything out, huh? So, do you want to give me some direction on what we're looking for specifically? Well, most of these cars look like they've already been stripped for parts. And Kaylee. Well, there's nothing we could do for Kaylee. Come on, she hardly counts. Just three okay, people so dead. So, we're looking for engines? Well, anything relatively intact. Got it. And everyone who, like, died in the carnival. As, that's just like 25 people. That's a bit spooky. Is there a tarot card? Oh, the tarot card's gonna help much more at this point. Problem. Ugh, fuck sticks. I mean, there must be a way to open it. Hmm. Maybe in that house thing. Let's take a look. What have we got? Wait, 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 check over here. It could be a hidden collectible. So hard to tell where they are because it's just like stands in random spot and it's like you got it. Yeah, we want to keep Caitlyn alive. What's this? That's gonna close it. That button is quite far away from the gate. Oh, wait, there's something upstairs. I got it. I got it. Wait two minutes there. What's this? Oh, 
Another full moon marking, yeah. These sons of bitches had it all planned out. Oh no. Oh, there's something over here? Scrapyard note. A scroll request to keep something off the, off the books is a little dodgy to say the least. Must be something here uh, they don't want anyone to know about. But oh, gee golly, I wonder what that could be. Who's T? Mm -hmm. Looks like these guys were cooking the books a little. Dodgy. You said it. Yeah, the T is obviously Travis here. Right, there's the calendar. Uh, let's head into the scrapyard. We need to keep Caitlin alive. Spotlights here. Oh, I don't like that. Shit, there's a lot of paths. Uh, what were we thinking, gang? Follow the lights. Might keep it safe. There's probably a tarot card for here, isn't there? That's like which way you're supposed to go. Like, they're given so many branching paths. I hate this. like that, please. I could hear a crow. I don't, I don't, I'm so on edge. Oh no. Sorry, that was scary. That's so annoying. We are being hunted by literal monsters, and this is what bothers you? Yeah, both are bad. Hate this. Hate this so much. Okay, go up here. There's some tower card that's just like, don't, oh, like, don't follow the lights. I heard the crow, I don't know where he is. Does anyone want to give, like, some GPS directions? I don't think we're going to find him otherwise. Bro. Use your gut. 
my 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 gut's not not too secure right now. I'll be honest with you. The louder the sound, the closer you are. Hot and cold game. This way. That just leads back. These damn cards. Okay, I'm just going up there. I'm going up there. Maybe we'll find it later. Who knows? It might be over here somewhere. Hate this. Hate this. Look. Wait, is that his car? So, you ever operated a crane before? I actually used to be pretty, pretty was that where good Chris was? at the was that the vehicle game Chris took? arcade. The kids used to call me the grabber. No, no, uh-uh. Uh oh, I hear that now. Look, why don't you see if you can lower it down so I can take a look under the hood? That's the car we gotta choose. Okay, watch my back. Sure, yeah, sure thing. Um, just uh, watch my back, yeah? Yeah. Come on, Dylan. He's pretty defenseless here, isn't he? Don't just drop it. Like somebody's mom. Just lower it gently. Never taught them how to clean up after themselves. Okay, let's see what we're working with. All right, not too complicated. Welcome back, grabber. Now you're falling away. Oh no! What the hell is going on? My bad. All right. Here goes nothing. I don't like how this is going. No, he's in there. That might be Chris's car. Don't drop it. You did it! Yeah. Uh, I think I found my calling. About time! <laughs> well, maybe we can see if we can try and get this thing running. <gasps> Score! Dylan? Oh. Dylan, you need to call us out. Dylan, you really need... What do we do? What do we do? What do we do? What do we do? I think putting her in the lift is probably not going to help her. Warner. We got her in. Oh fuck! Dylan, get the damn werewolf on the damn car! 
This is not good. Oh, what works there? What works there? Slam it. Caitlin? Drop the car, Dylan! You guys need to move. <sighs> oh, thank God, that's over. Don't de do that, that, that. Dylan, thank you. You actually saved my life. For realsies. Yeah, you know, no sweat. I just can't wait to see who they choose. What? That's one of the few times Play the music lined up. In the movie about how brave I am. Oh, stop don't breaking the fort wall. Yeah, don't okay. don't push it, game. Don't push it. You got ten ice. So, so much for our brilliant escape plan. Okay, back to the lodge. Are you nuts? Better than being out in the open. Come on. Well, I guess we'll just leave the car there. We're not going to take the rotor and we need it? No? no okay. <laughs> Alright. We didn't need that anyway. I think she got it. Are you sure? <laughs> oh no. We can't just sit here. Why not? Dylan said it's safe here. Well, yeah, I just... I don't want to be waiting around. But that's literally all we need to do. Just wait until morning, right? Fine. But we need protection. Go see what you can find. It's better than just sitting around. We need to get out of here. The ladder rung is damaged. These two are in so much damage. It's so Hero found. Another card. Take, take take your time loading it. Come on. That's the last one there. My poor boy, do you see what they did to us? How they hurt us? He's out there still, all alone. Each full moon they hunt him, armed with silver. Trying to put an end to a curse they inflicted upon themselves when they set my show ablaze six years ago. Stupid children. But little Silas, my little white wolf, he must be protected. You must not follow this path. Do you understand? Remember how I've helped you all to start Well, that's the plot. Okay. <laughs> Alright. That, uh, that wraps up uh, most of the loose bits we had. <laughs> I thought it would be a bit more of a dramatic reveal, I'll be honest. But, sure? Okay. Silas is the OG one. So we need to get Silas, ideally. Silas is silver as well. Is that right? Let me just check that again. Yeah, I, I know it is a ghost lady. Hang on. It's like the... This is just like the plot. My little white wolf. Okay. Sun, the vitality of a new day. There's still some time to wake up to the warmth of a night survived. Your choices, your actions, your very life hangs in the balance. It's up to you to find your path in the darkness and see the sun rise once again. They've actually all got wolves in them, now that I look at them. 
And Garrett's like wolf hide. Do they all have moon? No, they don't all have wolves. Okay. A lot of them have wolves. Wolf heavy. Crow heavy. Except for the devil, you know. The shit's hit the fan kind of there. There's a crow, see? There's another wolf. And there. Could be wolf blood. Stretch. Crow there. Hello, friend. Huh. Looks you know, what like we got the here? fuse is gone. That's why there's no power? Why would somebody do that? The w little white wolf. That's the one we need to kill. What is it? Silver shells. How'd they get down here? The hunter must have dropped them. It's probably how he oh, got upstairs no, he and attacked fired Caitlin. them. We need to go. Those fucking guys are everywhere. Where's the ladder? Uh. We get out of here? What'd you find? Oh, I'm just checking out this ladder. Why are you jump scared? Is that a tiny little door up there? Uh, yeah. We'll open it up. Why? We don't know it's up there. Exactly. Have you not been paying attention, like, at all? Okay, what I mean is, it might be good for us to have an escape route. You know, we don't know what's up there. It, it, the lodge, there, there also could be a, a way for us to defend ourselves. Oh, but the ladder's broken. Okay. Guess that makes sense. Wait, 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 is this... I don't have a choice here. She's just going, I can't do anything. I'm kind of just waiting for a quick time. You all right? Oh, well, yeah. Okay, yeah. that was that was close. Oh, well, we came on up. Emma, you might want to get up here too. How's Laura doing? Probably not well. Oh, they ain't getting through there in a hurry. Man, this place is huge. I might need to rest a bit. You'll feel better soon. I don't cool. think we have time, Ryan. I'm feeling pretty good, actually. What are you doing? Stop it. Do you smell that? No. Oh, no. Never mind. Let's just find another way down. A way to Chris Hackett. Don't transform. Or just a way out, maybe. I'm done being chased and stabbed. Ryan, like, you sure. really need to do another something. Another way out. Fine. Can we just, like, stop? Can we take five minutes? Like, he's just complaining. We don't have time, Ryan. Huh. What's that? Pray if we're on the right track. Stay close. Yeah, all the better to see you with, my dear. Shh. Don't have time for these, like, sarcastic comments. Oh no. Watch your step. Yep. I tell where the walk. Oh no. What was that? 
anything. This is him. I think we found Chris Hackett. Yeah, we gotta kill him. Son of a bitch. That's not Silas, though. Oh, no. We need to speak a little faster here. We need to go a little quicker. This can't be good. Meanwhile, the family. Don't do it. This is the wheel. Oh, dang it. Wait, wait. Let me. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, we got okay. We gotta try and prevent this if we can. <laughs> Silver back mirror. Bobby, the gun. What do I do? Bobby's in trouble. I got the gun. Hey! Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. That's a lot of decisions. That's a lot of decisions. That's a lot of... Wait, check the wheel. Did we just let him kill them? Shot against him. Shoot him. <laughs> you have to shoot Chris. Wait, where was Chris? Which one's Chris again? <laughs> Is that Chris, the one right in front of me? <laughs> All right. We're okay. <sighs> I couldn't tell which was which. Thanks. They didn't kill her as well. Not because we were nice to him. Yeah. Likewise. So, what now? Everyone's back to normal? What? Oh. Oh my I think God. this is over. This isn't over. Uh, Pat Chosen. I don't understand. Chris is dead. Yeah, it's not Silas. We still need to get him. Chris wasn't the first. That's not possible. Caleb. Kaylee. The girl you killed? Her brother. What? <sighs> Caleb bit Chris and Kaylee. 
But Caleb was bit by Silas. He was a good man, my brother. But then who bit Caleb? Silas. They've been tracking him for years. He's a, a gypsy, a transient. We got Chris at least. He'd been long gone from the area, but we Bit of we could end this. Anyway, there's sightings up and down the coast. A feral albino child. Giant white wolf. Yeah, Travis, don't be at that now. Yeah. White wolf. What? What'd you say? Where? Where'd you see it? Hey, oh, God. Up. At the cabins earlier tonight. Okay. Okay, it makes sense. It all makes sense. Uh, he must have been back for months, and he's what ran you off the road two months ago. Help me. Wait, was that really Silas? Help me. We can still save Caleb. We can still save what's left of my family. We, we can help those who are still alive. Um, yeah, we gotta help him. We we have to. Why the hell should I trust you? We need we need to end this. I'm not asking you to trust me. I'm telling you we can end this. We kill Silas, everyone gets better. Everyone uh, who's still alive, anyway. Oh yeah, Nick is okay, not. Okay, uh, okay. So. Not very too well, is he? Where would we even find him? I know exactly where to find him. Okay, let's go. Okay. This doesn't mean I forgive you for what you did to me. I understand. Can, can someone please get me some fucking clothes? Did she like transform for a moment? Is that why your clothes just disappeared? Yeah, she did. Oh, okay, very briefly. <laughs> You had your chance. You had your chance. <laughs> this is actually kind of spooky with the piece. <laughs> okay, I got caught. Oh, we've never paused as her. Hang on. Um. Check the old paths. Laura shot Constance in the head. I think we had to there. Uh, Laura did not attack Jebediah. Travis decided to work with Laura to find Silas. Yeah, so we wouldn't have got that if we didn't spare Jebediah, I imagine. I imagine we'd be in, like, a way worse timeline. Still loosen the rung on the ladder? The ladder rung broke when Abby climbed up. Oh, no. Okay, Laura did not shoot Travis when escaping her cell. Uh, Ryan shot Chris Hackett with silver, curing his line of infection. Ryan survived the ordeal at the Hackett House. Laura, Travis, and Ryan decided to work together to find Silas. Okay. Well, then Caitlin went to the scrapyard to find a working vehicle. Caitlin and Dylan worked together to escape the scrapyard. Abigail and Emma found silver shells in the storm shelter. And when Abigail found her way into the lodge. I, I assume Emma got up there, despite the ladder. But wait a minute. How's Nick doing? <laughs> oh. Yeah, and you failed. <laughs> Doesn't matter. There's still time. We can still come out on top. Past is the past. Yeah, I think this is the final Let's chapter now. Just <clears throat> look to the future, shall we? We get one last card. Death. Death takes many forms. It could mean change, transition, well, this is my fortune transformation, card here. often interpreted as a, a beacon for the hopeful. In your case, it means, well, it just means death. <laughs> the other one kind of gave the entire plot. <laughs> Maybe that's more helpful. <laughs> I don't like how you're laughing so much after reading that card. The sun, 
the vitality of a new day. There's still time to wake up to the warmth of a night survived. Your choices, your actions, your very life hangs in the balance. It's up to you to find your path in the darkness and see the sun rise once again. This was the one that gave the entire plot, wasn't it? The Hierophant? Where did you find this? Where did you find it? This shouldn't be here. Perfect, yeah. He's been through enough pain. No, no. This one's no. important. My poor boy. You see what they did to us? Oh, this is a special one. Six years ago. Oh, shit. No. <laughs> What have they done? What have they done? Ah! We get the look of that. Uh oh. I only had silence though, is it? Uh. Silas can't beat that already. Oh jeez. Oh, you need to get out of here. What? Why would you bad decision, lady? Silas, yeah. Can tell by the dentures. I always can. This is the sheriff. Curse them. Did she? Mommy's coming, Silas. Oh no, this is for Silas. Mommy's coming, Silas! 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 <laughs> I don't, I don't. Maybe she's gonna find him. Silas got out, yep, Silas survived. Tower. We didn't find that card, did we? No, no, no. My poor boy. You see what they did to us? How they hurt us. He's out there still, all alone. Each full moon they hunt him, armed with silver, trying to put an end to a curse they inflicted upon themselves when they set my show ablaze six years ago. Stupid, stupid. Little Silas, my little white wolf. You must be protected. You must not follow this path. Do you understand? Remember how I've helped you all this I, time? 
I mean, I kind of have to, though. Remember how much I've done for you? Why exactly did the Hackett family burn down the caravan? I still don't really understand that. It's just like blatant crime. Like, fuck them. Yeah, seems that might be that, yeah. Oh. What? What the fuck? Why am I on top of a fucking tree? Oh, how you doing, Max? Laura! What? How the hell am I gonna get down? Rob himself. Asked an answer. Play as Max now? Back at the treehouse. There was one here before. This is the one that chased Emma. I imagine that one's still on the island somewhere? Where the hell are my clothes? That one was Max. You got are you sure? Kid. I thought. Okay, I thought Max was put there after that. He chased Emma. Right. Okay. Gotta find Laura. Okay, uh, where are we going? Killing it here, Max, as well. Have a look. Uh, it's through the woods? I don't know where we're going at this point. I feel like we're very near the end. Like, th this is the final chapter now. We're looking for Silas. We gotta kill him to end this. Taking the hat. Where are we going? That's the walkway back to the um, the, like the zipline tower. Could go up that way. Oh, you need to be careful here, Max. You can't do water anymore. Life. Swim to shore. <laughs> uh, so I'm tempted to actually do this solely because there's been one guy in chat for the last five minutes that's been telling me, don't do it, before this option came up. And purely for that reason, I might just jump into the ocean. You know who you are. <laughs> Um, but I am going to try and save the kids. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> that just ends. It's like, do you want to kill Max? Yes, no. The table, help me. That was a short sequence. Well, 
Can't get much worse than it already is, right? Oh, I think it could, Dylan. Great. Just like the cartoons. It's been off and on all night. Gives us a little time. How do you figure? They don't like water, remember? Right, right. Oh, we should have just been swimming in the lake all night. And die of hypothermia? No. Fuck's sake, right, Dylan. Well, we're good now. <laughs> Night's not over yet. These fuckers know we're in here, and they're coming back first chance they get. Great news. Okay. All right. We gotta get a vantage point. Come on. Is Dylan a Scooby Doo fan? I, f I f do feel like Dylan with his goofiness and that is a bit of a shaggy, but uh, like a very smart shaggy at the same time. He has Paul True in like moments where we, he, he has actually got a brain compared to most of the characters. Caitlyn is absolutely Velma. Uh, because she's the best character. It's no contest there. And Jacob's like scrappy do. <laughs> but like from the live action movie. Probably close that window. That we kind of haphazardly found that. Are there any more uh, entry points to close? We do anything here? Check all the windows. Jesus fucking Christ! D Dylan is so tall. We're really short. That locked? I don't think there's anything I can do with that. Okay. Entry points are closed, yeah? Yep. That upstairs. I think closing that window was kind of important. What character was Nick? Um. The skeleton in the coffin. <laughs> it wasn't the ghost, no, because saying he's the ghost assumes he's alive. That's the point of Scooby Doo. Every episode of Scooby Doo, like they debunk it. Basically, like the term is like, no, it's just like it's the waiter or something. This nice to put a name to a big mean face. So, what you're like, Mr. H's brother, I guess? Who the big dude from earlier when you and Ryan went to the radio hut, Mr. H's brother, I guess, right. I probably shouldn't have let that guy throw the blood in my face earlier then, should I? We did just lose a gun throughout that whole sequence. Maybe I should have defended myself. This. Jeez. MC really struggling if they're begging for a dollar. Camp letter. Packet is asking campers' parents for additional donations to help the lodge renovation costs. Isn't that what camp fees are for? Where else could that money where else could that money be going? 
Have there been updates on any of like the question mark bits? No, like absolutely none of them. I don't know how we get that info. Oh, that was a person. Yeah, there's a question mark instead of an uh, uh, exclamation mark instead of a question mark on some of them too. Have we just like not found the evidence for any of them? Can you select them? No, you can't. Like none of these are updated. Okay, maybe it's like a post game thing. The exclamation points in the menus, you can click on those. Can I? Oh my god! <laughs> okay, thank you. What do they do with these posters doing Chris Hackett's possession? He must have forgotten to take one down. The question marks, you can't do anything, right? Exclamation points are the ones you can address. He's the same as the poster in the woods. Why does Chris Hackett have him? Is he connected to harem scare him in some way? The previous sheriff was killed in the fire six years ago, so presumably this blonde him. Travis must have succeeded him. Haley's dead, however happy they once were, that's all changed now. Caleb infected both his father and sister six years ago, sometime after this photo was taken, and now he's the only one left alive. Packets of supplies when the, their infected family members turn back at dawn after a full moon. Oh, there's just so much context here. That one's got an exclamation point, but it's a mystery. Have we only discovered this now? T. Hackett and T. Hackett, Chris and Travis, they're brothers. We worked that, we worked that one out. Nose referring to Max's car. Travis wanted to keep it off the books in case anyone came looking for them. Okay. Hackett's killed these animals with silver after they survived werewolf bites and became infected. No telling what this infection would do to non-humans. Seems the Hackett's didn't want to find out. That's a lot of evidence here. Chris Hackett killed the camp mascot on the night Laura and Max were kidnapped. Been hiding in the storm shelter, he devoured Ian in an attempt to satiate his appetite. It didn't work. He killed the camp mascot. Ian got eaten, yeah. Oh no. Because some people were saying that that might be like Christian as in like the end of his name, like Ian. This is an Ian at the very end of it, but no, that's a different guy. Oh, that's just the dog, I think. Oh. The fact that Chris Hackett is asking Camper's parents for donations means that these repairs may be more crucial than they first thought. Or Max was kidnapped by Travis and Chris. Uh. By kidnapped by Travis and Chris tried to hide it by not reporting that they didn't show for camp. And when he was on a time limit, Chris didn't want to risk the nurse being around when he turned into a werewolf. Yeah, and then camp letter. Maybe the camp is in worse shape than the fees can cover. <laughs> no shit there. I feel like this one's an exclamation point because we unlocked the revelation for some piece of evidence, but we didn't find the initial piece of evidence. Oh, whoopsie there. Where are we looking? Window view. The High Priestess. I'm surprised we're still finding cards. Liza was killed in the fire that broke out at her travel and show six years ago. The ghost roams the woods of Hackett's quarry ever since. She's been determined to get revenge on the Hackett family for what they did to her. The tarot cards, once lost in the blaze, have allowed her to guide you through the night. Though her motives may not have been as transparent as first thought.
That's the last card, yeah. Uno. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, is that everything upstairs? Is there another upstairs I need to go to? What are we looking for? It was so close to the end, too. There's the family. The hag is a bear. <laughs> Don't think that's quite it. Oh, is this a fine fellow? How long has this guy been here? I know about it. His regal oil painting of Septimus Hackett holds the pro holds pride of place on the lodge's chimney column. A long time ago. Long enough ago that it was okay to have an oil painting made of yourself. I kind of want an oil painting of me now. <laughs> Prepare for attack. Oh shit, are we are we done looking? There's a little more we can look around. Maybe I should keep looking. We shut the window, which was important. I didn't go over here. Scarum, scarum. Ticket stubs. Uh, stub. In behind, beneath, behind a photo frame, this ticket stub is an indication that Chris Hackett and his two kids attended the traveling show Harem Scarum six years ago. Huh. No, a absolutely not. We we have enough on our plates already. Stop discovering shit. Just trying to get the good like 100% completion, Dylan. I need these collectibles. It could be a bobblehead. Ripping, we hardly Poor knew you. Some camp mascot to kick it before. Oh, he was started. a sheep. No. <laughs> Hindsight. Sounds about right. We have a camp mascot? Well, no, we did. But you didn't hear? H hear what? He died before we got to camp. Uh, bummer. Poor Ian. Oh, I'm sad now. Look for all the Stanley figurines. That's what we're doing here. Uh, anything else up here? Or is this just the attic I've already been in? Might just be the attic again. Oh, but it's like a different side to the attic. Mirror. Uh, what's here? What's this? Trail cam footage. It's like they're looking for something. That seems like really important evidence. Yeah, uh, in Chris's surveillance room, he's storing all the footage. I think you might be right. Evidence collected. We got a grand total of seven out of 10. <laughs> Maybe we won't get arrested. That's a passing grade. That's an honor. Like, distinction. I remember Mr. H's cheesy ass announcements. Whoa. Careful with that. That's a camp relic. <laughs> Relax. It's dead anyway. Ah. Uh, RIP microphone. 
don't know if that's gonna help us at all, but good to know. Yeah, I think we prepare. Need a sofa there or something? Let's see. Jewelry. Guy jewelry thrown off in a scuffle. The inscription reveals uh, that it belongs to Bobby Hackett. Okay. What is it? A ring with a crest on it. Oh, very fancy. You can never pull it off. Sorry. A bit harsh, Dylan, but okay. All right. That's everything. Time to fight. I think we're ready. Yeah, that's like a like a lore and like context exposition dump. Right at the end. Okay, before we do this, one last break. One last quick break. I'm just going to use the loo again. I'll be right back. Two minutes. Lightning quick.
Hey, folks. Ah, oh, thanks for bearing with me as ever. Are you well? We're almost at the end now. I think this is going to be it. Oh, God. It's currently past midnight here. This has been a lengthy stream. <laughs> we will probably... The next stream after this, just to give a heads up, because I, I know my stream schedule is weird right now because I'm in the States. I'm trying to just do every other day as a stream schedule, and so the next one after this will be Sunday. Uh, on Sunday, we might be looking at the Mario Strikers game, because I believe that came out today, too. Probably be a bit of a shorter one, too, just because uh, we're doing a big boy marathon. Wait, you're in the States? I am. Uh, if you want to keep up to date on my travels and stuff like that, too, uh, you should probably follow my Twitter or something, honestly, or join the Discord server. There's, there's like, so much stuff I talk about in, like, other places that's just not YouTube. But people don't see it because it's not YouTube, honestly. Go give those a look. You can keep up to date on my travels there, if that's of interest to you. What state you in? I'm in Georgia. Hello. Been checking out Atlanta. Ew, why? <laughs> that's a bit harsh. Ah, oh, God. Okay, let's finish this. We're so, we're so near the end. Prepare for attack. This is gonna be a shit show in a few minutes. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Professional streamer. Ha ha. Thanks, guys. Hang on, let me just get my uh, chat back, alerts back. Okay, can you see it? We good? There we go. Every dusk and dawn all through the summer. What doesn't kill you'll make you stronger. stronger. We're here to lead the way. What? That mates for life, we're proud to proud say. To shout it straight and shout it loud. We're hacketeers. <laughs> Monster fighting sound. Two months and you never learn the words? Has Dylan got anything to, like, protect himself with? Could we now have tried to find, like, a weapon? Like a bat or something? Okay. It's the white wolf we're looking for. Remember. Showtime, motherfuckers. Here we go, Caitlin. He has one hand. Yeah, but like, something's better than nothing. Like, give him like a 2 by 4 or something. Something he can use. <laughs> oh, meanwhile. <laughs> Does anyone care about Jacob anyway? I just wish I could tell you I'm sorry. More than anything. Fuck. I just wanted one more night together. Is that too much to ask for? Yes, Shit. Jacob, it was very Stop silly to sabotage the car. Baby. I don't know what to do. Oh, you pathetic. <laughs> I hate him. I hate him. <laughs> I hate this kid. Everything's his fault. Put some damn pants on. What is going on out there? Should we go find the others? No! We're safer in here and it's nearly morning. What it's showtime. It's a bit dramatic, but alright. Caitlin, you wanna take the shot or something?
Oh. Wait, distance. Come on. Oh! oh, that wasn't much time. with the bullets of silver. I don't know if they are. What the fuck was that? It's Caitlin. Holy shit. Well, we gotta let her in. Well, we can't. The office door's locked from the outside. But there must be something we can well, do. Yeah, but what? Come on, Caitlin. That's a hell of a chair. Yes, it is. <laughs> What are we thinking? Silver shells. We gotta get them if to her. If we can time it right, we can give them to her. She passes. If she passes. Beam of the window. Beam of the window. Oh. Fuck. I'm so anxious that I'm just taking. I, I pause it out of habit at this point. Window ain't gonna help us hide. Beam. Come on. This is not what I had in mind. Oh, oh my god, oh my god, I'm coming, I got it. Come on. Run or hide? What are we thinking? Yeah, I don't think it's time to hide yet. We need to get right to the office somehow. Caitlin! This way! Yeah, we kind of need to grab Dylan, too. <laughs> Dylan's just here. We need the silver shell. We have to get that. Dylan, you're just gonna have to stay put a minute. It's silver! Hey, hey, I'm here! Come on, Dylan. Oh, oh my aim's not good. We got him. I'll go down. Fuck you. I got you, motherfucker. <laughs> he got something. All reliable. Give him a one, two. You got it? Yeah. Yeah, I got it. Is that a silver frying pan? Somehow I don't think so. I don't. Oh 
shit, now we're back to Laura. We have to finish the job. Ryan's here too. I think Caitlyn might be safe. I think this is it. Hey, what happened? So what exactly happened six years ago? There was a fire that wiped out dozens of people, and now there's Ryan. werewolves Shut and up. a ghost that roams the woods looking for her lost baby boy. Which I've just put together is Silas. Oh shit. It's a long story. No, it's not. We need him to tell it. There was a fire. Silas the wolf boy escaped, bit a bunch of your family. You failed to stop him. Burn. What happened in the past doesn't matter right now. I think it does. Uh, it kind of <laughs> does, actually. We relevant. need to know what we're up against, at least. What we're up against is a feral boy turned werewolf for the last six years has avoided being found. No matter what we did. Every full moon we were out there looking. Every single one. Now the son of a bitch is finally here. So what we're up against is my only chance to end this thing for good. So how do you even know where he is? How the hell are we gonna find him just driving down the middle of the road? Uh oh. oh. Is he just dead? Uh, gun in the wheel. Well, I mean, we're gonna crash with the car still moving. Travis! Travis, get it together, come on! <laughs> Wait, I got it, I got it, I got it, just get down! Where the fuck did Ryan go? Don't stop the car. Where did he go? He can't have just disappeared. He's gotta be nearby. Wait, where's Ryan? Let's look around. Are you crazy? There he is. Are we there yet? You're Ryan, okay. Please. Been better, but yeah. Ah, oh, he's so. God damn it, Ryan. Over here. Got some blood. Is this the the exact wolf that we needed? It's a lucky coincidence, Leave if so. There. What the hell happened back here? Whoa. This is where we went off the road two months ago. Oh no. You're trying to decide if you should shoot me in the head right now. Go ahead. If that's what you want, I won't stop you. What? I mean, I, I could do it. I don't think I want it though. Normally, I'd have werewolf's blood cover our scent, but I'm all out, so we're high That's risk. That's why. Yeah, we were right in that. We could be killed. You ready to end this? Be sure this isn't the end. We need some determination right now. Let's fucking do this. Go team! Ryan's just here.
Happy to be included. Yeah, he's here as emotional support. Don't know how helpful that is. Oh shit, if Chris is dead, that means Max is okay now, doesn't it? Max is alright on the island. God damn, this place has got some uncool vibes. Podcast didn't Only do just realized. You don't know the half of it. This is where I saw her. Her? We saw him. I, I know we saw him. I thought he was Max walking. hit her, but then I was out here and she was something else. Who? But now Chris is dead, so we don't have to worry about him being a wolf again. Yeah. Something over and over again. Oh my God, she was saying Silas. No, that's impossible. Who you're talking about? I saw her too. I only just realized that. Yeah, Max is in the clear. Eyes of Boris. Silas's mother. I think. That you played as him. I know I played as him, but I didn't realize that he's just completely safe. <laughs> oh, I thought he just untransformed a little while. Who was she? She ran a traveling sideshow called Harem Scarum. Came here six years back. She kept her son in a cage. Called him Silas the Wolf Boy. Died in a fire. Some say she never left. The hag of Hackett's quarry. It all comes back. We've been looking for Silas ever since. How did the fire start? Really? You're still hiding stuff now? You blew half the head off my niece, Kaylee Hackett. One of the kindest, gentlest souls to ever walk this earth. Uh, d dude. And all she wanted to do was help that little boy. Locked in a cage by that freak show witch. What did she do? She just wanted to help him. Travis. Was that how she got bit? She convinced Caleb to start a fire. It was just a distraction. It's May Bales. Give him enough time to get Silas out of his cage and give him his freedom. Well, that worked out happened? well, didn't it? No. Because within minutes, everybody was dead. Never see Hayburn, Liza, whole crew. Kaylee managed to get Silas to freedom. But Caleb got bit in the process. That's why you've been hunting him. We could just kill Caleb. I mean... <laughs> Oh my god. But, That's sure. why you've been hunting him. Silas, I mean. Every full moon for six fucking years. Some hunter you are. I think Caleb might be dead already, too, yeah. This, this is all that's left. Jesus Christ. Man. Any sign? Negative. Damn, I never saw any of this. I didn't even know this was here. Stick together, gang. God, Ryan, you piece of work. The fuck are you? Oh! Ryan? Didn't like that. Shit. I'm sorry, that was... Close. We must be close. Did you both see, see it too? I kinda wish I hadn't. Same. Well, we must be on the right track. What is it? Silas the dog boy. That must be it. Careful. I mean, it's nice we still have this guy with us, considering we saw him, like, brutally die earlier. But we're getting towards some semblance of a good ending. 
It's just a shame Nick couldn't be here to see it. Fucking Jesus Christ. My God. Is that Silas? What's wrong? What are you waiting for? Shoot, you stupid girl! He's in pain. Is that him, though? I don't know if I do. I don't have a cutscene for this. I just don't. Cause, just because he said, shoot, you stupid girl, I don't really like him. Is there any other way to, f to fix it? I don't know. I feel like... It <sighs> Does empathy help here? It seems too easy to just shoot him. It seems way too easy. Something's wrong. Yeah, that's the thing. Something's not right. My little white wolf. This one's not Silas, is it? I don't think so. This just looks like a regular wolf. Something feels very wrong. That's why I don't... No, it is Silas. Okay. I, I, something doesn't feel right. That's the thing. I'm worried I'm just going to get Laura killed, but I th I don't think I'm supposed to shoot. It doesn't seem right. Trust in my gut. I'm not gonna do it. Laura! Do it. He's just a boy! He's responsible for so much death. Says you! Do it! No! Give me the gun. Here we go! <laughs> I feel like I have to shoot someone here. Shoot Ryan! I, d I don't want to shoot anyone! Shoot them both! Oh no! That's uh, <laughs> that's a little unfortunate. <laughs> God, I really got that call wrong.
I can't believe how bad that got. <laughs> a genuine help me out chat. Can I even reload it? I don't know if I can. I don't know if I can reload it. That that got really out of hand quick. Oh, Jesus. It hasn't saved yet. Okay, so if I go back to the main menu, is am I okay? Cause that's thing, people are saying no I can't. You have to hard reset it. <laughs> Hang on, give me. <laughs> I don't know what to do. There's too much information right now. Well, you just got the crow ending. You can only reset in your second playthrough. <laughs> I, I, I'm kind, I mean, we're right at the end. I'm tempted to just play it out and see what happens. <laughs> If I beat the game and I unlock the rewind, can I go back to like that sequence and just play it out differently? Will I be able to go to that specific point? Uh, I mean, people don't know. <laughs> that went really wrong. Something didn't feel right, but I didn't expect there's everyone to fucking murder. You need to replay the whole final chapter. Is that true? Okay. Please try. No, I'm not doing anything unless like there's a bit of certainty. People are saying that like I have to redo the entire chapter. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know if anyone else has seen it. Pet the crow. I wish I could. He's a cute, he's a cute bird. It loads to a certain point. All that four will load the autosave. I I don't know if that's true. Do we just play it out from here? <laughs> If only there's some way we could have saved the kids. There's nothing we could do. You were clever, didn't you? I you knew my bitch. boy would be okay. <laughs> with me watching over him, I'll never forget what you tried to do. I did. I've been with you all night, you know. And You're the I'm worst. Not about to stop just because the nights come to an end. No. Whenever you hear a noise in the dark, 
whisper from the shadows, the breath on the back of your neck. That's gonna be me. I'll be there. Now, I'll never leave you. <laughs> Jesus Christ, she cursed I'll us anyway. I'll never leave you. After all of that, she cursed us anyway. <laughs> Unlock chapter 10. Oh, the fucking music! Come follow me into a place where the fear is gone and the worries fade away. Oh, this was fun. What an experience this has been. Max is cured of the werewolf curse when Ryan shot Chris Hack with a silver shell. He waits for Laura, unaware of her fate. Uninjured Bobby was able to fend off an attack from Chris, his brother, in werewolf form. Is it Bobby fending off werewolf Chris? Uh, Jed survived the attack at Hackett House. Chris was killed when his favorite counselor, Ryan, shot him with silver. Or shot Constance's face off in a struggle for the gun. This fucking music! Werewolf Nick was shot dead by Laura when she mistook him for Chris. Whoopsie! Chris Hackett's daughter Kaylee was shot and killed by Laura who mistook her for a werewolf Chris. Having successfully avoided infection, Jacob was freed from the Hackett's basement and survived the night. Abigail made the safety of Chris Hackett's surveillance room. Emma survived the night in the safety of Chris Hackett's surveillance room. Dylan survived the night by taking refuge from Caleb in the kitchen. Caitlin survived the night by killing Caleb, curing all those infected by his lineage. Oh, that was Caleb! Right! Caleb shot. Caitlin shot Caleb dead using the silver shells passed her by Emma and Abigail. After Laura hesitated to shoot Silas, the white wolf slaughtered Travis. When Laura failed to shoot Silas, Ryan was killed in an instant. Laura was killed when she failed to shoot Silas and ended the curse. You're in love with Summer me. Camp tragedy. Freak bear attack leaves several <laughs> dead. What do you make of that, Anton? I love that term, several. Like, the detectives are just, they, they don't even count the bodies. They're not like one, two, they're like one, two, three. Yeah, you know what? It's several. Several murders. This is the you podcast. Know, it might be a tactic, though. They can't give out that information yet. Sometimes detectives are notoriously difficult to solicit information from. I can't believe the bears got go so many saying, people. Hi, I'm a paranormal expert. I thought we'd done the whole Hackett's Quarry thing. Not this Hackett's Quarry thing. What was this, like three months ago? Old news, dude. Anton, introductions first. We are Bizarre Yet Bonafide, the podcast of the paranormal. I'm Grace. And Brian would have loved to and hear together, we explore the uh, this podcast episode if he was still alive. In real life, I can't believe the bears got him. And that's exactly what they are. Real life, everyday occurrences. With a shadow of spiritual, supernatural occurrences. I can't believe the bears killed so many people. <laughs> we shouldn't have okay, used the bear spray. So I hope you've got hat insurance, Anton, because I'm about to blow your mind. Did you just ask if I had hat insurance? Yes. It's responsible to insure those things which mean the most to you. A hat. Yes. Okay, I know where your priorities lie. Go on. Anyway, there actually is a real reason that we're coming back to Hackett's Quarry. There have been some developments, and I've sourced some information. Ten I hours skeptical, for a bear but I'm all ears. <laughs> Under my hat. I was hoping you'd say that. Oh God, why? Why are you smiling? Stop it, I hate it. Why? I had braces. I have to make use of them sometimes. You do have very pretty teeth. Thank you. That's something that a lot of podcast listeners might not know about me. 
<clears throat> so, it just so <laughs> happens I've got someone on the inside. So today's episode what? Uh, is going uh, to have uh, uh, a bit of a show and tell vibe to it. Who do you know on the inside? The inside of where? What? You know someone on the inside? Don't we all have someone on the inside? You know, an inner critic that mm. says, stop doing a podcast, no one's listening. You should listen to that voice, Grace. Okay, well, what I really meant is, <laughs> let's call it an anonymous donation. You know, we're not the only ones who flagged this as a bizarre situation. Someone actually reached out to us. They sent us a package. Did you, you didn't open it. Anyone who, I don't trust anyone who listens to this show. I couldn't wait to open it. Surprise! Anonymous donation. Okay, you've always promised we send the evidence to them. This podcast, the podcast. If you could see true evidence, you will consider all options, right? Why didn't this go to the police? Did not say that? I did say that. Yes. I mean, I know. Knowing you... for a fact that we would the never. The fuck see is the podcast going to do? That. Okay, well, we've been sent information, and we need to decide whether it's bizarre <laughs> or bona fide. <sighs> Okay, fine. Let's do this. For anyone listening at home, we are about to open a package from a mysterious person who listens to this show. If you are the one who sent us, whatever it is, congrats, you got us. Sorry, the tape is just really, really... There's just so much tape on the package. Sorry, I think it was Ryan who sent them the evidence. A key I could, like, slice at it with? No, I don't want you to dull my key. Just use your fingers. But just give me your fucking key, Anton. No. Give me your fucking key. After no. we finish up with the bears. Use your own key. Not like you lock your door. Of course I lock my door. What, what, is you, what are you secret? hiding? What am I hiding? Do you not lock your doors? No, I have nothing to hide. You think that ghosts are real, but you don't lock your doors? No, ghosts couldn't open my doors. They could walk through my walls, Anton. Okay, you need to be more concerned with murderers. So, remember those missing hikers? Yeah. What if I showed you leaked photos from one of their cameras? Photos that show them at Hackett's Quarry, supposedly where oh, the camera the was found. I would think that maybe they went there and they dropped their camera. Okay, Anton, let me ask you real quick. What makes you drop your camera? Uh, tripping over a root. Um, being well, at least jostled. all these dead kids uh, made for a great episode in, of BuzzFeed uneven, himself, you know, like that's uh, a silver line I'm sure we can take away over here. What about being murdered? If you dropped your phone, you wouldn't go missing. Where are they now? I don't know. People get lost in the woods all the time. There's like hundreds of people a year. They could be anywhere. That's not all. No? Mm -mm. I'm about to lay a little something else on you. My sources are also tell me that their backpacks were found at We got to go through all of this. Camp. Really? Then okay, well then shouldn't this be public knowledge? Why aren't the Hackett's prime suspects? Exactly my point. Maybe they would be if anyone knew where they were. Is it all just a big cover up operation? I'm going to see if I can rewind it in a yeah, moment. I'm going to see if I can go back and do it, redo that ending, okay? So, bear with we've me. Got to talk a little more about the Hackett family. Right. So these guys are like the heritage landowners, right? Mhm. Mm yep. Their great 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 grandparents were trappers who claimed the land way back when. They just claimed it? Yes, they did. They put their flag on it just like the man on the moon. The Hackett family flag, right? Well, apparently when they claimed it, they found quartzite. Quartzite? This okay. is a long gag for the podcast. Oh, my gosh. Fun fact, every building in the whole of New York is made of quartzite. That's not fun or a fact. Most of them are. But I digest. Digress? It was a pun. They dug the quarry and hit great heights of success before Septimus Hackett. This is a long sequence. Name, the seventh son of the trappers, the number seven, has great supernatural powers, uh -huh. closed the mine down. Okay, so <laughs> then they only had the land. They're to just live talking. On. Yes, you say only, but this land actually spans acres. That's a lot of forest, a lot of unexplored darkness Ooh, this is like an actual okay, podcast place to hide to have all these dark I... <sighs> secrets for this strain no that's me passing the game it's just the crow 
reclusive family. Mm -hmm. And this is I don't think I can skip it. I'm trying. Into paranormal territory. Okay, here acres we go. Acres and acres of haunting I can't woods. skip it. If you say so. Oh, I think Welcome we're all at the end. To Bizarre Yet Bonafide, the podcast of the paranormal. Welcome back to Bizarre Oh my god, they're still going. Anton, today I'm actually going to pass you some light rating. Okay, you're going to make me read this? Mm-hmm. All right, um, this is... What you're seeing now is a copy of a letter that Kaylee Hackett... It just won't fucking grandma, end. Allegedly. <sighs> All right, uh, this seems like more of a you job, but I suppose right, I can Right, but read I, I this. feel like if some of the evidence comes from your mouth, it will have more clout. Right, okay, here we go. Gammy, how long we gonna drag this shit out? Yeah, you know, I'm... <laughs> well said. Okay, you've unlocked the debt rewind feature. This feature allows you three opportunities between a single playthrough of the quarry to reverse a playable character's debt and try again to save him. Sure. Okay, chapter select. I'm gonna have to redo that entire last chapter, aren't I? There's no other way for me to save him, is there? I could just hit continue as well. Hey, wait, wait, wait. <laughs> These are two entry points. There's <laughs> not a lot of options. Is this the last one? Summer camp tragedy. Oh my Free fucking bear. god. Okay, just chapter ten. Chapter ten. I I'm gonna like blitz it. Can I skip a cutscene? I can't skip anything. Oh, what, the, what the fuck? Why am I on top of a fucking tree? Flora! What? Maybe do it on Sunday? I don't think I want to stream this game again. I think I'm done <laughs> after tonight. Like th this is a mess. This is all over the place. There's bits I liked, but oh my, like this is no until dawn. Absolutely not. Like, even the climax isn't that great, because, like, even in, the, in Until Dawn, they have a climax where, like, all the characters come together. And it's a really fucking tense final moment, because suddenly every character in the game is at risk that you've saved up until that point. Here it's just, they go into the woods and you shoot them. 
You gotta be kidding me. And then the fucking podcast. The fucking podcast. Okay. Gotta find Laura. Okay, let's head on back. I'm not making Max swim just because I'm gonna try to save all the kids, Barry Nick. It might affect the ending, and God, I don't want to go through all that again. I thought I'm so tempted just to kill this guy. It's me and they're back. Get our hat. She must have come back. Yeah, he's curious, so we could probably go for the swim. Uh, but I'm just worried, like, he's gonna be picked off or something, you know? I just don't think it's gonna end well for him. Try to do this again. <laughs> Fuck it. <laughs> I hope so, Max. Is he worth it? <laughs> sure. I don't have to fall out of the tree there again, do I? It, that, that, <laughs> he just instantly dies. Oh man, I really want to swim though. Okay, stay, stay, get through this. I gotta do the entire house sequence again too, don't I? <laughs> oh my god. I just want to get something that's not the damn podcast in it. Help me. Okay, table, and then we go shut that window. Okay. Well. Can't get much worse than it already is, right? Great. Just like the cartoons. It's been off and on all night. Gives us a little time. How do you figure? They don't like water, remember? Right, right. Let's do this uh, again. We should have just been swimming in the lake all night. I really wish I could like skip some of, of the sequences or have a fast no. forward or something. Especially consider I'm replaying this. We're good now. <laughs> Night's not over yet. These fuckers know we're in here, and they're coming back first chance they get. Great news. Okay. All right. We gotta get a vantage point. Come on. Okay, 
shut this window. Oh, it's like this. This game could have been a lot more, honestly. I do What's feel a bit disappointed. So it started to get a bit better for a while. Especially going back to the house with like Ryan and Laura. Like that, that shit was really cool. But it just took so long to get going and then it's over, you know? I feel like it could have been a lot more. Junkyard was cool too. Yeah, the Junkyard, they actually got the, the, the audio stuff working right too. The like royalty free music playing. Oh, uh, come the end too. Like, that has to be like a practical joke. A long time ago. For like the choice of that. Long Surely. enough ago that it was okay to have an oil painting made of yourself. I kind of want an oil painting of me now. <laughs> oh, I have to get the videotape, don't I? Hang on. That might Maybe affect I should it. keep looking. And it's because you did streamer mode. I did do streamer mode, but it shouldn't be that fucking awful. Streamer mode for the game shouldn't just be... Let's fucking kill the atmosphere. Like, no, you should, like, replace it with something appropriate. Like, that end credits song sounded like the Kevin McLeod, like, YouTube video like, music that you always hear. It's like, do, 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 do. You know the one I mean. Where it's like a little jingle. That's what it sounded like. Of everything you could fucking choose. Why that? What's this? Trail cam footage. It's like they're looking for something. Yeah, uh, in Chris's surveillance room. What's the actual song that plays? Footage. I think you might be If right. it's not on stream remote. Happy by Pharrell Williams. Shut up, it's not. It's not that. There's no way. Okay, just prepare for the attack. Nobody has played this yet. Yeah, true, it is release day. What do you mean you haven't spent like the last 10 hours playing along while I've been streaming? Every dust can down all through the summer. What doesn't kill you will make you stronger. stronger. We're here to lead the way. What? That meets for life, we're proud to say. say. Shout it straight and shout it loud. We're hacketeers. Two months and you never learn the words? <sighs> yeah, let's go. Come on. Let's do this again, from the top. Showtime, motherfuckers. Good to go. Oh, Jacob just sat down and cried a while, didn't he? He didn't really do much else. <laughs> Fuck this whole night. I wish I could tell the you. The actual sorry. song is Daydream Believer by the Monkeys. More than anything. Is it really? <laughs> I guess they just wanted to make it just like a bit funny or something. Together. Is that too much to ask for? <laughs> Shit. Stop 
crying, you big baby. And Jacob just has an emotional breakdown. I don't know what to do. There, there, Jacob. You little shit. What is going on out there? Should we go find the others? No, we're safer in here and it's near Yeah, we just gotta minute. sit tight until we have the house sequence and then we go into the woods again. There we go. Okay, here we go. This is it. What the? It's coming in. Okay, we just, I, I, we did this before, it was fine. I gotta wait to take the shot. Remember the order, it worked before. Wait to take the shot. I'm get a bit close. Come on, Caitlin. Now we run. Okay, let's go. Okay, put the share of incredible strength there. Like he is fine. There must be something we can well, do. Yeah, but what? <laughs> yeah, we go into the beam. Silver shells. If we can time it right, we can give them to her. She passes. If she passes. This way. Come on. Come on. Gotta mash A a lot here. Come on, Caitlin. Doing great. All good. <laughs> Maybe you can save Caleb. I don't think so. You're supposed to take the sa the silver shell. Yeah. Caleb, this way. I think he's gone. Dylan, you go off or have a walk. He's just working away. Investigate. It's silver! Hey, I'm here! Yeah, he's off to get the silver frying pan. He knows what's up. Caitlin, no! Oh, she 
No. No, she's got. No, I still have some rewinds. Yep, that's me. You're probably wondering how I got into this situation. Well, let me tell you about a crazy story that started at the start of summer. Use a life. Hey, I'm here! Don't miss. I th don't think I missed. I left that very late. Okay, we got him that time. Like, I shot sooner there. Fuck you. I got you, motherfucker. And nothing bad happened. Okay, the question is, do I kill the cop as it? well as Silas? Yeah. Because I'm going to have yeah, that option. I might be able to get a twofer. I think we just kill Silas, yeah. Go for a drive again. And the hag, the hag is so really exactly not your friend. So like, don't, ago. don't have pity. Like, it just. There was a fire that <laughs> wiped dies. out dozens of people, and now there's werewolves and a ghost that roams the woods looking for her lost baby boy. Which I've just put together is Silas. Oh shit! It's a long story. No, it's not. There was a fire. Silas the wolf boy escaped, bit a bunch of your family. You failed to stop him. Burn. What happened in the past doesn't matter right now. Uh, it kind of does. You yeah, have to actually. let Travis grab the gun in the quick time after refusing to shoot Silas the first against, time. The feral boy turned werewolf for the last six years has avoided being found. Oh, can I get him to no shoot what him? We did. Every full moon we were out there looking. Every single one. Now the son of a bitch is finally here. So what we're up against is my only chance to end this thing for good. I don't want to take chances at this point. Yeah, I just I'm just gonna shoot well, him. How do you even know where he is? How the hell are we gonna find him? Just driving down <laughs> just the middle. Just shooting of him. Hey, Silas, how you doing, bud? <laughs> Can I shoot Ryan? Is there still that option? Travis! Travis, get it together, come on! Oh, I forgot to press A. Out regardless. Go! Where did he go? He kind of just disappeared. He's got to be nearby. He got swiped out a little bit, Let's but he's okay. Are you crazy?
Are we there yet? Top of the gold, Ryan. It's not the time. You're okay. We have to endure we're a very lengthy there. podcast to get to this point. Yeah. Over here. Got some blood. Leads through there. What the hell happened back here? Whoa. Ryan, you need to die so you can't hear the podcast. This is where we went off the road two months ago. Like we'll spare him. You're trying to decide if you should shoot me in the head right now. Go ahead. That's what you want, I won't stop you. What? Do it, Laura. Take the shot. Normally, I'd have werewolf's blood cover our scent, but I'm all out, so we're high risk. We could be killed. You ready to end this? Let's go. Let's fucking do this. Go team. Thanks, Ryan. Ryan, why don't you just like wait in the car or something? I don't know. <laughs> you know. Don't need to be here. Ah, oh, God. God damn, this place has got some uncool vibes. Podcast didn't do it justice. You don't know the half of it. This is where I saw her. Her? I thought she was... I thought Max hit her, but then I was out here and she was something else. Who? The old woman, she was saying something over and over again. Oh my god, she was saying Silas. No, that's impossible. Who are you talking about? I saw her too. If the not shoot Silas the first time fail, the quick time event when Travis goes for the gun that shoots Silas the last time. He, so I'm just gonna there. shoot him. <laughs> I think. I don't wanna miss after what happened. Who was she? She ran a traveling sideshow called Harem Scarum. Came here six years back. She kept her son in a cage. Called him Silas the Wolf Boy. Died in a fire. Some say she never left. It just didn't feel right because it was so easy. I, I thought it would be more of a sequence. Court. That was the problem. That's why I didn't do it. We've been looking for Silas ever since. I didn't expect the game to just line up. It's like, well, there he is. How you gonna end the game? Because I thought there would be something more, but there's not. Really? You're still hiding stuff now? You blew half the head off my niece, Kaylee Hackett. One of the kindest, gentlest souls to ever walk this earth. And all she wanted to do was help that little boy. But I thought there would be more, which is why I didn't shoot. Hooked in a cage by that freak show witch. What did she do? She just wanted to help him. Travis. She convinced Caleb to start a fire. It was just a distraction. Like, it's maybe. It's a like comparison, right? Yeah, this is probably a good one. Until Don literally ends with like the lodge history. fucking exploding. That's not what happened. In no. like an inferno of fire. Because within minutes, everybody was dead. This, you got a gun, and it's just like, take the shot. Liza, whole crew. Like, I just thought, I just Caleb thought there'd be a bit more. Silas to freedom. But Caleb got bit in the process. And it's like a sequence of like five quick time events as well. Like, it's really fucking hard. Every full moon for six fucking years. The beat until dawn. Some hunter you are. Shoot him. 
That's it. This is all that's left. Jesus Christ. Man. Any sign? Negative. Damn, I never saw any of this. I didn't even know this was here. Oh, we get the jump scare. Hang on, brace yourselves again. Hey, how's my favorite close. character Nick doing? Did you both see it too? Kind of wish I hadn't. Same. <laughs> Nick, yeah, like Nick, we we kind of fucked up. I was, I was looking at chat. Uh, that's why Nick's dead. <laughs> this is that's the only reason he died. <laughs> Didn't oopsie there. What is it? Silas, the dog boy. I looked away for like two minutes and Laura just took that chance to fucking kill him. Careful. Maybe the devs worried a big werewolf fight at the cabin would be similar to Until Dawn. I mean, maybe. Maybe it's like oh, Silas Jesus chases Christ. you through the woods or something. That'd be fun. Like, really climactic sequence. So, like, you don't just hit, run over Silas with your car. He's on top of the car, you crash the car, and he's chasing you. And he knocks the gun out of your hand. And you have to, like, stumble about a bit. What That'd be great. For? Shoot, you stupid girl! I don't even want to, like... Get the ending because of that. Are you sure about this? Shoot. I have to. Doesn't feel like a good end. Please, let's just let's just go before we we have to see him like that in human. It's time. awful. It's too late for that. It doesn't seem right. But that's the end. Oh, how's the hack doing? I bet you think you have it all figured out. I bet you think you're fucking clever. I tried to help you. I tried to warn you. I even started to like you. Not now. Not after this. I will not forget what you made them do to my Silas. I've been with you all night, and I'm not about to stop now just because the night's come to an end. No. Whenever Maybe the ending improves so you've saved everyone in the dark. A whisper from the I'd hope so, because it, it's kind of shit right the back now. of your neck that's gonna be me. I'll be there. It's not great. Now I will never leave you. I really have higher expectations for the game. I had higher hopes. So oh, he's the fucking. <laughs> Brand new day. Yeah!
Well, Vax is good. Poppy's good. Die is good. Chris not looking too good. I think we had to kill Chris. There was no way to get like a better end in there. Chris had to go. Did Constance have to die? I feel like she did. Nick had to go. <laughs> Kaylee, I think, will script it. There's Jacob. Abigail's safe. Alvin's okay. We made a TikTok after. Like, Jacob's story just ends. Yeah. He just sat down in the woods and cried. You should have like made it back to the lodge or something. Have a bigger part in it. I just didn't know what to do with Jacob. Yeah. Travis survived the encounter with Silas and finally saw an end to the curse that had haunted his family for six years. Brian was cured of the werewolf infection when he shot Chris and managed to survive the showdown with the white wolf. Laura killed Silas with silver shell, curing every infected person who survived the night. Silas dead. Laura killed Silas the dog boy in his nest. The curse of Hackett's quarry is broken. Is there another scene? The police made it. Is the evidence going to change? Psycho summer camp teens turn on one another. Okay, give it, give it a minute. What do you make of that, Anton? Ooh, sounds kind of hot. Um, what the fuck? Oh, damn, like killing each other? Right, what else would it... Uh, it's different. It is different. I thought we'd done the whole Hackett's Quarry thing. Not this Hackett's Quarry thing. What was this, like three months ago? Old news, dude. Anton, introductions first. We are Bizarre Yet Bonafide, the podcast of the paranormal. Yeah, I'm Grace. Going? And I'm Anton. And together, we explore the possibility of supernatural There's no bears this time. in real life, everyday occurrences. And that's exactly what they are. Real life, everyday occurrences. Oh, they got char we got charged. Spiritual, supernatural occurrences. No. <sighs> okay, so I hope you've got hat insurance, Anton. You gotta rest it without the bears. To blow your mind. Did you just ask if I had hat insurance? Yes. It's responsible to insure those things which mean the most to you. A hat. Yes. Okay, I know where your priorities lie. Go on. Anyway, there actually is a real reason that we're coming back to Hackett's Quarry. There have been some. How is this a worse ending than what we got? And I've sourced some information. I remain skeptical, Everyone got arrested. but I'm all ears. Under my hat. The bears was at least kind of funny. That. Oh god, why? Why are you smiling? Stop it, I hate it. Why? I had braces. I have to make use of them sometimes. You do have very pretty teeth. Thank I you. I don't want to sit through all this again. <laughs> I'm done. Oh, that was such a letdown. That was such a letdown in comparison to Until Dawn. I don't want to have to sit through like half an hour of that goddamn podcast. And why would they do it that way? They could have even copy-pasted that end system from Until Dawn where it's like, you talk to the characters that survived. And that was kind of fun, because like, you hear bits about it and there'd be an interview. I don't care about the podcast. Need more evidence. I mean, maybe it's better if you have more evidence, but it shouldn't be absolute, like, 
It shouldn't be kind, like, that bad. With, like, three pieces of missing evidence, you know? It should be kind of okay. Like, it's just unsatisfying. You're not gonna find everything the first time you play through, and I'll be honest, getting that ended, I don't think I'm gonna play this again. I don't want to go back in and get all the other endings like I do when I finish Until Dawn. I'm just done. <laughs> Yeah, that was re that was a real let down. Oh my god, I I'm I'm got it. Until Dawn is like one of the best horror games just ever made, in my opinion. It's so good. It is just an experience. I wish I could just go back and play it again blind. That's no Until Dawn. Like there, there's so many problems. The technical problems is inexcusable. Like it, you gotta fix that. The ca so many of the characters were just really annoying. And I get that the kids. And Until Dawn had that too, where it's like, Oh, what's going on with Emma and Mike? But oh my god, they just wouldn't shut up about it. They just wouldn't stop. Like, we're making dick jokes for like the first four hours of the game. It, it, it felt like that's missing a bit at the end, too. Jacob's plot, like, why did that just end? He should have made it back to the lodge or something and actually have a meaningful impact in the end. We could have just left Jacob in the cell to rot and it wouldn't make any difference on the ending we got. Honestly. I don't understand why the, the climax isn't more of, like, a climax. You just shoot Silas and the game ends. Like that's... That's just not how you end it. It's not. The house was way more exciting when we were there. A fucking moment where, like, they dropped through the ceiling, Laura transformed it, and it's like, oh shit, what do I do? That was great. That was the climax. It's a shame that was two chapters ago. Yeah, no, I'm really disappointed. They got some of the mystery right, like the intrigue was cool with werewolves. You know, of course you gotta do some kind of fantastical, supernatural, cute creature to follow off from Wendigos. I, I get that. Oh, the credits have stopped. Thank you to everyone who subbed, thank you to everyone who gave bits. Thank you to the mods for being on hand as ever. I'm just venting them all before we wrap up. Like, final thoughts on the game and that. If he hadn't killed Nick, Jacob would probably have gotten killed instead. Okay. Oh, would there have been more of a sequence if Nick was still alive, like chasing Jacob or something? That might have been more interesting, yeah. Maybe that's what was supposed to happen. You have to sabotage the fuel line in order to get all the evidence. Really? That's kind of bad. I looked it up on YouTube. It always ends in the podcast. I... Oh. Like, the podcast would have been cute if they just got to the point. I think. Because I just want to see how my choices mattered. The evidence doesn't feel like it mattered at all. It's just like in a long rambling tangent in the podcast. Like, I'm, I'm just bored. Do the police interviews. Like, I know you did that until dawn, but it worked. Like, it's better because, like, you actually get to see, like, the tangible aftermath of each of the characters. And it has so much more impact then because you'd be, like, going through the interviews like, holy shit, that character's dead. Rather than like a where are they now, like sentence. Nick's dead. <laughs> the 
podcast interview and Ryan or something would have been cool. Yeah, that's all I needed to do. That's the thing. Podcast joined by Emma and Ryan talking about what happened. That would have been so much better. Emma being the influencer that she is, and Ryan just as a fan of the show. And then it gets like really heated or something. They may do it towards the end, but it takes way too long to get there. Yeah, that's the thing. Like, I've, I'm bored. Just lost interest. We put up with the podcast for like 10 minutes. It was lame. Ah, oh, it could have been so much more. It could have been so much more. I'm really sad. I, because I know the Dark Pictures anthology has been bumpy. Bar the latest one. Apparently, the latest one of that is good. The first two, real rocky games. And with this as well, I, I don't know if they're ever going to replicate it until dawn. I think until dawn might have been a once-off, but they just knocked it out of the park. I really think they, like, that might have just been, they got it right. And they may not be able to do that again. Because that's like three kind of mixed games. Since then. And one that's apparently good. One, apparently the third episode of Dark Pictures is apparently quite good. I've heard good things about that one. Oh, God. Okay, we have to wrap it there. It's half one in the morning. Long stream. Long stream. But thank you so much for coming, folks. I hope people still enjoyed the stream. We, we got to experience this together. If you've been here the entire time, I hope you've enjoyed it. There's no one I know streaming. <laughs> it's so late at night. There's actually no one. I'm checking. Uh, so, the best we're gonna do is, uh, we're gonna raid Bob Ross. <laughs> oh, they've disabled, right. Well, well, thanks for coming. <laughs> okay. You can't raid Bob Ross. Yogscast, Yogscast is just showing cinema. They're not actually live. They're, 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 their channel's like 24-7, but they just air the previous stream. They're not actually there. <laughs> Alright, well, thanks for coming, folks. Uh, see you all Sunday. We'll play some Mario. Have a good one. <laughs>